jewelry makers oh it's gonna be a super saturday and it does feel like an absolute age since i've been with this beautiful gentleman three and a half that weeks. Is, has it been three, three and, and a half weeks, weeks. it's mark everyone it? yeah we spent the last hour talking about taylor swift we did <laughs> Which we happened did. on my last show, we spoke about Taylor Swift as How well. How she's taken on the world. Phenomenon. I know she yeah. is, yeah. yeah absolutely. Yeah, because I, I went, I was telling Mark, mm. I went down to see my mum on Thurs Thursday. Thursday. Because um, yeah. it was her birthday. Um, hindsight, I should have probably gone either the day before or the day mm. after yeah. because Taylor Swift was on in Cardiff and the traffic. Horrendous. The traffic, yeah, yeah. she has completely taken over, hasn't she? Yeah, she's just suddenly appeared, hasn't she, out of nowhere. I mean, she's it's always incredible. been fairly big. She yeah. was country first, wasn't That's she? That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big country singer. Yeah. I'd heard of her, but I, you know, I knew a couple of songs, but yeah, it's just completely amazing. And my, I, sat, my, I sat down for a couple of hours and watched a concert the other evening, and it was amazing. Yeah, she, to really, be fair, she's she a good is a, role model, she is, isn't she? Absolutely, yeah, very family friendly, and yeah, that was lovely. So good yeah, luck no, to nothing, her. nothing um, risque. No, 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 definitely no. not Madonna. Shall we definitely just say, not Madonna. Just definitely say definitely that? not. Yeah. Or Sam Smith. Yeah, but it's massive that? at the moment. So we've got Girls Aloud touring. Yeah. We've got Pink doing her big yeah. stadium tours. My we've got Taylor Swift. We've got Glastonbury in a couple of weeks. Yeah. We've got the Olympics coming up. Yeah. We've got the Euros. Well, I won't talk about the Euros at the moment. So. Oh well, yeah, yeah, we're not doing great in the Euros. Oh, something. That's because Jack Graylish hasn't been chosen. Well, I'm sorry. I but, mean, we had yeah. some messages in about this, Mark. Oh really? And people were saying he hasn't been playing great. No, apparently not. So, but he's not on squad at all, is he? But this he? is the third year, sorry to bore people who aren't into football, I mean, me talking about football, can you believe it? <laughs> this is the third Euros tournament where we've won the opening match and then drew the second. We just, we just give in, yeah. Just Poland are out, sorry. Poland are out. Poland are out? Yeah. Oh, no. First team dropped. Like, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. But so, I think it's Tuesday with our next match. Who which we, we have to. I don't know. Ross will know. Ross, who are we playing on Tuesday? Slovenia. Slovenia. Should we win that? We have to win or we're out. Yeah. We yeah. should definitely win. Yeah. You think, yeah. you think they're... De yeah. That's very confident. He says they're yeah. definitely... Oh, they through. are through, are they? Oh, oh they okay. are through. Right, okay. But we're not doing great, though. No. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Um, yeah, Olympics, yeah, that's on the horizon yeah. as well. Gosh, it's mad, isn't I it? like the Olympics. And then we've got two elections going on as well. It's just... Oh, gosh, yeah. It's mad, isn't it? I know. Never mind. It's... <laughs> we had... Um, I... Sorry I wasn't here yeah. yesterday. I know you were in the very capable hands of lovely Lindsay. Which is what started off the Taylor Swift conversation, because I thought, I thought uh, that you'd bought tickets for Willow and you were off to London last night, but um, no. I would not spend that money. Right. As much as Willow would love to go see Taylor Swift, I have said to her, I was like, Willow, I am not spending £800 no, no. on a ticket to go and see Taylor Swift. And getting there and getting yeah, out exactly. and getting back. I was like, you might yeah. love her, but I am not spending that, <laughs> might, like, not spending that money. Um, no, I went to Willow Sports Day yesterday. Oh. And do you know, since she's turning eight in, ju in July, and this is the first sports day I've been to. You've been able to go to. Yeah, because I've always been working. So, yeah. uh, and I was like, I'm going to make sure I go. So I booked time off. And it was lovely. I made a day, you, you and Tom being there, I think. Yeah, it lovely. was so lovely. I really enjoyed it. You know, like Willow said to me about her little boyfriend. Let's tell him about this. Um, who's very cute. She was like, make sure you watch him, mummy, because he's very impressive. <laughs> <laughs> Which lovely. I thought, doesn't every boy stroke man want to be described as impressive? <laughs> At the age of eight, he succeeded. Oh, very impressive. Amazing. Yeah, amazing. it was really nice. Good. So, But I'm Good. back, I'm back, I'm back, and we've got amazing. an absolutely amazing Saturday. You and me on a Saturday. Again, that's good. Third time oh, this yeah. year. Third, third Saturday this year we've worked together. Which that is that, really that nice. three weeks does seem like a long three weeks, Mark. It's been, yeah, it's been Ages since we've case. been together. Like ships yeah, passing yeah. in the night. Yeah, yeah. Um, shall I tell you what you got coming up? Because, like I said, it's a Saturday show not to miss today. Mm -hmm. Your early bird is the oh. most beautiful silver bead cap. Now, a bead cap plus so much more, to be honest. I love bead caps. I'm a big advocate of bead caps. This yeah. year's been amazing. I mean, the, you get They're three gorgeous. different sizes as well. They're lovely, aren't they? A bit like a tassel, yeah. a bit like a collet, tassel, yes. yes. A bit like yeah. a tassel top as well. Yeah, yeah. Yep. So, if I, do, yeah, look at those. Can you see? They're very intricate and they're almost not a full B cap. Does that make sense? Oh, they're hinged. Yes. Oh, so they're. Oh, I've not seen this More style like before. More like a collot shape. 
Yeah, so you pop the bead in and you close it around. Close the it dance. around. Oh, that's cute. But it's not fully circular. No. So you could, I guess, you know, if you've got maybe um, an irregular shaped gemstone, then uh, these would fit nicely around yeah. there. You could customise them. Plus, you get all three sizes as well. So that's your early bird, and there's 200. Oh, brilliant. So that might seem like loads, but Saturday morning, mm, not so much. I think that is a quantity that could sell mm, out easily. Yes, so make sure yeah. you shop ahead on those, coming your way at an early bird price. Then at 9 o'clock, Mark, just wow. Wow, wow, mm. wow. Mark, I, I love selenite. I love your work on wall. That's so beautiful. And the instruction booklet today, after being pestered to oh. have to, to get one produced, I've actually gone and done it. So we have got, from start to finish, how to do the kiss cross, how to do the netting, how to incorporate gemstones, how to join the two ends together, which is probably one of the most requested <laughs> things I've been asked yeah. for this year. If you buy the um, Harlequin kit at nine o'clock, you get 24 stage instruction booklet how to make from start to finish. Oh, there's the little video. Right? Here's the lovely video oh, yeah. in your garden as well. That's so, oh, wow, yeah. Marks. So seven strands. Seven strands. Yeah. I agree, Ross it's has just said it's stunning. the nicest selenite we've ever yeah. had. So we've got it in the brights, which you can see on the on the, the tea bar there. There we go. Yeah. And then we've got a few left of the, the pastels. Yeah. So if you want to, and they're really nice, the they're really nice working together as well. I mean, we, we had Ascot. Yeah. Re this week we as did, well, didn't yes. we? Claire Mark went yesterday, I think. Oh, did she? I think I oh, saw yeah, she a, looked I think beautiful. On her post, yeah. And My... Can I um? Am I allowed to do this? Go on. Um, I'm not. Who's in charge of the lights? That'll be Ross. That'll be Ross, will it? Yeah. So I bought recently. I bought a couple of strands of Upalite. Yeah. Okay. So I went onto the River website and I bought myself a UV torch. Yes. Okay. And I, I'm pointing this at everything at home at the moment. Are it's you? ingenious. <laughs> if we can turn the lights off and look at this, <laughs> I had no idea. Are no you ready? problem. Okay. 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 You okay. do that. You put the light there. Yeah. Okay. Ready? Look at this. I had no idea. Selenite did this. Oh my goodness me, look at that. Look at these. Look, look at that glow. Isn't that amazing? It's apt. I didn't, I didn't realise selenite glowed when you hit it with the oh, UV light. We didn't think it could be any more magical no. than it is. That's beautiful. That's stunning. Amazing. Yeah. Especially the, the pinks. pinks. Yeah. Pinks are amazing. Yeah. yeah. So I didn't I didn't know it had that property. So yeah, so that's a little a little extra as well. Yeah. Wow. So that's at nine no, o'clock, jewelry makers. Yeah. Let me just double check for so we have Oh I don't know numbers. Eighty six. Oh. Okay. Fifty of the pastel one. It's not a huge amount. It's not a huge amount, no, not for a Saturday morning, no, but no. so get in early with those. Yeah. And I'm looking at the price tag, it's amazing for the volume that you yeah, get. Yeah. Um, so that's at nine o'clock jewelry makers. Also within that hour, I should give you a heads up, we've got some of the very last, um, i.e. 55, of the vivid green angel light. It's stunning. Um, it's isn't stunning. It? Yeah. Absolutely stunning. What what? It's a brand new parcel. I oh. beg your pardon. So we have, but they're still limited. Wayne is still not here, is he? He's still on his barge. Ross has basically taken it. It's never oh. been on air. Amazing, absolutely amazing. Brand new, but there's only 50 of your vivid green and it's totally and utterly natural. I love it. I absolutely, oh. oh my goodness me. <gasps> I was about to say yes. that. Can I just say move over Imperial Green Jadeite? I thought it was an Amazonite when I saw it this morning. Yeah. Wow. It has got Amazonite vibes. Yeah. Um, I, yeah. I looked at it and to be honest, it was one of those like, is it, is it Jade? Mm. Is it a Nephrite maybe? Yeah. Wow. So that's, that is brand that's new beautiful. Vivid Green Angel Light in your 8 mil round. The only one that we have in the business. The only one. Roscoe found it. And and, wow. and and yoiked it for your Saturday show. Should he have? Probably not, but never mind. Hey ho, Wayne's on a barge. Wow. 
That's become a catchphrase, isn't it? Wayne's on a barge. <laughs> oh, is he having his lads week? He's having his lads week on a barge. Oh, right. You know, the canals right. of, of the UK used to be Beware. quiet and peaceful. Yeah. Now, no, you've got <laughs> Wayne and, and co. Um, yeah. So there we go. That's your nine o'clock. Ten o'clock jewellery makers. We're welcoming the wonderful Dave into the studio for a brand new opportunity of your wow. stunning quartzite jade this is the purest white color i've seen again totally natural we have it in a bangle have we had it in a bangle before i don't, I think, don't think we so. have no. i think we've had strands but and carvings but i don't think we've ever actually mm. had quartzite jade in a in a in a bangle so <clears throat> at 10 sorry 11 o'clock then you've got your collector's choice uh, lots of collectors deals last of stock opportunities as well and then at 12 o'clock mark again wow because we've we've yeah. done the kind of nod towards alhambra but this is different this is really it's different. a different technique isn't it yeah yeah completely different can you see how marks oh. the little the little four leaf clovers yeah. can you see how they differ jewelry makers i don't know I'll show, you you this I'll show you this bracelet first of all so this is what i'm going to be demonstrating on the show yeah so this is this is a brand new take on the alhambra with the pointy edges with the pointy corners oh i love that okay so this is what i'm going to show in the demo and then the black necklace at the back is what your tutorial is going to be in and it's a 36 stepper so if you can see yeah. at the top there jewelry makers you've got the sort of uh, um alhambra separations yeah. haven't you yeah and then you've got that lovely tassel mm. and that's the, black um, jadeite too it is yeah and the whole um the whole project hour on that is all about really the stars of the show are these double yeah they're amazing these little aren't they? stopper beads so we're going to show you so in the instruction booklet we show you how to get your cords and your wires and your and your, you get you get sterling silver chain by the meter in these projects as well wow it's just incredible so you can use that through them as well absolutely yeah yeah we'll Unbelievable. To yeah, i told you it was going to be a cracking yeah. saturday and can we just give a massive shout out to Eva's first show on cameras yes, today? Yes, Eva. You'll be all yeah, right. Yeah. We'll look after you. Yes. We'll look after you. You're in capable hands. <laughs> um, you've got <laughs> you've got lovely Adam at the helm. Yeah. He'll sort you out. Won't yeah. you, Adam? Yeah. You'll look after Eva. Yes. Yes, of course. Um, but I'm back, Ross. I'm back. I'm back. Also, what? Oh! Hang on. Now, I thought when I read this on Thursday that this was only on the website. And me. But it isn't. It's on everything. Web and TV. Free postage and packaging with JM Free Post. Brilliant. Take advantage of that. Should we get yeah, cracking, jewelry yeah. makers? Get your messages in. Come and say hello to us. We'd love to hear from you. Ooh, hello. Don't forget your early birds as well. Do shop ahead on those. Shall we start <laughs> with... Um, a very pretty strand, a pink tourmaline rondelle strand. Oh, oh, it's just registered. It's just dawned on me. Yeah. <clears throat> I have a few days off, honestly, and it all goes out the windows and <laughs> can't remember anything. Um, it's just registered. It's the first auction, isn't it? Ross is in the hot seat, isn't he? Um, we want to see who's watching oh. first thing in the morning. 35 of you on the web, 41 of you on the web, 56 of you on the web, and climbing. Du, 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 du. Pans. It's a pants. Pet, 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 pet. 73 of you. Yeah, Ava, have you ever experienced the whole pound thing? Pants. No, yeah, she's looking at me blank, blankly. I don't wow. think so. I don't think so. Well done. Well done. Well done. Um, pears. What? Heart pears. <laughs> no. This one. What? Oh. Sorry, Roscoe. I was looking at that blankly then, that tea bar. <laughs> it's as I could tell. What? Mm, sorry, you had professional Lindsay yesterday, didn't you? Who looked, can I say, she looked stunning. She is gorgeous, Lindsay. Absolutely beautiful yesterday. Can I just say about Lindsay? Yeah. She's, yeah, exactly what I, yeah. you just stole the yeah. words from my mouth. She literally is gorgeous inside oh, yeah. and out. Yeah, amazing. Yeah. She, yeah, she is, she is one of life's yeah. gems, yeah. is a Lindsay. Just a lovely person. As are you. Oh, bless you. As are Thank you. you. Yeah. Thank you, Mark. I thought I was going to cry this morning when I saw you. 
Ah. Yeah, I have missed you. I've missed you too. Yeah. I've missed I'm you too. I'm a bit off kilter at the moment with everything going on in the world and I'm not very well and it's just You're a elder. bit pants at the moment. And yeah. It's just, so it's really nice to come here and just get away from everything for five hours. You it's can lovely. forget about yeah. it all, can't you? Yeah. 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 You can. Disconnect. What? Mongolian fluorite in faceted rondelles. These. No. These. I wouldn't call them rondelles, though, personally. I'd call them faceted rounds, Mongolia. but it's all good. Are they rounds? They definitely look like rounds if I've got the right strand. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, like to keep me on word. the toes. They're roundels, apparently. Roundels, right, okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So you're going down from 30 quid? Natural. To a pound. Oh. Spend. Spend. The why, phone why, lines why, why? have gone crazy. Look at that beautiful colour. Oh, Debs did a de demonstration the other day about wisteria. I was thinking of you. Oh, yeah. Have you got wisteria? No, 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 no. No, I'm not, I haven't got the patience for a wisteria. But do they take a lot of work? 15 years before they flower. Do they? Yeah. I mean, can't, we can't be doing with all that. No. I, I drove past a house um mm. the other day oh no i think i was part of traffic lights you know when you look at i love looking oh, at houses yeah. Yeah. and they clearly had the front of their house all painted right and then this perfectly manicured wisteria oh. literally just kind of does that yeah um just beautiful i was they like how incredible. do they paint around that yeah, yeah. they no, must they have almost lifted it away ever so slightly yeah. but so beautiful aren't they the reason yeah. why i'm saying it, it's perfect yeah. wisteria yeah. colors aren't they sold out yeah. well done yeah. well done well done busy today Next item's on its way. Lauren's on the ball. Hi, Lauren. Hello. So Lauren's been poorly this week. Have you been poorly, yeah, Lauren? She's, she's had the flu. Oh, oh bless your heart. Yeah. You all right now? Yeah. She's all right now. We'll use the oh. recording on these, shall we? Natural pink kunzite. <gasps> natural wow. blue amazonite. What on earth is that, Ross? That should be the price. In fact, no. Sorry, sorry. As that is mad the kunzite shouldn't be anywhere near 10 pounds or the amazonite for that no. matter that's one of the craziest deals ever 60 seconds to close this how many do you have then roscoe 12 yeah well if they don't sell out i would be utterly amazed wow. because that is one of the best deals i yeah. think i've ever seen yeah. Of the year, I agree. I agree. It's just a shame that we've only got twelve of them this morning. Um, were they a big launch? Were they like a deal of the day or something? There was a hundred and fifty. Can't believe we took it anywhere near a tenner for kunzite for Amazonite. Kunzite is not an inexpensive gemstone. It's very expensive in actual fact. And Amazonite, well, you know how we feel about Amazonite. Sold out. Well done. Well done. Well done. Um, beat the clock. Well done. Wow. Morse code, Stardust, Spacer Beads in Sterling Silver. So beautiful. So beautiful. Um, so you can literally go on Google. Google what um, the, the alphabet, if you like, in your Morse code, and you can mm. put together your secret messages. Secret messages, you can do things like uh, coordinates as well. Um, my husband likes his tattoos, and he's actually saying L. I really want to have the coordinates of where we met tattooed. I was Aww. like, that's very romantic. Where was that? It was in Barnt Green. Which is? Which is not far from here. Oh, okay. And very low. It's where Paula Bennett lives. Oh, okay. It's right. lovely. It's very right. beautiful. Okay. We met at a nice country pub. Ah. Yeah. So Offered. it wasn't in the Eiffel Tower or the no, no, anywhere no, like no, that. No, 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 right. no, no, oh, no. That's that. That well, nice. that wasn't where we first met, but that's where our first date was. Uh, there you go. So that's oh. what he wants to have. And I was like, yeah, you could. Or you could just rather than go through the pain of a tattoo, just do yeah. it in a bracelet, couldn't you? Has Morse he had code? any since he's been with you? What tattoos? tattoos? Oh yeah, loads. Oh, he has, has he? Right. He loves his tattoos. Oh, okay. I, I thought you might put a stop to it when you met. <clears throat> I, my only, I mean, his body, I have said, please leave some skin. Mm. As in, I, I don't want him to touch one leg mm. and I don't want him to do his neck. Oh, right. But um, I was like, because that's I want just a little bit. Yeah. So, but then that's, it's, it's up to him ultimately. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 
because <laughs> Adam's like, why the one leg? Because the other leg is tattooed. I was like, leave that one. Yeah. yeah so yeah. So that's already tattooed. I was mm. like, leave one leg at least. With just your skin. This is such a random conversation, isn't mm. it? Um, anyway, silver-plated, beautiful <laughs> star of space of beads. Um, you get it. And if you don't want to go hot down the whole Morse code route, you can just literally use them yeah, as decorative Yeah, absolutely. Terms. Those are lovely, aren't they? They'd be nice with your kits, actually, wouldn't they? They would be they? perfect. Yeah. Lovely. We had, uh, we had a message on our last show when we were talking about Morse code, about doing it on memory wire. Mm. And you could do a whole poem and do all sorts of things on your memory wire. What a lovely with idea. With Morse code, yes, yeah, lovely. What a lovely, with all yeah. the coils. With everything. What yeah, a yeah. nice idea. Yeah. Love that. Wow. And at that price, you probably could, yeah. you? Stock up That's on brilliant. them. Yeah. Amazing, well done everybody. Do get your messages in as well. Come and say hello. Free post and packaging, jewelry makers. Uh, we didn't even know. We didn't even know. <laughs> so make the most of that one. Um, well, so if it was DPD, that's six ninety five, is it, or five ninety five? I can't remember what the expensive postage is. Oh, it's three ninety five normally, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. What in the fast track one or express, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Is it five or I think six it's five ninety five. That's six quid in your pocket straight away. Yeah. Then, the way I look at it. Amazing. Yeah. Make sure you make the most of it. Um, Sarah in Yorkshire, Denise in Surrey, Janet, Ayrshire, California, all around the world. Uh, shopping with us wow. this morning. Lincolnshire, you're there as well. Make sure you're checking out your baskets and remember your early bird jewellery makers as well. Those beautiful decorative bead caps um, <clears throat> that will sell out today. I'm absolutely certain of that. And get your messages in as well. Um, tell us what you're up to this weekend. I did go and get some gas for the barbecue yesterday, so we're going to have a barbecue That's a chore, tonight. Isn't it? Yes. Mm. You have to hunt it down these days. Yeah, you do. Garden centre, was it from a garden centre you got it from? I got it from um, um, a large supermarket. Oh, they do yeah. gas, do they? Mm. Which, 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 which colour supermarket? Um, the yellowy one. Oh, lovely Morrison. Yeah, that's the one. I love Morrison. If you go to the car, yeah. if you go to the actual petrol station bit, because oh. I went originally to the DIY shop, oh, you know, yeah, the yeah. orange one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they were like, you can, but it's a hundred pound. She was very oh, nice. She was like, thing. it's a hundred pound contract. I was like, yeah contract i just want some gas from a barbecue mm. and she's like go to morrison's so i did oh there you go good for so her. i did so that's what we're doing tonight a nice Mason. barbecue in the garden that's good nice yeah will be nice get the paddling mm. pool out yeah barbecue in the garden Perfect. still looking after our neighbor's dog as well so <laughs> Um, yeah, we had we had one we had a Saint Bernard last weekend. This weekend we've got a French bulldog, and wow. he is far more oh. challenging. <laughs> He's lovely, but he is challenging. Let's do what? Sorry, the clovers in solid sterling silver. Wow, well, this is the strand I had in a kit. <gasps> Look at these. Yeah. The and I made um, I made friendship bracelets out of each one. Oh, how beautiful! Yeah. Get all those gem all those yeah. gemstones. Lovely, aren't they? So tiger's eye, these yeah. are all framed in sterling silver. Yeah. Tiger's eye, carnelian, lapis lazuli, turquoise, where am I? Uh, malachite, bronca onyx, yeah. and I'm gonna say probably onyx as well. Black onyx, yes. Um, all set in sterling silver. Now coming up tomorrow, if you love your clovers, make sure you're tuning tomorrow uh, tomorrow at 10 o'clock as well, lovely jewellery makers. I mean, you could quite literally just take the tassels off and you attach could. a clasp, couldn't yeah. you? It's all sterling, including the jump rings. So if yep. you are going to separate them, yep. keep those to one side, don't throw them away. Yep, and they're open jump rings as yeah. well, I can just yeah. about see. Um, so literally, yeah, just connect them and away you go. Um, wonderful selection of your gemstones. I mean, this really is a... Um, a collection isn't it it's exactly that even if you did go to van cleef and arpels which wouldn't be 299 i can tell you that for free would it wouldn't be 299 uh, <clears throat> and i have to say you wouldn't have turquoise you'd have agate you wouldn't have lapis lazuli how about then jewelry makers remember you've got the gemstones and you've got the silver gram weight here how about 99 pounds and 99 pence seven four leaf clover motifs yeah, seven. Seven, yeah. Seven four-leaf clover motifs. What do you reckon? Even mm, if we were yeah, to sell them individually, yeah. £20? When, when we launched them, I said that all the bracelets I would sell for 60 quid. Yeah. And they had one stone and then macrame and sterling silver dongles. Yeah. And, yeah. 
And I bet they would absolutely fly mm. because yeah. the four-leaf clover is everywhere at the moment, yeah. isn't yeah. it? Thanks to Van Cleef and Arpels. I mean, there's lots of designers sort of doing their version of, yeah. if you like. Um, 99.99, but not your price this morning. How many have we got, Roscoe? Eight, only eight. eight. If you love the, wow. the clover motif, wow, that's amazing. Oh. For the silverweight oh. alone. So hang on a minute, 49.99 divided by seven. You're talking about seven sixty each, something like that. I think. Seven pounds sixty. Seven, seven fourteen. 14 even Her better. sterling silver clover motif. Wow. How amazing is that? Mm. I mean, you go for one four leaf clover at said maison. You're talking thousands of pounds. Yeah. And that's not an exaggeration. But I only have a handful of them left, Jewelry Maker, so do make sure you check out. I love the selection. I mean, this is that magic Alhambra where they use that lovely play, uh, um, playful selection of gemstones as well and colours. Love it. Um, you've got meter chains coming up with Mark as well, haven't you? Yes, you can incorporate it absolutely. into your project. With the stopper beads. Yes. So you've got everything you need. Yes. That's Pop a good it. idea. Yeah. yeah. Snapple them ready for the kits at 12. Get this with the 12 o'clock yeah. projects and you're away. Um, hello, Kathy. Hello to you, Mariska. Hello to you, Ayrshire. I only had seven, so make sure you're checking out and I can see people with multiples. 49.99. That is solid 925 sterling silver as well. Do you know my favourite on that? Ooh. Well, I would say Malachite. Yeah. I'm going to say, it's actually the Carnelian. I Look how the vibrant Carnelian. the Carnelian yeah, it's is. stunning, isn't it? I love Malachite. Yeah, yeah. I absolutely love it. But that that mm. carnelian is speaking to me. It's that beautiful it's sunshine lovely. orange. Um, well done, everybody. You found something out very special. <laughs> 50 vivid green angelite -like coming up in the next hour, yeah. You found oh, 10. Oh, no. Oh, these are going to go in seconds. Uh, brand new. <laughs> 10. Can I just, I'm just going to speculate here. So don't take this as mustard. Yeah. But, mustard. When a quantity of 10 is unusual, right? So I'm going to say this is probably what was offered, as in, we can do this. This is the, this is the quality that we have. Take a little look. We might have bought a parcel and they haven't put the SKUs together. Oh, yes. I wonder. Could I wonder. Well Either way, yeah. it's 10 opportunities that we didn't think we'd have. This is one gemstone I don't own. Really? I've never been able to get it. Do you know, the That's other week so when beautiful. I was talking about the Peacock Angel like bangle, I was like, is it any wonder we love this gemstone as much as we do? Yeah, it's like, yeah. it's celeste blue. It's got chatoyancy, a lovely feather. I, I can't believe I've got this, Ross. For me, it's like a turquoise Larimar. I've always thought that. Yeah. yeah. It, uh, do you know, if you were, never mind the big five, which is all marketing, ultimately. Mm. If you were, or we were just discussing the most beautiful gems that exist on this planet, this has to be one Without of them, doesn't it? Without a doubt. Has to be. Yeah. Do we all agree? If we weren't focusing on rarity, if we weren't focusing mm. on price per carat, if we're just driven by beauty alone, Peacock Angelite's gotta be up there. Yeah. Look at that. And also, yeah, that's true. That's true. That's true. Ross is just saying, L, but remember, this is probably one of the last opportunities that we'll have of this quality because we have been offered further peacock angelite, but it has the yellow inclusions. It's still pretty, don't get oh, me wrong, right. but it's not as good a grade as what you see here. So this is the last that we have. We are trying, of course, to get more um of this quality but all we've been offered at the moment is the one with that blend of yellow i have 10 and there's 27 of you with it in your baskets no not not one confirmation yet though so we'll do this in one price crash good luck well, i couldn't do a showcase this is the this is the only strand that we have left if everyone put the checks out it's gone it's gone yeah already Again, can I just highlight, look, if, if you were to go to any other jeweller or gem trader and say, okay, um, what's one of the most beautiful gemstones? Also, what's one of the most difficult gemstones that you have to um, to offer? And they are like, okay, Peacock Angel, I've only got 10 in my entire entire portfolio. But I tell you what, I'll just give it to you to 29 99 Where else in the world to do that? Yeah. You know, they'd be like, okay, that's the only one I've got. So let's, let's put zeros on the end of it. That's what most jewellers would do. 
but we're not like that. And free postage and packaging. This is going to beat the clock. Always beat the clock. It's gone. It's gone. Well done. Well, well done. done, everyone. We are trying to get more. Don't miss out on the vivid green. If you love that, you're going to. Is love that on pre-order? No. No. Oh. I don't think we can. Right. Because if we did that, it'd sell out. I do have Guinea Mine Natural Ruby. Oh my goodness. This, this is the one that glows, isn't it? With the UV, I think. Yeah. Oh, and you've got your, yeah. yeah. So yeah. this, we are talking extreme rarity and widely regarded as some of the best, um, the best Ruby in the world. It's got a massive closeout deal on one of the world's rarest rubies. Um, you can see, you can see the quality. Like yeah. Mark says, it literally glows and it'll glow, look at that recording, even more so oh. in natural sunlight, yeah. That's wow. natural, it's not fissure filled, it's not even heat treated, it's not uh, um, diffused in any way. We're, I mean, that's already way too low at £129 for 25 carats. Now, when we launch this, we'll show you the closing price. There are 10 available in the world. If you are a July baby, you need this. So we, ah. Oh. Wow. 79.99 for 25 carats of natural ruby again how many of us actually thought that we would own ruby because yeah, i didn't yeah, yeah that's the launch price it's not your early bird price i have 10 available i'm tempted by this it's willow's birthstone and they are big yeah absolutely big stones just do one like you said on a bit of macrame yeah, something a bit yeah, yeah. Cool and wearable. What? Today, <laughs> that's ridiculous in the best possible way. Well done, Heather. Wow. I've got Manchester, London, Cumbria, and Susan. That's actually ridiculous. I think we will beat the clock. I think you're right. Put this. Do you know what I'd put this with? Maybe your black mm, jade eye. Yeah, that yeah. would look lovely. How about mm. the vivid green? That would look lovely. Oh, how about your deal of the day? As well, how about teaming it alongside some absolutely beautiful quartzite jade? I love that strand of rondelles on the yeah. end. Yeah, it's beautiful, isn't it? We are talking high-end collectible gemstone, one of the world's rarest mm. and one of the world's finest locations. Um, that, as Mark said, it literally glows. You can see that in the recording without the need for UV to, uh, uh, torch. Marishka, Elaine, London, Cumbria, wow. Heather. Cumbria's got two. Well done. Um, I only had ten. I've got Denise there, Cheryl there, Ella there, Shona there, Manchester there, and Susan. You get the box as well, don't you? You we get, get the box. You it's part of our well, coveted yeah. collection. Yeah. I'm oh, not. Yes, I'm right. not really yeah. sure if Ross should be half pricing our coveted no. collection. It's gone. He says. In the minute. Was it? Was it? Amazing. Right wow. then. Next up. Should we do another close out? <laughs> uh, no. Oh, is it? Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Ross says, I'll just give you a moment and then it registers. Oh, yes, yes, I've got it. Yes. Um, it's described as dark green, but you'll see my mm. mistake. Yeah. You'll understand my st mistake. Technically, though, all black jade is actually just a very, very dark green. Yes, yes. Because it's bypassed your imperial green uh, um, colour. It takes millions of years. This is the blackest dark green you've ever seen. So do you see my mistake then? Yeah. In a you, way. <laughs> you can just say yes. You can. You want to keep me on my toes? Okay, fair enough. Um, a beautiful dark colour. Yeah, to, to, to most of us, we'll go, okay, yeah, it's black. But actually, under a strong light. In fact, you can see in Adam's recording, it's actually a very, very, very dark yeah, green. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. And nothing, absolutely nothing, no treatment, no laboratory can actually speed that process up. Only Mother Nature and the length of time is, is millions of years. Um, it forms in much, much smaller sizes. Um, there's two varieties of black jade. You've got omphacite and then you've got chicken skin. This is more your omphacite variety, which has got that translucency and that beautiful, beautiful, very dark, almost like a vintage green, if that makes sense. Think of a Rolex, the Rolex branding, that only a little bit darker, mm. yeah? It is that really dark green, isn't it? Like a forest green. Um, we're talking real rarity and definitely one for the collectors. Um, I've only got six available. We'll do it in one price crash, jewelry makers. 
and you get a minute at this price crash because it is clearance effectively close out whichever way you want to word it oh that's why we can't do pre-orders isn't it mm. yes <laughs> Let's never lose sight of the fact that we are talking about one of the world's rarest gemstones. It is in the top 10 world's rarest mm. gemstones out of 4,000 minerals that exist yeah. on our planet. Amazing, isn't it? Um, I'm, just gonna, I'm just going to say, if you see any six millimetre rounds today, we're giving this away at 12 o'clock, yes. at 9 o'clock with the, uh, the selenite kit. You'll be able to kiss cross with any six mil round using this. That has got to be one of the most in demand. Mm. instructions yep. ever mm -hmm. start to finish kiss cross coming up at yeah, nine o'clock yeah. you could kiss cross with this i mean any, how any amazing would that be yeah, yeah, yeah. oh that'd be incredible heather mariska and wendy you've done it i've got tina kevin stay where you are on the phone lines my lovely i've all said oh you've been answered lovely um gloria's there as well i've got two left margaret you can do it good luck everyone 69 pounds and 99 pence only nine o'clock we have a brand new selection of selenite here it is oh, oh mark that's so beautiful i could watch that recording all day it's lovely, with yeah. the instructions that mark just referenced start to finish Kiss Cross, one of the most in-demand tutorials ever. Has Price, to be. Isn't it? Has to be, and that comes free with the project. So basically, if I get the project, the only thing I need to add is thread. And 11, um, and 11 O's. There you go, that's which it. most of us need. have with our yeah, stash. Yeah, that's all you need. I'm not a seed beater and I've got 11 O's. Mm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so that's all you need, nine yeah. o'clock, nine o'clock. You can't pre-order it yet. Okay, sorry. Should we do a slider? Yes. Well, not just one. Have you seen how many there are? You get 12. Whoa. By the time they get these out, the auction's going to be over, isn't it? Right. Ross says, I'll tell you now, there's 17 available. And this might be the biggest closeout of the hour. Okay. Are these the birthstone? Yeah. So far, I can see Mukai. I can see... Garn <laughs> he said it really fast. Garnet, amethyst, aquamarine, black diamond, emerald, freshwater culture pearl, ruby, black spinel, blue sapphire, white opal, citrine, tanzanite. Black diamond. Yeah. Normally yeah. we put a bit of quartz in, don't we, for, for Do you want to April. see the black diamond yes, one? Yes, please. Yeah. Oh, my yeah. word. There it is, black diamond. That's the price of all of them. Yep. Oh, and this is going that. to be one of the biggest closeout deals ever. How many do we have? 17 on the nose. Sterling silver, 12 grams. Those two alone. Wait, no, wait, 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 wait. These three. Because hang on a second. If I can pick it up, that is. It's not many sliders we actually, or birthstone events that we actually do proper diamond. No. This is amazing. Oh, that's tanzanite, yeah. It's uh, just a lovely tanzanite uh, you've got there. I mean, seriously. Oh, look. Tanzanite, pearls, black diamonds, emeralds. Ruby. Ruby, sapphire. sapphires. Yes. Oh, yeah. Can I just show you the, the, the emeralds? They're amazing. They're, They're quite huge, aren't they? Absolutely amazing. Yeah, you have got the big five in here. Yeah. Yeah, because you've got your rubies as well, haven't you? And um, big six, big seven, because you've got aquamarine <laughs> too, and pearls. I mean, okay, you get 12. I can't hold them all, jewelry makers, because otherwise I'll, here we go. Wow. You get 12. 10 pound each would be absolutely incredible, Roscoe. Should we stop there? Just for kicks, just for kicks. 120 pounds, that's 10 pound each. 10 pound for that black diamond. Slider bracelet, sterling silver yeah. slider bracelet. That's amazing. We're going to do one of the biggest closeouts of the of the day thus far, and they are going to disappear. We've got seventeen though. That's it. That's all we've got available. Ten pound each. I'm still going. Don't worry. I'm still going. I'm just trying to lay these out as best I possibly can. 
That's amazing. Oh, there's the citrine. Am I ready? Yeah, I am ready. We're actually over allocated. Ignore ten pounds each. Six pounds sixty six per sterling silver genuine gemstone slider bracelet. The black diamond, six pounds sixty six. The tanzanite, six pounds sixty six. The ruby, yep, you guessed it, six pounds sixty six. The emerald, six pounds sixty six. Four way split pay as well. Yeah, well, you know it's too low then, don't you? Oh you my know word. it's far too low. I only had seventeen. Denise, Heather, Mary, hello to you, Ken, Lorna, hello to you, Warwickshire, Maker, Janice, Angela, Jane, Maureen, Margaret, Lanarkshire. Make sure you're checking out everybody. Twenty pounds. Sonia in West Yorkshire, Mandy in Derbyshire, Jennifer, Ken. Kirsty in Australia, all around the world. Aye, aye, aye. World, aye, aye, aye. <laughs> <laughs> I can't buy my baby. I don't know. Who sang that? Lisa Stansfield. Lisa Stansfield. So beautiful yeah. she is. Yeah. No, she's lovely. Andrew likes Lisa Stansfield. Yeah. Got all her albums. Yeah. Do you know, Lisa mm. Stansfield, Alison Moyet. Yeah, yeah. Do you remember she looks her? incredible. Yeah, she's touring at the moment as well. Is she? Yeah. Um, my, my, my sister yeah. always used to like yeah. Alison Moyet. Yeah. I'm trying to think of an Alison Moyet song now. Um, well, she did the Yazoo stuff, didn't she? Did she? Yeah. Do you remember Yazoo? I, do, I feel Back like I do. Day. It was her and the chappy who was now in the Pet Shop Boys. Yes. No, no, he's not. No, he's not. He did... Um... Erasure. <sighs> yes, thank you. There you go. Thank you. I don't know why. That just came to me. It was, yeah. Just yeah. came to me. Think, I'm trying to think. Yeah. So, Alison Moyet song. Oh, cried out. That's you it. took a whole lot of love and full of nothing. nothing. Yeah. That's right. Oh, show only me. you. Oh, no. Um, seems like only yesterday you da, took da, your da, troubles da, da, away. Da, 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 da. Can you hear me? Yeah. yeah. Love it. Yeah. Can I just put, can I be controversial to say 80s best music? Absolutely, without a doubt. I think the best music in the 80s. Yeah. What do you reckon, yeah. Ava? Yeah. 90s. You think 90s? 90s Ava was wasn't good. born in the 80s. That's true. Yeah. I, I mean... Lauren definitely wasn't. Do you no. know Lauren was born in 2002? I know. 2002. <sighs> what do you reckon? What do you reckon? What, ge what decade do you think had the best music, Ross? You think 60s, because oh, yeah, yeah, he's a massive actually, Beatles fan, yeah, isn't he? Yeah. What do you reckon adds? Yeah, 80s, 80s is good, yeah. Because yeah. you had the whole power ballads and everything in yeah. there, didn't you? Stock Aitken and Waterman. Hey? Stock Aitken and Waterman. All the, uh, all the Sonyas and the Kylies and yes. the Sinitas and. That's right, yeah. The, yeah, all the, yeah. Brilliant. Um, yeah. Uh, do you know who came on the radio the other day? To Pow. Oh my word. Yeah. China in, in your, your hand. hand. Love it. Right then, next. Oh, I, this has been winking at me, this, this strand. It's absolutely beautiful, nice. literally. Winking at me. <laughs> Look at yeah, this. Let's, yeah. Is this the chamfered edge cube or yeah. the plain cube? Yes, the chamfered. Sh the chamfered one. Chamfered, it's so beautiful, yeah. this strand. Burmese, Burmese wow. black spinel. Now, um, the reason why I'm emphasising the word Burmese is because Burmese ruby, ruby mm. we know, has only got maybe a couple of years left of mining. Spinel is mined alongside ruby, so it tells me that this is limited too. And it is, for obvious reason, but you can see some of the best spinel, some of the finest spinel. Um, even here at 99.99, it's totally and utterly natural. But yeah, there's a, what Mark's oh. describing is it's a cube, but it actually has a chamfered edge, so it gives you more sparkle than your standard Eight cube. Eight more facets. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So pretty, this strand. We fell in love with this, we Mark, did. didn't we, we did. when we saw it for the oh, first we did, time? We did a big collector's black spinel launch, yes. didn't we, with all the different yes. strands. That's right. Do you know what I do with this? We've got those lovely bead caps coming up. I make a tassel and I put that on yeah, the top. Yeah, that'd be amazing. Do you know what I mean? Squeeze that over a nice tassel. Make a nice full Burmese spinel. Wow, that's beautiful. Chamfered cube tassel. Unbelievable. And it's totally and utterly natural. Again, this is one for the collectors. Um, you can get spinel from all around the world. It's not mm. abundant. It's very, very rare. And of course, was very much in, misunderstood as a gemstone because we didn't have gemology at the time. Um, but this is actually mined alongside sapphires and rubies. 
Burmese Ruby, they believe will have about two years left of mining. So that tells wow. me that if you are a fan of Burmese Spinel, then definitely now is the time to be getting hold of it. It's some of the best quality. We're at £49.99, pence, but we are no way near done. How many have we got, Roscoe? 30. Okay. I mean, how many do you think you'd need for a full tassel, Mark? If I was going to go for like a nice pair of tassel so I earrings. would probably go for nine drops. And yeah. each drop maybe. I don't know, if you rosary linked, you could be really sparse, sparse with it, couldn't you? Mm, that would be nice too. So you probably need, I don't know, 15 on each tassel, so you've got more than enough More there. than enough for more a big full tassel. Enough. Yeah. Probably yeah. even a suite of jewellery, to be yeah. truthful. Yeah. Um, already collectors are getting involved. It is full of spark. I mean, black spinel from any location is one of the most performing gemstones. You've got to remember, it's all on the exterior, so cutting, polishing is absolutely crucial. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> yeah, get it now whilst you can because, yeah, the price oh. is on a massive incline, obviously, because of the rarity. Any gemstone from Burma carries a higher price tag, obviously. Um, but I should imagine, that, yeah, any gemstone that... <clears throat> Um, that is on that is known well it's as beautiful as it is no explanation no, the reason it's not just about country of origin uh rupal janice sally kathy tina jane janice and jan well done uh mary and jerry congratulations i only had 30 and there's multi buyers getting involved again it's not about the internal brilliance it's all about the external hello mandy um oh. i have these they're stunning I have the rounds too and i made a bracelet with silver spaces uh, oh. Simple but stunning. Yeah, you don't mess around with this. Why yeah. do you need to? It's you don't. Just, no, it says it, it all, doesn't it? Well, you know what, yeah. Mandy? When we've shown pieces like celebrities who've chosen black spinel on the red carpet, you think about Jennifer Aniston, for example. Mm. Um, it was really simple, just literally very linear, like designs. Yeah. Yeah. Sandra Bullock, very linear, very simple designs. Because the performance is in the gemstone, isn't it? Yeah amazing well done everybody yeah. on the verge of, of selling out now um paula in london kathy in derbyshire well done to you elizabeth in tiny where we are busy this morning and so if you've noticed but free post and packaging today use this code jm free post and you can combine your order etc free postage and packaging all Not day That's bottle, a nice of wine, isn't it? bottle of wine exactly yeah, yeah. exactly Ooh. Might have a glass. There she is. That's a really simple linear bracelet. Very similar to what Mandy was just oh, yeah. describing, wasn't it? That's very nice. You like this? Yeah, wow. Ross is saying, yeah, big statement looks. Yeah, Michelle, yo, she looks gorgeous. That dress is stunning. Mm. I love that dress. She always looks effortlessly stylish, though, doesn't she? Well done, everybody. Wow. Amazing. Well done, everybody. Um, okay, now, if, if like Mandy, you're thinking, oh, I like the idea of, of the rounds. I don't have the rounds. I think they sold out, but we do have the rondelles. They're more of a roundel. We're back to that again, yeah, aren't yeah, yeah. we? <laughs> so, again, you could go really simple. You could go for the sort of linear looks like Sandra Bullock. You could go for the full drapage like Michelle Yeoh. Um, again, you just get so much performance, so much sparkle. An opportunity oh. to get involved from that same location, natural Burmese black spinel. What shape is this? A little rondelle? Yeah, kind of, oh, yeah, cute. more like a roundel though, yeah, aren't they? Cute. We're under £20, Mark, and we're not stopping. What? Yeah, you did hear that right. We're, in 30 seconds, we're taking this under £10. When we launched it, there was 150 available. There are 35 of them left oh. within the vault. Um, they're too beautiful to be sat within our vault, jewellery makers. These need to be worn on, in, the, in the gorgeous sunshine that we're having finally. Natural Burmese spinel. And it will go with absolutely everything. That's what I love about black spinel. You know, a black diamond. I love a black diamond, but they're more metallic, aren't they? Use them as spaces in between your selenite. That looks oh, amazing, wouldn't it? Yes, with the contrast of the bright colours. Mm, that would be beautiful. Oh, and you're getting that project instructions yeah. as well at 9 o'clock today. A tenner for Burmese black spinel, Ross. No, no. Wow. One of the lowest priced Burmese spinels that we've ever done. Well, surely it is the lowest price. Probably, surely. 
Um, Nancy, Lavinia, RuPaul, Jan, Shona, Elizabeth, Alison, Mandy. Oh, I can see Mandy there. Um, Maker, Ma uh, Mary, Hillary, new customer, new customer. Morning, everybody. Hi, June in Newport. Gosh, June, I bet it was chaos by you when Taylor Swift was in Cardiff. Because, <laughs> oh, I bet it was absolute chaos for you. I, yeah, I wouldn't want her to live in Cardiff or, or any of the big cities mm. that she was at. Or if you do, just bed down for a couple of days. Um, hi, Asuje. 60s, 70s, 80s music. Brill. Loved Alison Moyer and Erasure. Erasure yeah. were great. Still are. Hmm. They're still about, aren't they? They're yeah, still about. They're still touring. Yeah. They're still touring. Yeah, I yeah. liked Erasure yeah. as well. Yeah. Can I throw this one in there? Rock set. I was a big rock set Oh, she's fan. just passed away, isn't Has she? Has she? Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. I loved her music. Hello, yeah. Helen saying, um, good morning, you beautiful people. Uh, morning, darling. Um, L, what is a sterling silver ring holder? Sunshine outside and sunshine on oh. TV. Who could ask for more? Helen. Bless you, Helen. Um, I, I can show you. Um, sterling silver ring holder. It, it's interesting, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. this. We had to figure it out, didn't we? Yeah, yeah. Here we go. I'll quickly show you. I'll quickly show you. So if I just take my... Basically, have you? Oh, yeah. if, if I, I've got some of my dad's rings that I obviously mm. couldn't wear, but if I did that, yeah. I launched these. Did you? Yeah. So we you basically loop it over. Yeah. You put your chain through there, and it means you can wear that piece of jewelry. Uh, you can wear that piece of jewelry. Yeah. Yeah, it's nice. There were two stars. There was this one on the horse and a um, wishbone. Yeah. yeah. I think the wishbone must have gone. That's what you do, basically. Or if you want, you could do it that way. Yes. Yeah. You could do it that way too. Which it's entirely up to you and it's perfectly safe. I think it's the most contemporary design we've ever done on the show. Yeah, this time. very never, cool. I, we, as you said, we didn't, we were quite unsure how we You know, you look at something used. and like yes. you, Helen, didn't yeah. know how it yeah. worked, but that's what, yeah. that's what you do. Yeah. Now, just before we get into your early bird, we're going to do a double trouble on spacer beads. I need these. I do need these because they, I like the size of these. Five millimetres, I'm just going to hold them in the pots because otherwise they're just go, they're going to go everywhere otherwise, aren't they? <laughs> And Ava will be like, no, trying to follow all the five mil beads. So you get two pots, double trouble. So that's 40 in total. Is that right, Roscoe? Yeah. Um, solid 925 sterling silver. You're going to need these, Mark, with your vivid green yeah, angel light. You're going to need these yeah. with your kiss cross, aren't you? And wow. your selenite. You're going to need these with your masterclass. You're going to need these with your quartzite jade. They are always an integral part to any jewelry maker's stash. Tell you what, one pound per sterling silver five mil spacer bead. How about, how about 50p? But then oh. also a 30 second clock would go and even lower. So in my head right now, jewelry makers, if we were to stop at 19.99, you're buying one, you're getting one yeah, free. Yeah, absolutely. That's what my head tells me. I'm not saying you should listen to what's in my head. <laughs> <laughs> but that's what I, that's how I'm I'm like that, that's an amazing deal five mil sterling silver spacer beads 19.99 buy one get one free but we're going even lower going even lower everybody pays the final low stock up your stashes while you get the chance um. <laughs> dead 16 quid dead on the nose on the nose on the nose <laughs> that's that's eight pound each. That's one of the best prices on spacer beads I've seen because yeah. they're big, aren't they? Five mil. Yeah. Ross. Wow. That's very low. Eight pound per for, yeah. for a pack of twenty. Unbelievable. Is there quantity of these? I do ask for my own personal benefit because I would like to get some of these. I just pop them on straight on a on a on elastic, couldn't you? You know, wow. like um, Tiffany's and Co do. So um, links of London, who I don't think are with us anymore no, are I don't they? think so they they're a, a bracelet of just this size was 110 pounds yeah and you can get one for 16 quid yeah basically because you've got 20 centimeters worth there yeah links of London which is eight inches so you've got you make a bracelet and earrings and earrings <laughs> for 16 quid and their their sterling silver is no different yeah. to ours it's all the same isn't it absolutely Tiffany's and co sterling silver any different to ours nope do they? Do Tiffany's do this yeah. bracelet? Do they? I don't know if you can find that photo, can you, Roscoe? That photo of this of the sterling silver stretchy bracelet on Tiffany's, and it's like five hundred quid, I think. <gasps> no. Five hundred pounds. Yes. 
I know. Really? Yeah. For the same silver? Yeah. It's silver, silver, isn't silver, it? Silver, silver. 925. Yeah. yeah. Unless, of course, you're going for something like silver clay, then obviously that's a bit different. Mm. But 925 sterling wow. silver is all the same. And they don't use silver clay. That's amazing. amazing. That's one of the be best deals I've seen on Spacer Beads. And, and I, 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 you know, credit where it's due to our lovely Alice, who does most of the bulk of our sterling silver yes. buying. Yeah. It's difficult to buy silver competitively because mm. the bullion market price is the bullion market yeah. price. Yeah. Um, but yeah, she's she's doing it, isn't she? Well done. Sally, Pauline, Heather, oh, Wendy, Renfusha, Rupal, Lucy, Janice, Helen, Catherine, Samantha, Janet, Jane, Ken. Lots of multi buyers on this too. I only had 50 there. Yeah, there you go. That's like five hundred pound that bracelet. Wow! I know. Could you make that jewelry makers? And I actually think they're quite small. Mm. So I think yeah, these are bigger. Yeah. Um, well done. Keep checking out your baskets. Your early bird is coming up next. So stay where you are on those phone lines for your spacer beads. Make sure you start thinking about checking out your baskets on everything for this hour because remember they time out at nine o'clock. So that's five minutes time. Free post and packaging today with JM Free Post. And don't forget, we've got the most unbelievable, unbelievable kit hour, project hour, sorry, coming up with Mark, the return of your absolutely beautiful selenite, but this time in new colors. That's coming your way. Up next though, is your early bird. <laughs> So, a bead cap, Mark, you've always been a massive advocate massive. of a bead cap, haven't yeah. you? And it's something that we've never had on the show until this year, I don't, yeah. think. I don't think. Well, we used to have them, but then they disappeared. Yeah, completely. We haven't had them for years and years and years. Through no reason. No. And there's such a really nice way of just, if you have a special focal bead, yeah. we want to have a, you know, a focal bead within a piece of jewellery, just having that little bit of silver either side just to accentuate it and make it a feature. Yeah. It's just so simple, but so effective. So right? effective. Yeah. It's a bit like, you know, yeah. if you hang a piece of um, art on the wall and then all of a sudden you frame it, it's that mm, difference, absolutely. isn't it? Absolutely, yeah. It, yeah. It, it, yeah, it's giving it that finish. And I'm not saying you need to frame every single bead, but that mm. one bead that you do decide to use a bead cap with um, is going to become yeah, sort of the, the, the focus. Um, but not only that, jewellery makers, you have, for me, this design, it's very, it's, it, it's very clever because it's not a closed bead cap. It's actually more like a collot, more like a clamshell, mm, I mm. suppose. Let me just grab my tweezers and I'll show you around. Um, I'll pick up the largest one first, but only because then you can see the designs and then we'll show you the other ones. But look at this patterning on the surface. Can you see that beautiful beaded patterning? It's lovely floral motif. Can you see the flowers? It's so pretty. It's like a vine that is going to cage around your gemstone of choice. Now, hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Beautiful. I have 200 of these available. Um, I'm just going to borrow one of the strands from 10 o'clock because, and obviously I'm not going to actually completely fit this, but if you imagine, do I need something smaller? Hang on. If you, I'll get the other strand, it's all good. Oh, here we go, well actually, how about the angel light that we had earlier on? If you imagine this, but actually threaded on. Oh, this has got two loops, hasn't it, to go down through the center of the gemstone? Yeah. Oh. Well, no, you've got three, because you've got one there. Oh, yeah. 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 And then you've got one here. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. And then you've got one the other side. Look at that, Mark. They're gorgeous, aren't they? They're so pretty, aren't they? And obviously, I've literally just placed that on top of it, but you would incorporate into your beading so it would be sort of horizontally. Um, I love it. We've never done a bead cap, to no, my knowledge, no. anyway, like this. So intricate. Now, you don't just get the one, you get three different sizes, so you can accommodate lots of your um, gemstone strands, even the larger size gems as well that we have available um, here at Jewelry Maker. Loving this idea. Now, we're talking V caps, but it could also be a tassel top, couldn't it? Yeah. Are you smiling? Something just pops into my head and it's really, really bad. <laughs> bad, but all funny. So for the, for the sci-fi fans out there, all I'm going to say is Terminator 2. Judgment Day. Okay. I'm so confused. 
Does he look like that? There's a, there's a baddie in it who's, who um, he, gets, he gets shot at quite often by Arnold Schwarzenegger. Oh, right, OK, and, and then, it's silver. And, and then he melts back into a human yeah, he does. form yeah, again. Yeah, 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 yeah I that, know what you that mean. That just reminded me of... Ah, uh, yeah, because he's... <laughs> when it went, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, but far yeah. more beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I do get what you mean, because you know he's what silver, I mean? isn't he? Yeah, and he, he, yeah, he parts open, doesn't he, when he gets yeah. shot, and then he moulds back just as a human being. Just moulds back together. Like yeah. this does, you can literally yeah. mould this back around the actual gemstone. Um, unbelievably beautiful. I'm loving this. They could also be, if you do like a tassel, you know like one of our um, fabric tassels where you've got the cords mark, you could just literally cage that over the top, couldn't you? That's a nice idea. Over mm -hmm. the fabric bit? Yeah, yeah. You could do that. You could use them around uh, um, your gemstones mm. as well. We're at 29.99, so in my head, that's £10 each. An amazing deal. That's solid 925 sterling silver. A lot of you are choosing to multi-buy on this. And I know our graphics say bead caps, but for me, this is so much more. It could almost be kind of treated like a calotte, I guess. You could use it as a tassel top. You could solder it and complete, mm. make it a complete sort of bead if you want. I like the organic to. nature of it as well. It's, yeah. it's really beautiful, isn't it? Does anyone else almost see like oh. a grapevine here? Yes, yeah. I'm looking at that like a grapevine. Now, we could stop here or we could go lower. If I tilt that one towards you, that's the smallest. What? How about if we said we're at five pounds each no. And we're still not done. I've only got 200. That's not enough. And I've, I, I've got quantities of fours, threes, twos being purchased already. You get a graduation of sizes. Look at that. So can you see there's, like Mark just pointed out, there is three drill holes in here, three opportunities effectively. So you've got the one just here, kind of like your calotte would be, but then also you've got two either side. So um, it really gives you lots of opportunities to treat them as calottes. You could use them like calottes in that way. Would they work in your designs? I can see you looking around. If I bring this across, so this tassel necklace here. Yeah. I've made a cone ending, yeah. so the, the top of the cord is hidden inside, inside that cone. If you didn't have the cone and use one of those, yeah. you'd have the two cords from the necklace going down through one of the holes, yeah. you pop the top of the tassel up, clamp it closed, yeah. and then you get this How amazing ornate be? tassel top. I think that'd be gorgeous. Really it? lovely. Yeah. And yeah. you see the colour of the, t of the fabric running yeah. through as well. Really pretty. We're at £5 each, jewellery makers, but we are going even lower. You get all three of them. They are brand new. I don't think they're going to see another show, to be truthful. Yeah, that's ridiculous. <laughs> that's the price of the big one. Yeah. And the other two free, in my opinion. Yeah, because it is a... Yeah. What's that? 10, 12 millimetres in size? 13. 13 mil. So you could easily support that around some of your bit larger gemstones. Plus free postage and packaging for you as wow. well today, jewellery makers. Stock up your stashes. We've never done a bead cap like this before, to my knowledge anyway. I love the idea because it's not just a bead cap. You can actually use it as, well, an embellishment, obviously. But also, why not treat them? Why not use them as mm. clots? It's beautiful on that screen behind you. Gorgeous, aren't yeah, they? Gorgeous. Yeah, gorgeous. Because you think a clot, you close it around the knot, don't That's you? That's right, yeah. So you could almost put, say that, say this was pearls, you could put the last pearl there. Yeah, yeah. Couldn't you? With the cord coming up. With Not. Your, with, yeah, yeah, yeah. Then your clasp. Then your clasp. Yeah, yeah. You That'd could do that, amazing, couldn't you? Amazing, wouldn't it? So it actually goes right up close to it. Yeah. How amazing. Yeah, yeah. Half the stock is gone, jewellery makers. Um, half the stock. I'm surprised, mind you, there's loads of people there in the process. You've got to remember though, threes, fours, twos, I'm seeing a lot of multi-buys on this. A good, what do you reckon, Mark, 80% of yeah, people absolutely. choosing to multi-buy? Yeah. So the, are the two smaller ones the same size? Um, no. Slight, oh, okay. They graduate. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Yeah. So it's like small, medium and large. Beautiful. You get the three different sizes. If I turn it that way, you might be able to see better. Oh yes. that, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. You've got a graduation of your sizes as well. Okay, three rows of names. Marisha's got two, Kathy's wow. got three, Alice has got three, Geraldine's got three, Pat's got three, Nottinghamshire's got four, uh, Pauline's got two, uh, Karen's got two. Paul, uh, there's so many multi buyers. Tessa, you've multi bought. Congratulations. We're going even lower. That gets you all three jewelry makers. 
all three building up towards our next hour which is going to be absolutely amazing a vision of summertime that this would work so beautifully with good luck i had 200 we did say we didn't think that was going to be enough to go around definitely looking like that's the case <laughs> A few, a few of the designers have said this, and I'm sure you're in agreement, Mark. But also, where can you get something like exactly. this? Never mind no, the price, no, that's a good where point. can that's you a get it? point, them? actually. Yeah. Because it's not something that you're going to find on many places. Because no, no, we not. do bring you some quite niche products, mm. don't we, here yeah. at Jewelry Maker? You know, it's where can you get items like this and guarantee the quality as well? You can see the investment of sterling silver. They're very cool. That's £3.33 each. That's amazing. Amazing. They're, they're, they're just so beautiful. As I said, I like the organic nature of them. Yeah. Very um, woodland. Very. I, I was thinking of Hobbit in Lord of the Rings. That sort of. I literally that sort watched of that thing. last night. Did you? Which one? First one. Of. Lord, Lord of, of the Rings. Rings. Yeah, yeah. It was. It was one of those ones I'll go to if you just put it on in the background. Yeah. You know, Tom loves them. He's obsessed with those films. And Willow loves them too. Three hobbits? Oh, four hobbits! <laughs> yeah, no, it's good. Yeah, yeah, it is. It's definitely got that yeah, kind of, that sort of what the Shire yeah, yeah, yeah. beauty just, about yeah, them. It's just gorgeous. Loving these. They're on the verge of selling out. Everybody, good luck. If your name is Carol, Patricia, Catherine, Northamptonshire, Lynn, Lindo, London, Alison, Lynn, Sarah, Sally, Karen, Jennifer, Margaret, Susan, uh, Dorset. I mean, your name's not Dorset, wow. but Sylvia, um, make sure you check out because these are looking like they're going to sell out imminently. Well done to you, Carolyn County Down, Conway, Linda, Tina, Maria, London, Tracy and Powers. Keep on dialing through. Now, coming up in the next hour, we are super, super excited because there is something so hypnotically beautiful about selenite. We have brand new colours, jewellery makers. You think summertime. You think the races, you think weddings. Mm. I, see, I see palettes like this. Um, you're going to get seven strands in Mark's project. Plus, for the first time, and quite possibly, quite probably, I'm going to reword that, the most in-demand tutorial instructions yet. Mm -hmm. I've shown how to, I think I was with you, I've shown how to join the ends once. Yeah, I remember. And we've never done it in written instructions before, which so is a question I've asked so many times as you, well. You have written down, Mark, which would have taken you hours, mm. start to finish Kiss yeah. Cross. Yeah. So if you've struggled or you've always wanted to do this technique, then you get that free with the project. The only thing that you need to add to the project is some thread, wildfire, fire yeah. line, one of those, yeah. and some 11 O's. Do not go anywhere, but I'll give you a heads up. There's less than a hundred of these colors available, so they will sell out. Do not go anywhere while I make my way over to Mark. Um, we'll see you after this. Hello everyone, it's Mark here. I'm really looking forward to joining you all this Saturday, the 22nd of June, nine o'clock. We've got, I don't know how we managed to get it, a seven strand bundle of rainbow selenite in six millimeter rounds. The tutorial that you get free of charge if you buy the bundle shows you from start to finish how to make this, I think my, one of my favorite pieces I've made, the beautiful Harlequin selenite necklace and also a sneaky bangle from start to finish and how to even splice the ends together to produce the over the head look. And then at 12 o'clock, something completely different, something completely unmarked Smith, I have been given sterling silver double stopper beads with the most incredible gemstone strands. We've got this one here, which is black jadeite. There's this little stopper there at the bottom. So you can adjust to any length, any style of necklace that you like. We've got green jadeite again. Beautiful, where's the little stopper bead? My birthstone, amethyst. And again, this is going to be the little demo that I'm going to be showing on the show. There's amazing little motif here so that's coming up at 12 o'clock and also you don't have to make necklaces look i've made these cute little slider bracelets again there's the double stoppers so that's this saturday 22nd of june myself ellen and the team cannot wait to share it with you we've got some real treats in store
Here at Jewelry Maker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard PMP is $3.95. Charges may differ outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option of $5.95. Shopping made easy on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, this coming Saturday, we have an incredibly exciting deal of the day. A brand new parcel, quite possibly of the finest quartzite jade we have seen. It's an opportunity not to be missed especially for the collectors out there. So make sure you tune in this coming Saturday for Quartzite Jade. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewelry making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8am until 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Welcome back, jewellery makers. Now, I think 2024, this has to be one of the most loved launches. Oh, without a doubt. Was it 2024? It was, yes. I thought so. Yep. So, in the past six months, we believe that the coloured selenite that, that has been launched here at Jewellery Maker has to be one of the most popular. I think so. And it's understandable, mm. isn't it? It's my gem of the year. It's my gem Is of the it? year. Yeah, yeah, without a doubt, without a shadow of a doubt. You know, I keep looking mm. at this recording every time that, it, like, <laughs> in my peripheral vision, I see the same recording that you see, and it, you can't not look at it, can you? It's been viewed nearly a thousand times. I'm not surprised. It's only been on a couple of days as well. Yeah, it's fascinating. So beautiful, ha and that, and by the way, you know, that's not a man-made gemstone. That's a mother, a, a mother nature yep. created gemstone that then we influence with colours. Yeah. And that colour seems to only enhance the chatoyancy of selenite. Um, can we just talk about what selenite is as a gemstone? Um, I don't know if you've got that, Roscoe. Um, because it's actually a variety of gypsum, so it's, very, it's actually very dry. Mm. Um, but it is massively, massively celebrated um, in the gemstone world and, the, uh, and within your metaphysical metaphysical uh, side of gemstones. Thank you, Ava. So selenite is a very uh, specific variety of the mineral gypsum named after the ancient Greek goddess of the moon, Selen. Ooh. And straight away you can totally mm, see that, yeah, can't yeah. you? Yeah, yeah. Um, the Greeks especially appreciated the beauty of selenite, even making windows with the stone. This gemstone received its official name from uh, J.G. Wallerius. I hope I said spelled Wallerius, Wallerius, mm. um, in 1749, uh, 47, uh, when he wrote that. Um, <laughs> as a general uh, material, it has been valued since as far back as the Egyptians. Wow 
when it was used for decorative purposes. One unique use of selenite is in the Santa Sabina church in Rome and large arched windows built in the 5th century are named, uh, sorry, made of sheets of selenite. That's 1500 years ago, that's yeah. incredible isn't it? Amazing it? and it stood that it time. Stood, wow. Um, selenite not glass. Um, after large amounts of gypsum were found near Paris um, in France, a material known as plaster of Paris was mm. created. Plaster of Paris is gypsum that has been chemically altered to extract the colour within. It's also said French farmers use raw gypsum as a soil additive. Oh. Here is wow. that church. So those windows were 5th century that's incredible, and they're selenite. It? That's what you can see on the inside. So beautiful, isn't it? It plays with light unlike any other material that I can think of. That's stunning. It gives this lovely kind of bluish like aura yes, about yeah. it. Um, but as I mentioned, it is hugely, hugely popular within the metaphysical side of, uh, um, gem of the gemstone world. Uh, they say gemstone selenite is most closely associated with the crown chakra, which represents wisdom and spirituality, as well as the third eye chakra. The colourless beauty and translucency of selenite is often attributed to purity and peace in both metaphysical beliefs and colour theory. Selenite is excellent to use when meditating or trying to achieve mental clarity. Oh. Um, it is believed to compel the person holding it to be honest with themselves as well. So I remember having a conversation with Gemma Crow some years back in actual fact, and she was saying, I think it was her son, she, he, was having str uh, he was struggling concentrating during his exams, and she gave him a piece of selenite and put it on his desk and... Oh you know, word. he really managed to knuckle down thereafter. Yeah. Um, so many words attached to this beautiful gemstone. And this is the colourless variety, but also in its coloured variety. Serenity, purification, peace, uh, meditation, universal consciousness, clarity of thought, purity of heart, universal love, integrity, spirituality, psychic development, forgiveness and positive thoughts. You see all of those words when you look at Sunlight. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It is one of those gemstones. There's not a negative whenever I look at mm. this gem. Do you know what I mean? There's not a negative emotion that you can feel, I don't think anyway, when you're looking at selenite. Um, so Mark's number one gemstone of the year is the launch of coloured selenite. Mm, without doubt. Not without only do you get the beautiful colours and all those emotions attached, you also mm. get a phenomena with selenite, don't you? This well, magical chatoyancy. And I think, I think with the aid of colour, it just transforms it. Yeah, it, it, it makes it more it. obvious. Yes, yeah, yeah. Now, team that with one of the most beautiful designs, quite possibly in Jewelry Maker history. Well, we've given it its own name. I mean, it's, it's tubular netting. That's, that's what it is. Yeah. If, you, if you've gone to YouTube and put in tubular netting, this is what comes up. And I, I coined this Kiss Cross. It must be, it must be nine years, eight or nine years ago when I did my first Swarovski DVD. Yeah. It was, and it was a little project perched on the end of a DVD to make up the hour. And it's, yeah. And it's just completely. It just, it just yeah. took I, the world I think by storm. Because it, it is so simple. And I've said, and I've shown so many times, I can teach you how to do this in five minutes. And, we, and we've, we've proved that time and time again. But I also do mm. get it, you know, people might watch mm. a demonstration on air, Mark, and go, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then time passes, your mm. kit arrives, and it's like, okay, I've forgotten what I watched. You can watch it back on YouTube. Yeah. But today is the first time, Mark, that you've actually put it down in writing. In writing. I've done two previously, but only the little stations, yeah. you know, the little sections. I've never done a full splicing the ends together to make the bangle. So the bangle is brand new. The necklace I've, I've made previously and it, it's exactly the same technique. So whether you want to make a bangle to start, to, to learn when you're new to the technique, is a really good way to start the bangle. I don't know if you can get the bangle on. You've, you might be able to, just down in the front Oh, yeah, there. yeah, yeah. Here you go. So, yeah, so, so start off with a bangle to get to know the technique and how to splice the ends, and then you then build up to your... I mean, it's not, it's not a quick make. This necklace took me seven hours. Yeah. So, so do a little section, come back to it later on. And, and oh, look at yeah. that. That's so beautiful, yeah. Mark. Talk about a vision of summer. It's lovely. It's so beautiful. And, it, and I've used gold 11 O's in this design, but if you use silver, it will look completely different. Completely different, just depending on the, the on the colour. Is that the first bangle? Yes, I've never done a bangle before, ever. <laughs> I love it. 
Does it go on all right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Look at how beautiful I've that is. I've never made a bangle. I've never, I've, I've done station bangles before, but I've never, and I've made kiss cross bangles with a clasp, but I've never done a 360 bangle I before. I love that, Mark. So that's a first for me. Yeah. That's absolutely beautiful. And you've got, so you've got seven, I've used all seven colours from the kit, so you can use, you've got seven colours of outfit that you can go with this as wow. well. Wow. So again, Amazing. For, for summer holiday, you only need to take that piece with you on a summer holiday yeah, and did, then yeah. everything else will match. I totally agree. And do you know what yeah. I love about this so much as well? Because mm. it, it, it flexes. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. it's not rigid. No, it's no, not no. going to, it's not going to bang about no. firstly. No. You've got no. a lovely sort of flexibility to this design. Yeah. So it's really comfortable to wear. And the netting is also protecting the gemstone as yeah. well. Because, because like fluorite, it, it's quite a soft stone. So for necklaces and earrings, it's absolutely fine. But because you've got that netting, it's protecting the gemstones as yeah, well. Yeah, so absolutely. It's, oh, I'm glad you like it. It's stunning, yeah. Mark. Yeah. I absolutely love that. Um, now, jewellery makers, this is very limited. It's also oh. so, so, so popular. Um, you have the instructions, which I think, Mark, you know, even if we weren't bringing the project components which I'll, obviously i'll show you in a second even if we were just saying okay your mm. would, would it's just this it is just this our phone lines would would light up wouldn't they you get this for free now with this project you have not one not two not three seven strands mm -hmm. of your colored sel uh, selenite you've got a mix so this one's your brights and then we've got your pastels um, I love the brights because they're not too bright either. No, no, no. no and no. then if you look just down the front, you also get a selection of your elastics too, of which there is... Seven, they match the colours. Seven. Oh, do yeah, they? Yeah. So yeah, you can literally yeah. just do stretchy bracelets. Yeah, so you've got an orange, you've got a yellow, you've got a green, you've got the indigo and the blue, and then you've got the pink and the red. Yeah. Can you see that? Is that block in yeah. the way? So depending on what, so depending on the colour of the elastic you use, if you colour coordinate with the strand, it makes the colour even more intense yeah. because you've got that cord, that elastic going through the centre. So gorgeous! What's not to love? Sixty seconds to graphics. We do this to make it fair for everybody. Whether you shop on the web, the phone lines, the app, whichever it might be, we have less than 100. 86 is not as big a quantity as we no, would like no. with something like this. And for the first time, Mark has actually done the tutorial literally from start to finish on the Kiss Cross. Which 24, take 24 piece. 24 stages. Yeah, 24 stages. I mean, that would have taken yeah. you hours. Mm. That on its own. <laughs> never, never mind the hours that it took to create the, the actual necklace and bracelet. Hours to actually write the instructions for you and you get that for free. Plus free postage and packaging, jewellery makers. If you do oh, have yeah. any questions for Mark, then do text in. Um, if you're watching at, what is it, 25 past nine in the morning, um, we are live. If you're watching on the repeats, we're not live. We're probably at home. Um, but but yeah, you text in if you've got any questions to Mark. I love. Have you got a favourite colour? I think the green. I think that green is absolutely beautiful. It is lovely. Yeah. No, I love them. I, love I like them the all. orange. I yeah. think. So the the bracelet on the end is the orange and the yellow, and that again that's on a stretchy little stretchy. The auction is live. Oh. Yeah, they're amazing, Mark. I knew it. I, yeah, yeah, we knew it. There was a reaction immediately. The instructions, the elastics, and then seven strands of beautiful selenite in your bright colours. You know, I don't often. I'm not. I'm not very good with bright colours in my clothing, but I love bright colours mm. and accessories. Mm. So something like this yeah, would be yeah. right up my Absolutely. street. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. You know, we've we've been seeing lots of occasions, like you said, Ascot was um, this week. You know, can you imagine that necklace, at Ascot, for Ladies' mm. Day? Caution stock confirmed. Oh, wow. And we haven't even brought the price to her yet. You get 20, uh, even, not even a single price. Ross is liking the mm. yellow. Yeah. They're lovely colours. I like the, yeah, I like the orange. Lovely. And I'll show you the, the organisation of the gemstones to make the harlequin pattern, because if you notice, it, there's not, it's not, um, a, no, it's definitely it's arranged. not a section that's then mirrored and mirrored, but it, I show you the order to yes, help put them Yes, because I suppose you wouldn't want to have like two colours no, next to each other because no, no, no. that would stand out, wouldn't yeah, yeah, it? Yeah, absolutely. So even that has to be yeah, thought yeah, about. Yeah, that's all been organised as well. So that, again, that's in the instruction booklet as well. Wow. The layout wow. of the gemstones. You get that jewellery makers for free. Twenty first time ever actually having the full kiss cross in a step-by-step -step instructions. Um, 
seven strands of beautiful selenite, 38 centimeter strands as well, jewelry makers. All this knowledge that you can print off, sorry, Adam, Ava, um, all this knowledge that you can print off and save, you know, so you don't, 24 steps. So mm. even down to, Mark was saying he's demoed this once, even down to this, how you actually join them. Mm. It's a lot of work, absolutely. You know, and the kind of instructions that you would have to pay anywhere else, Mark, you'd pay a lot mm. of money for, wouldn't you? Mm. Okay. First price crash, look at the call screens, Mark. I haven't even brought a price to A yet. I've no idea where we're going. We've also ah. got it in full way <laughs> split pay, so. Wow. I the don't know how much I'd charge for that necklace. You I, know. I, hang on, seven mm. hours work. Beautiful so, seven. So, right? so the necklace and the instructions, that's, that's 10 hours. Say that again. The ne making the necklace and doing the tutorial was 10 hours. Right, so I've just heard a price in the gallery and I totally wholeheartedly agree. If you were to sell that piece, you've got to remember it. I, I, I think, yeah, what? if you said 500 pounds or more, oh, I wouldn't be surprised. I mean, the amount of time that it creates, and it mm. is a beautiful, it takes to create it, and it is a beautiful gemstone. I'd expect it to be mm. those figures. Wow. Definitely more than what's on your screens. So, hello. Uh, how could you make the bangle on elastic, says, uh, says Barbara. Or, oh, sorry, could you? Yes, yeah, so what you, what you, the only way you could do it is to... Yeah, because you wouldn't be able to join the two, unless, no, you wouldn't be able to do that. So you can use elastic, but you'd have to have, you wouldn't be able to splice the ends together. Right. Because once you splice the ends together, you wouldn't be able to, and I don't, yeah. think, I don't think you can crisscross with elastic because that, of the drill hole size. That bracelet has got an amount of give, hasn't yeah, it? Yeah, There's a certain yeah. flexibility to it, and yes. that's done with what, yeah. wildfire? Yes. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. I don't think you need the elastic, to be honest. No, no. Um, Hello to Karen no. in Whitchurch saying, Morning, Alan Mark, beautiful work as always. How many bangles could I make from the seven strands? That's a good question. So I think in the instruction steps, yeah, let me pass it to you I'll show you, let me have a quick look. I actually Where tell I you how many, how many beads you need. This is not um, your price, by the way, and half the stock has gone. So for each bangle, you need 15 of each colour. Okay. So seven times 15. So if you put that to one side, 105, that figure. Yeah. And then seven times 380 divided by six. Yeah, divided by six. Yeah. And then divide that by a hundred and so it's four bangles, isn't it? You can make four bangles with some left over. Yes, yeah, so at least four bangles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seriously, yeah, you yeah. can make this times four out of your yeah. one project. And I made, I made that whole neck. I made that whole necklace as well, and there were a few left over as well. Oh, uh, yeah, I would have assumed that was one project, yeah. Oh, oh my no, no, goodness. No. Hello, RuPaul, say, Mark, your jewellery is beautiful. I am in awe of your skills. Can't wait to see receive the project. Mm. Oh, it's beautiful, RuPaul. I always give a disclaimer when, when you take on the Kiss Cross. It is so addictive. Yeah. It is so incredibly... You, you want to kiss, cress, kiss Cross everything. That spinel we had earlier, the little cubes. Yeah. If you, if you took out the 11 O's and used 15 O's instead and made that... That look incredible. Oh, it would have like yeah, angles and everything, be wouldn't it? Be um, June and Surrey, Mark is saying good morning, Mark and Elle. Morning, lovely. I've Aww. ordered mine. I fell in love with Selenite when you first launched it. It's an it amazing stone. Thanks, Jory Megan. I absolutely love it. It really is mm. beautiful. So many messages coming through. Um, Tracy in Norfolk, the bangle is a game changer. Genius, Mark. As I said, I've been doing this now for eight years and it's the first bangle I've uh, made. Yes. <laughs> and I love it because it's yeah. it literally, look. It's flexible. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So and and the more you wear it, the more flexible it will become because the the wildfire will relax. Oh so my slightly. goodness! Yeah, yeah. 
Kathy is saying, what is the inside dimension of the bangle? My wrist demands, well, you could, I suppose you could make it to make it fit. To make it to fit. That's what I did with this one. So I, I made a, a strip and then held it on my wrist. Yeah. But you need to make sure that it goes over this part of your hand. Yeah. If I can just show a, a, Eva, this part of your hand, because that's the widest yeah. part across the four knuckles there. So as long, so I held, I made a, a, a length of the kiss cross tubing and then made sure that it would go around my wrist. And when I could easily get it on and off, I then splice the two ends together. There you go. Yeah. There you but go. But I think that I think that's probably about. I mean, it's fitting my hand, so that's going to be I don't know seven inside. I think yeah. seven centimeters inside. Um, Deborah in Merseyside, it is yeah. it is addictive. I can't stop, says Deb. No, yeah, absolutely. No. But look at the end result, though. This is a good addiction, isn't it? I mean, look how beautiful. How beautiful yeah. are the comments that you're going to make? We've got so many messages, oh, we're not, Mark. We're moving. Um, no, we're not stopping there. We're not stopping there. Yeah. You've got to remember, if you can make four bracelets, that's fifty pound a bracelet. I but, wouldn't sell that for fifty quid. <laughs> no, definitely not. Um, we're going lower. Tina in Bristol. Hi, Mark. Oh. Fantastic jewelry. Um, how do you work out where to place the selenite in the memory wire bangles? So this is. There's method in my madness. So if you see the gap in between, it's always an odd number. Um, so I think with this one, it looks as though it's. Th it, I've got the selenite, yeah. and then I've got um, a six O gun metal, then an eight O, and then eleven Os. If I always make the eleven Os either nine, eleven, or thirteen. Okay. And then I don't know what I think it's the, the size of the coil on the memory wire, but all of the stones all line up every single time. If it's you do really, odd numbers. If you do odd numbers. If you do if oh. you do um, even numbers. They're quite sporadic. Oh, okay. Yeah. So if you want that arrangement, and yeah, they so have nine, to have so yeah, so nine, that. eleven, or thirteen, eleven O's in between. That's a bit and of me. That and you'll is. get that zigzag. Um, I love these, Mark. Yeah. Absolutely love these. Shall we get the price on the move? Because that's not where we're stopping. Okay. So for seven strands, full thirty-eight centimeter strands of your bright selenite, where you get that lovely magic, that chatoyancy. Um, these are eight mils. Is that right? Six. Six. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you can kiss cross with eight, but obviously it's going to be so heavy okay. to use. Six mil. So, yeah. Then you get the, the seven elastics. They come along with it yeah. as well. So even if you did something as simple as stretchy bracelets, yeah. plus you get, for the first mm. time ever, start to finish, wow. the instructions. It covers everything you need to know with your Harlequin Kiss Cross necklace. How to arrange the colours, how to start, yep. how to finish. We're at 149 and we are still not done, Mark. Still not done. We said earlier on, you know, how much would that uh, Kiss Cross necklace be sold? 65% of the stock's gone. I think 500 plus. Wow. Yep. Do, we, do you agree, Adam? I mean, absolutely. That bracelet, two fifty. What do you reckon? Wow. If you put if mm. two nine nine, yeah. If you put if I walk past and I know it depends. Ross thinks more. It it is bespoke. You're right. <clears throat> it depends where you sell it. But you need to. <clears throat> Sorry. It's an investment of your time. And it's beautiful. <laughs> it's like a bouquet of flowers literally around, yeah, your, yeah. around your wrist. Yeah, yeah. Amazing. That's the cost of two decent bouquets of flowers as well, yeah. isn't it? 100 quid. Absolutely. <laughs> oh, that's mad. If we were to get, yeah, if we were to bring you this as a showcase as opposed to a project, seven separate strands. Mm. Oh, Ross says, I, see. I yeah. think you'd be able to get three strands for that price. Because yeah. they are part of the projects, so you're getting all seven, you're getting the elastic and you're getting the instructions as well, jewellery makers. Um, we said you can make four bracelets out of this uh, project. That's £25 mm. per bracelet. I mean, how amazing is that to make? To make, all you need to do is add some of your wildfire and some 11 O's. Yeah. And you can learn how to do it. I mean, I keep saying this, and as I said, we've... we've We've proved it live on air a couple of times now that I can teach you, well, the instruction will teach you how to do this in five minutes. Yeah. Five Look minutes. Look at the end result. Yeah. That's why it's so addictive because it is so easy to learn. It's so methodical. It's you, you, you place your gemstones for the first round, 
then you see beads, then you gemstones, so you see beads. So you can't go wrong. No. You can't go wrong at all. No. Another yeah. question for yeah. you, Wendy. Hi, Mark. I've got the kit. Will I be able to yes. make both a necklace and the bracelet? Yes. Your designs are simply stunning. Yep. Really? Yep. So wait, ninety nine, ninety nine, yeah, and you yeah. get you can make both. Both. Yep. And the necklace is thirty. I think the necklace is thirty inch. I worked it out. So obviously you can, as long as you can, again, you measure the widest part of your head to be able to get it over your head. Yeah. Uh, or you can pop a clasp on. So the instructions allow you to pop a clasp on if you want to as well. Do you so, know, yes. I love the fact that it's yeah. claspless. Claspless. I like that because it just, it's, it's, mm. it's, it's uninterrupted then, kiss cross, isn't it? Yeah. Amazing. This will sell out. Um, in terms of quantity, how many do we have left, Roscoe? 19 as it stands right. but there's way more than 19 people with it in their baskets angela's just snapped up three maker and oxford has right. just got two uh maker's just got two lanark has got three so you get the idea um there's loads you get involved look at that beautiful quality of selenite as well and those amazing colors um do you know so this will sell out it's only a matter of time we do have some of the paler pastel colors um, in different sizes in both. different sizes yeah, yeah. yeah where well, we'll talk about those pieces yeah. after your demonstration, Mark. So good luck. I'll keep you updated on uh, quantities, but let's just say you need a bit of urgency now. Um, over to you, Mark. Amazing. So I, uh, what I had a lot of fun with were, were these, um, these funky yes. little elastic bracelets. They're so cute. And again, I kept two. This and, that's, and that's got the yeah. coloured elastic in? This has got the coloured elastic in. If I just, yeah, you can see I've used the purple with the purple inside here so what i thought i'd show is these these tiny little peyote spacers which are great fun yeah because you you, yep. you get the kiss cross instructions anyway yep. don't yeah, you yeah. yep so i mean you can you can do this as kiss cross as well i'm just trying to work out i don't think you can do it with elastic because the elastic will be too thick mm. to do the actual threading and you won't i don't know i've never tried it with elastic and obviously once you've you've spliced your two ends together there's no give to have yeah. the elasticity so i think you can do it but you'd have to use broken ends or a clasp but okay. then you wouldn't elasticate with a clasp would you so mm, not really. i'll experiment i'll have an experiment have a try I'll have an experiment. good question though yeah, yeah yeah so this this is really cool as well and again you you can make these in in seconds so what you're going to need so i've gone for antique bronze and the green i think they just go so well yeah, together lovely. so well together that's very Amazonite s colours, isn't it? It's just lovely, and I, and um, you can always tell the quality of the selenite is fantastic because even though it's covered in netting, you can mm. still see all of that yeah. amazing the colour and the yeah, chatoyancy. Yeah, it's just it's incredible quality. It really is. Okay, so I've got on my needle. This is a size ten needle, so you don't even have to use a fine needle. And this is your six pound white fire line. Um, you only need, I don't know, a foot and a half, something like that, for each of your little spacer beads. So first of all, we're going to pop on a stopper bead. So this is an 11-0, different to the colour that you're using. Okay, so I've popped on my little stopper bead. And you can, you can use any amount of uh, seed bead rows to make your little... Um, spaces i've just gone for four okay because i think that's that's probably the, about the size of a six mil round so, so I, it's the perfect size so we're going to go for the four so again this is your basic peyote so we're going to pick up our four 11 o's two three four and we're going to slide those down so it meets our gold 11 o and then i find it easier to hold it in my left hand i'm not good at sewing towards me i know some of our um, guest designers able to sew in both directions but I always get in a mess and I always knot my thread mm -mm. so I always prefer to work away from me so I've turned the beading around so my stopper bead is at the top end and what we're going to do is we're going to pick up one 11 o, and we're going to jump the 11 o at the base of our beaded section and we're going to sew into the second so the first couple of rows are always a bit fiddly and then we're going to pick up an 11 0. We're going to jump one through one. So it's always jump one through one when you do your first section. Pull that through. Just 
just straighten out that last little bead at the bottom. There we go. Flip him if he doesn't want to flip over. There we go. We'll pick him up on the way back. Okay. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go back again. I've flipped the work over, so we're going to work away from me. And you can already see the little castellations, they're called the little sticky outies. So, what we're going to do is we're going to fill those two gaps. So, I'm going to pick up an 11 0, sew into the sticky outie, and then pick up my next 11 0 into the sticky outie. That nice and tight. And then I'm going to flip it over. And what you're going to do is you're just going to repeat filling in the gap. So you're only going to pick up two beads each row. So 11 0 into the 11, into the gap, into the gap. This is, again, this is why I really like peyote because you, do, you don't have to overthink it because the beads do all the mm. work. They tell you what it to do. It shows you. Yeah. So we've got, what we're going to do is we want 12 rows. So six beads along the top and six, six beads along the bottom. I'm just going to jump the gap. As I said I've gone for four rows. If you're going for an eight mil round, you might want to do something slightly larger. So it's all about just experimenting with size. Put nice and tight. I'm not one for complicated. So anything is e anything that's easy. But looks beautiful at the end. I'm, I'm all for. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> I'm all for. I always love watching you see bead mark. It's always very calm. Flip it over. And don't forget free potion packaging this weekend as well. As I said, bottle of wine. Yeah. Back in your pocket. So we're just going to check. So I've got four along the top on the bottom so we just need to do a couple more and then we can zip up which is it's well worth the five minutes making the bead nice and tight flip it over so I always flip it over it's much I find it much easier so that's five along the bottom and five along the top I think yep so we've got one more each row. Put that nice and tight. Oh no. 12 of the projects left in our vault and there are 56 people with it in their baskets. That maths doesn't work out, does it? No. Plus no. free potion packaging and full way split pay. So if you are Christine, Carolyn, Jacqueline, Donna, Karen, Denise, Kate, Carol, Kathy, Jane, Andrea, Karen, Kaz, Barbara, and those are the names I can see. Um, we have still got one more project to bring you, but just to give you a heads up, this is very limited now. Love these, Mark. And you can just kind of sit and do lots of little make lots of little spaces effectively yeah, aren't yeah, they absolutely so just make sure we've got one two three four five six one two three four five six and what if it's, it's you should have your stopper bead and your working thread mm. on the same row which we've got perfect so all we're going to do then is just going to fold our work over in half and all we're going to do is move my stopper is I'm on the left hand side so we're going to go across to the right So, make sure we don't catch our stopper. Then we're going to go across and up the left side. And then across and up the right. Across and up the left. And pull that nice and tight. Like so. So we've got our little, our round little cylinder of 11 O's. Pretty. And then all we're going to do is we're going to get back up to our stopper bead. So all I'm going to do is just wiggle across until I get to the top. So again, always going from left to right, left to right. And then go to the left. 
And then we've then met our, so we're going to take our stopper bead off and then we're going to join the two ends together and this will make a nice cylinder. So with a single knot followed by another knot and then don't just cut your thread at the knot because it might, the knot might come undone. So all I, all I always do is I go, so away from the knot, go down 111.0, come across and go up the next and then go across and down the next and then you're safe then to go in, cut off your threads, one and two. And then just what I did is I made lots of these first of all and then I decided what the design I was going, yeah. to, I was going to make. And then all I've done with this bracelet here is I've gone for the yellow and the orange and I've made little sections. So I've popped a, a, a little stopper in between, little spacer section in between the yellow and an orange and then in between the two it's yellows It's gorgeous, again. it's like a sunset. And they're really cool. And it's just a really nice little embellishment. And with the added yeah, uh, um, yeah. addition of the elastics of too. Of the elastics running through as well. Yeah. Which just really heightens the colour as well. Yeah. So it's fantastic. Yeah, Absolutely it's Absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. Mark, we've got seven left. Wow. We literally have seven left. And this is it. This, uh, there's no more six mil rounds. Okay. Mm. Are we are we endeavouring to get more in we're the future? We're trying. We're trying. I should imagine it's really yeah. difficult because look yes. how beautiful yeah. it is. Yeah. But the, that, that that little bracelet there just looks like kunzite, doesn't it? Yes. Uh, you know, that, I'd sell that for twenty. The best quid. kunzite. Yeah. I'd sell that for twenty quid on its own. That's just a simple stretchy with a little. Do you? Yeah, Ross thinks you're underselling uh, it. It's just it's just for beautiful. selenite and yeah. also your 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 yeah. and I made talent. those um those little matching earrings as well look and that's so I've just oh, yes. made, made I've just made the little <gasps> beads the little spaces and popped them on looks like best aquamarine doesn't it <laughs> just lovely oh, and again, just, just look. So, so just use those little little spaces on the bottom of your yeah they're so they're really beautiful cool. aren't they. Really and that's using simple. what four stones, yeah, and then a few of your and that little beads. little CB technique I just showed you there. Stunning, really stunning, simple. stunning. Um, here we go. Oh. A simple selenite stretchy in white, <sighs> though forty nine pounds. Wow. And that's by the way old prices. We've been showing that. Yeah, it's about two three years. I agree, Russ. Oh right. Wow. So yeah, it'd probably be about what do you reckon seventy five now? Gosh, right. And I know they've got overheads and it depends where, but selenite is incredibly popular as a gemstone. Mm. And it's very difficult to get hold of too. I'd never seen it. I'd never heard of it until we brought it to the very show. Cool. So it was, it was like magic to me. I'd never yeah. seen anything like it. It is magic. And, and yeah. I can't talk about selenite. And we've got one more project to bring you as well without showing you the selenite caves photo. Because this oh. is just mind blowing. So imagine, um, and the little orange figures that you're about to see are people. Wow. Look at that. It's crazy, isn't it? It's like pillars of selenite. Amazing. You'd never catch me going underground. Not mm. even not even to see that. <laughs> no, I, I mean, I have done. I've done potholing when oh, I was younger. The no, thought of no, doing no. it now, no. No, no, no. No, well, I'm fairly sure I'd get stuck now. <laughs> but before, when I was like, you know, when I was like a slight teenager, I used to do it. And you're brave then, aren't you? Um, look, five oh. selenite rounds on simple check. quid? Yeah. It's not hard, is it, to make that? Oh, my word. That's amazing. Ross is saying that's stretching a minimum of 50. Wow. I think so. I think so. Especially Gosh. on places like Etsy. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. Amazing. The final five. Uh, mm. Hello to you, Susie, saying such a clear demo, Mark. Thank you. How do you plan the design on the beautiful memory wire bracelets? So, if I These take, ones. Yeah. yeah do you so, want to? so, first of all, you need to decide on the number of coils that you want. Okay, so I've gone for... Uh, uh, I'll try oh, if I, I haven't can. done that very well, oh, sorry. sorry. I'll try if I can to do odd numbers. Okay, so if I turn it round. Yeah. And always make sure when you cut your memory wire, that you start and finish in the same place. Can you see that's the start yeah. here and that's the finish. And those both ends will then go under the wrist. So yeah. you, won't, you won't see those ends. And then you need then for this one, for example, as I mentioned earlier with the number of seed beads, you choose a number of 11 O's. So I always go for nine, 11 or 13. 
then choose your pop in your gemstone and then you can embellish either side to make even more of a feature of it. So you can see with this one here and with the yellow and green, I've popped a larger bead either side just to make a more of a feature of it. Yeah. And then all you do then is you just keep going and keep going with the same combination. So with this one, I've alternated between the pink and the Kunzite purple colours. Oh, look, at, look yeah. I've done that, Mark. That's, right, don't worry. That's the only don't reason worry. it's not sitting right, yeah. is it? There but, um, but if you stick with the, the odd number of seed beads in between your beads, you'll get that uniformity or the zigzag pattern. Love that. So that's what gives it, you that it diagonal. It lines. Yeah. Love yeah. it. Yeah. I've got three left of this project. Make that two. Oh. Angela's just taken us to two. I like the fact it's all four-way split as well. Yeah. That's lovely. 57 wow. people with it in their baskets. You can't say we didn't warn you. Um, and there's nothing else in the vault. So it would have to be a reorder. Oh, you get a different... Um, oh, yeah, you get a different... This one. You get that You get the, for that necklace there, which is all about um, mandalas. And oh, things. Mark, that's yeah. so pretty. So you can see... The pastels, if you think mm. about, I don't know, like um, your ice creams. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah, those yeah, kind of pastel it palettes. It is. It is gorgeous. In yeah. fact, Roscoe, uh, um, I will ask for this anyway with the Vivi Green um, Angel Eye, but do you remember the, yes, the other day when we spoke about Peacock Angel Eye? And there's a section within a presentation that talks about the pastel colours and why they are, why we gravitate, why we actually gravitate mm. towards them so much. You know how lots of the big brands use pastel palettes it's almost this mark it, it is, is literally yeah, yeah. this project yeah, yeah. that they that they could have literally just mm. photographed themselves um yeah here we go it says pastel palette is not something invented by us rather it's an, uh, a gift of oh. nature you can find pastel colors in a lot of natural elements like the sky water flowers fruits wood pebbles and even across species look how pretty that fish is gorgeous look at that tail oh, that's a male is it? Male, that's a Siamese fighting fish. Is yeah. it? Yeah. Oh, so they're not so friendly then? No. No. Not okay. with each other. No. Not they're with each friendly other. with females. Are they? <laughs> Fair enough. But not with other males. Um, yeah. And of course, premium jewellery brands like Tiffany's and Co. Um, premium jewellery brands like Tiffany's are a prized possession for customers. The jewellery is delicate uh, and to be taken care of. Mm. So they're using those pastel palettes there. Then. I had a box of those chocolates sometimes. They're back very then. expensive. You get them at garden centres. Are they? Yeah, they're very expensive. They're truffles, aren't they? Are oh they? yeah, champagne truffles. Yeah. I think I was gifted them by someone. Um, there you go. Wow. Well, uh, truffles speak the language of love and romance. Using soft tones of teal, pink, and white gives a balmy look. The metallic text is the cherry on the cake. But again, look at that palette mm. right, right yeah. there in that photograph. It's literally this project that you're about to see. You've got the soft greens, the soft blues, the soft pinks, um, all available. What are you thinking? I've been keeping an eye on that list and I think the kit's just sold out. Oh, I, think. I think one left one. is there. Literally oh. one remaining. So again, wow. pastels, mm. lots of us gravitate towards it, but Mother Nature, is that, as it said mm. at the beginning there, yeah. um, you know, you think about the beauty of the sky above us. Do you like know what our first, our first um, dealings with pastel tones, and it's just popped into my head. Do you remember um, Love Hearts, the sweets? Yes. They're all pastels. Nice. Yeah, or that little sweetie necklace that you wear and you yes. buy. Yes. That's all pastels. Yes. Have you got, have you got, yeah. Oh, look at this. Look how, pretty, look how beautiful that is. Even yeah. the pink yeah. of the sun, sunset, I assume, or sunrise, yeah. whichever. Look how stunning that is. I want to be there right oh. now. That looks so lovely. But no, gorgeous, I love, I yeah. I like pastels. Um, okay, now we have less. These of are, these available these are amazing they're stunning and they do come in different sizes as well jewelry oh, I think you get you get a tube of 11s in this one as well do I you think. yeah yeah yeah. okay i'm oh, gonna drag this across the back of my hand so 10 yeah look at that she told it is incredible eight mm -hmm. yeah yeah can i graduate kiss cross you can so all you would do is you would start with your six O's with the number 11 O's and then you go to the eight, then all you do is you up the amount of 11 O's you use and then you then you detract the amount of 11 O's you use. Exactly, the, the technique doesn't change. All you do is you just add more C beads. You say love hearts, Mark. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Oh, look, 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 how funny. <laughs> oh, amazing. My angel. Oh. Grow up. I'm not 
not sure that's something you want to put. Love you, true. What's uh, that? True hold... lips. True lips. <laughs> what? Are these appropriate ones? I'm not really sure. You can get adult ones, can't For, you? Can you? Yeah. Hold, hold me. me. Oh. Hang on. No, no, Ross. It's not really appropriate because just there is one on there which maybe is not TV worthy. Oh, it does. Yeah. Sorry. It's okay. I'm reading it wrong. Oh. <laughs> Panic them for a second. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Perfect. <laughs> Oh no. We have is that all? available. I think this is. <laughs> this is going to sell out. Wow. They're all candy floss <laughs> tones, aren't they? Yeah, stunning. <laughs> um, you can oh. use Mark's previous demonstration, but with this as well, I'm actually crying here. Um, you can you you can create this stunning necklace called the Selenite Sunrise. Mm -hmm. Oh, Mark, it's so pretty. How, how many how many sets steps uh, are in this one? Don't know. Should I have a look? Yeah. I think it's quite a few in this one as well, isn't there? Um, twenty three in that one. Twenty three steps in that yeah. one. Okay. Um, graphics alive plus you get your tube yeah don't put that one up there's no, some horrible ones there's some there. horrible ones on that yeah, um, yeah. one in the middle in yellow uh, <laughs> <laughs> how is that love hearts when did love hearts become Ooh. what's that oh yeah the gen z ones yeah what's that mean people lauren's age oh. young, youngsters yeah. yeah love hearts are meant to be nice yeah nice that's i love that recording that's so beautiful yeah. and you can see that movement can't you that lovely chatoyancy that naturally occurs um it matches our graphics today as well yeah. yep. jewelry makers we only have 50 of these available here is that necklace um and these i mean look just them on a pair of earrings mark yep and i've done the um the marla as well with the again that's peyote which i just showed you and this is using Atos with a longer spacer in between. And all you do is you just knot it, you treat it as a bead. It's all so yeah. pretty, Mark. And it's also wearable. Pastel mm. palettes complement absolutely yep. everybody, don't they? Absolutely. So these yeah. come with, this This project comes with three strands, um, but you get three different sizes. So if you wanted to follow the first instructions, if you got the first project, then you can do both. Absolutely. You can do both. Yep. Okay, but it's more limited, this opportunity. So. Two nine nine, and you get eleven O's. What colour is the eleven O's? Um, is it like a topaz. Thin... It looks like a topaz, doesn't it? It looks. It looks like a silver lined. Silver lined topaz, maybe. Yeah. Do you know, Russ? The colour of the sea beads. Yeah, it looks a bit. Hang on. Glow Sorry, on your Ava. Hand look. There we are. There we go. That was me. That was totally wow. me. I just, it was bothering me that they were creeping into this project. I think these are more of an intense pastel than when I first had them. Oh, They're really? Pretty, yeah, I'm looking at you on the back of your hand there, that colour's quite an intense pastel. They're so pretty. They're lovely, aren't the they? The pinks. Dark oh, gold. Dark gold. There we go. Perfect. Dark gold colour. I Perfect. mean, you look at some of these and think, oh, it's like fruit pastels and yeah. sweets, isn't it? Yeah. So beautiful. We're at £99.99. And you get the three strands, but also remember these go up to 10 millimetres in their size. Six, eight and ten. £79.99. Now, we have 50. It is far more limited than the previous. Half mm. the stock has already gone. There's still one of the previous kit. That's better, Roscoe. All you need is no, love. That's I love you. Kiss me. You're hot. I remember the you're hot ones. Do yeah. you? Yeah. We're talking about the love hearts. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't just. <laughs> yeah, oh. all of a sudden, I was just. I'm just claiming my love for everybody. I think you can get personalised ones where you can put your own messages on as can well. Can you? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, can oh, it's you? for Adam, that one. Yeah. What? what which you're one? hot. You're hot. You're hot. It's yeah. Adam's love heart right there. Yeah, there we go. Ah, yeah. they are nice. Well, the all you they? need is love would have to be Ross's, wouldn't it? Definitely Ross's. Yeah. 
Kiss me, kiss me. Is there a song called Kiss Me? Kiss me. Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 And then there's I love you always forever, near and far, once together. Oh. That one. There. there you go. Thread. Is there a song called Your Heart? Not really, but there is Looking for some heart. That is that oh, one. Oh, yeah. There yeah. is that one. <laughs> Oh yeah, baby, I love you, yeah. Um, well done, it's gonna sell out. <laughs> Regardless of our singing, or I should say mine, because you can only hear mine. Um, this project is absolutely flying out the door. I can't oh, believe that, Mark, 49.99. No. What was the first, what was the first kit? 99.99 for seven that. strands. Oh, that's amazing. So yeah, that's true. You yeah. can get the first yeah. project and this project for and the elastic pounds. and the seed beads and the two projects and ten strands. That's yeah. amazing, yeah. isn't it? Wow. And you can get it on 0 percent interest split payment as well. That's amazing. Well done, everybody. I love that song, Ross. I haven't heard that song in ages. Who is it by? The Ramones. Baby, I love you. Do you know that one, Mark? No. What's your favourite mm. love song? Careless Whisper. Is it? Yeah. Yeah, that's a good one. Oh. Careless Whisper. Yeah, without a doubt. That's a good one. What's your favourite love song, Ross? Here, There and Everywhere by the Beatles. Nice. Oh. Ah, it's a tricky one, isn't it? Mm. That is a tricky one. There is... Yeah, that's true. Do you know, so I've, this is a, not many people, I don't think I've told anybody this actually, I don't know what I'm telling the world now, but we, for our, our wedding, we wanted as our first dance, Crazy For You, Madonna, which, yeah. is, which is our favourite slow song. And we mulled it over for days before, thinking that's going to be too slushy, two blokes dancing in front of all these people to you, crazy. What's wrong with that? So at the morning of the wedding, we said, no, no, we, we can't, we need something else. And Islands in the Stream popped into our head. And that was our wedding song. We don't, ah. like, we don't like it very much. Oh. But, but it was, we just popped into our head and said, yeah, let's have that one instead. It's and that, good, though. That was, our first, that was our wedding song. We don't even like it. But we were so embarrassed <laughs> of dancing to Crazy For You. You should have done. We, we didn't do it. You should have yeah. done. Maybe we might now. 15 yeah. years later. But yeah, I always regret that. We, did, we didn't really have... Um, 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 a party as such because obviously I was heavily pregnant mm. with Willow but mm. we um oh, we did have a I walked down the aisle to um the piano guys version of um Christina Perry a thousand years Aww. which I heard I saw the other day it was on a playlist for sad songs it's not a sad no, song no, no. I've loved you for a thousand mm. years I love you for Aww. a thousand more that's not sad no it's no, nice no. it's nice um, anyway, we've gone completely off on a tangent, haven't we, here? Look at those beautiful pastels. It's the pastels, that's the that's thing. It's made us all it. romantic, hasn't it? <laughs> um, well done. I've got 11 of these left. Sally, well done. Angela's got three. Catherine, kathy has got two. Anne, West Midlands, wow. Kildare. Buckinghamshire, Rachel, Christine, Vivian, Christine. Alison's got three. Victoria, oh, I can't see that. So, it's really nice and quite humbling to see people buy more than one of a kit. Because they're, they're quite uh, a layout financially, and it's lovely the fact that we do the split pay now. And I oh, totally I think it's get, I totally yeah. get why people are there. Look how pretty mm, it is. Yeah. Um, hello, Margaret. Saying Joan. Um, Armour trading. Armour trading. Oh. Love and affection. Both myself and my uh, future <sighs> husband oh. bought the same album on the same day for that track. Oh, it was meant um, to be. Hang on. Yeah. Love and affection. I can't think of that one. Do you know it? No, no. Joan Armour trading. I know. She's amazing. I need to, I'll, yeah, I'll listen to it in the break. Yeah, yeah. I will listen to it in the break. Yeah, love that. Love that. There's so many nice mm. uh, love songs though, isn't there? Yeah. Beautiful. And um, Phyllis Nelson, Move Closer. Move that's another good closer. one. That's, yeah, that's, that's a good one. one. Yeah. yeah, like that. Mm. I've only got five left of this project. Well done. <laughs> Ads, what's your favourite? That's gorgeous, oh. that song. I love Which that. Which version? Leona Lewis's version is really nice. First time mm. ever I saw your face. That's beautiful, that song. Mm. Apparently a chap called Marlon Williams. Oh. Very nice. Mm. 
That is lovely. I think you've, yeah, that's a yeah, gorgeous song. Ah, yeah. oh, love it. Look, the pastels that's have made it is. all romantic. <laughs> all romantic. My, my best friend got married and still to this day, it's the most beautiful wedding I've ever been to. Mm. Still to this day. The flowers, the arrangement, it was just gorgeous. Um, it was all pastels was like it? this. Was it, it was literally all uh, pretty pastel colours and it was so beautiful. Um, well done, <gasps> everybody. Yeah, now, I've, I've got into so much trouble over these seed beads. Have you? I was told no on Monday. I was told no on Tuesday. I was told no, you can't have them on, on Wednesday because they were part of kits. And I think I've ground them down. So they're, <laughs> they're in. <laughs> You've worn them down. So they must have, I mean, I think they've taken them out of future kits you know to have you them, yeah to accommodate I, I think they have so why 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 have you been working so desperately to get these on air today what because we, we the whole thing about the kiss cross you need seed beads yes for anyone who doesn't have any seed beads it would be nice to have them okay there are now oh, perfect colors as well look here we go oh. i'll turn them that way so you can actually see the colors so I'm going to start with... What have we got? These lovely colours. So I have to thank... She's probably watching. I have to thank Katie for um, giving in. These aren't just any old sea beads, though. These are delicas. Amazing. Which were Can beautiful. I still do kiss Yeah, yeah. They, so they would go in the centre of the netting. They would sit in... <gasps> so they'd be the kisses in the middle of the crosses. They'd be beautiful. And look at those colours for the pastels like and... And the seven stranders. That one's so pretty, isn't it? Yeah. So... Um, Descriptions, they're all eight O's. Perfect. Blue iris, lined line, which oh. I assume is that one. Yeah. And then you've got the topaz. Beautiful. Oh, so pretty. I they can't remember work. the last time yeah. I saw these. No, I don't know where they found them. I'm not going to ask. <gasps> are we Are we not helping your cause No. Yet? Oh dear, okay. so, that's yeah. brilliant. Get them whilst you can. How would you describe a delica? Because they're a different shape to a normal Mayo. So, aren't so they? a delica is they cut the tube and they sand the edges. So they're kind of like squared. So they're, so they're squared off, whereas a seed bead, they're still cut out of a tube, but they're round, the edges are round. Right, okay. That's the difference. I see. Yeah. Is there quantity, Roscoe? So for the, um, the little demo I showed you of the little peyote spacer beads, delicas are perfect for that. Okay. Amazing. How many did he say? 40. Not enough, is no. it? Not for a Saturday morning. I'm just thinking that, that all of those three with the pastels. Oh, it'd be so yeah. beautiful, wouldn't they? Yeah. Shall I hold them together? Would that help? So if you've got any of these projects, they I think they're stunning they on that white background. Yeah. They? Here we go. Oh yeah, yeah, perfect. Oh yeah, they yeah, look lovely. Dead on. Yeah, all of those. Stunning, absolutely stunning. Make sure you're checking out your baskets, jewelry makers. These will sell out. You try and get a tube of delicas for three pound thirty-three online. You it's won't. not just not gonna happen, is it? No, ever. Not gonna happen. No, no, that's a that's a bargain. Stunning, stunning, stunning. Um, wow. I'm still on the romantic love songs. I am. You just thought of another one. Which one? Something. Something in the way he. Yeah. I prefer Shirley Bass's version. Frank Sinatra said it, said it was the greatest love song I've ever written. Ah. Yeah. The other bundle. I thought you were going to say another Beatles song then. Um, um, here we go. So you've got the four Ooh, tubes in this one. 11 O's. These are your 11 mm. O's, which you definitely need, don't yep. you, for um, Mark's Kiss Crossing. Lovely colours. Um, and they work perfectly with the, um, the eight O's as well. They certainly That's brilliant. do. Brilliant. So this one is opaque purple. This one is raspberry lined. Raspberry lined? Hang on. It says, yeah, raspberry lined crystal I've never AB. Had raspberry lined anything before. Isn't that nice? I like it. They go lovely yeah. together as well. That's don't new they? to me. Then this one here is your silver lined gold AB. And this one is your metallic purple iris. Very For nice. For a tenor. All of that for a tenner. All of that for ten pounds. That's ridiculous. Amazing. 
Um, three pound. Wow. No, it's, no, it's not even no. three thirty-three, is 250. it? Two fifty. Two pound fifty, of course. Um, Vera, Denise, Janet, Elaine, Patricia, Sarah, Donna, Rupal, Pat, Lavinia, Jay, Marie, Vanessa, mm. Cheshire. How many have we got, Roscoe? Forty again. Oh, so they are quite limited. And they're on the yeah. verge of selling out as well. Wow. Um, now there's been a little bit of a swapperoony on um, on your deal of the days. Your deal of the day, which was originally going to be your uh, quartzite jade, is now tomorrow, and today we're going to bring you the okay. four leaf clover, which actually works better. To yeah, be yeah. Honest. Oh, it ties in with uh, it does. twelve o'clock, doesn't it? That's a lovely song. I love Joe Cocker. I think mm. he's brilliant. I love his voice. He's got quite a gruff yeah, voice, isn't he? Yeah. Um, Carol's enough. What was it? First dance was a uh, love lift us up where yeah, we belong. With Jennifer Warnes. Love it. Uh, Venetia saying good morning, Mark and Al. Uh, my ex, but still my best friend. And I loved my first, my last. Barry yeah, White. my everything. Yeah, lovely. Barry that White is another loss, great one. Yeah. Suzanne, my favourite oh. song uh, is Billy Joel singing um, And So It Goes. Oh, I don't Look know that one. Online. But I do oh, love okay. Billy Joel. Yeah. Or I love Joel. Or Joel. 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 It's quite cool, Joel. Um, I love, like, oh, yeah. she's always a woman oh, yeah, yeah. to me. Like yeah. that too. That's mm. a good one. Yes, oh. Suzanne. I'll look that up because I love Billy Joel. Yeah. Um, okay. Before we get into your deal of the day as promised we are about to bring you the vivid green angel light now there's 50 it's brand new it's never been on your screens previously before jewelry makers so um wow. this is first time there's no treatment whatsoever it it's amazing that a gemstone that was only discovered discovered relatively recently comparatively speaking and when it was discovered, it was thought only in blue. But actually, we've seen mm. some very rare offerings in peacock angelite. And as you all know, jewelry makers, we have none within our vault now. None. It's all sold out. This is even more scarce than that. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, the vivid right. green is even more scarce. Um, this is the only strand that we have available. Now, what we're looking at, and I'm going to read an article. These aren't my words, but I think, think it's beautifully written. It says, um, this is a sacred stone that stashed out of sight for many years and was only discovered in 1987. Wow. So this is as young as Adam. Yes. Um, in the mystical Inca lands of Peru. It sometimes but goes by the name anhydrite from the Greek term for without water. This is because angelite is born from parched areas where gypsum crystals, do you see the similarities yes, to this, this yeah, hour as well? Yes, yeah. um, where gypsum crystals once sat in, in the company of water. As the thousands of years tick on, the water dries up and the crystals get compressed and thus the gentle blue angelite is born. Since its discovery in Peru, it has also been mined in Britain, oh. Poland, Libya, Germany, Mexico and Egypt. I find it amazing though because mm. let's just say the UK is not parched, is it? No. <laughs> <laughs> At no. all. Um, anyway, Angelite is as, as soft as silk in energy and oh. physicality. It will transform back to gypsum when placed in water, a reminder of the feeling of flow, that ethereal energy and change that drifts dreamily through the stone. Mm. It's lovely, it's isn't it? Yeah. Um, I was talking about this and um, now I want to show you this because it is. It was originally really, I've compiled this, this PowerPoint really more around the peacock angel eye, but actually, because of the colours of the peacock, but actually, oh, yes. the yeah. vivid green slots yeah. into that Does colour indeed. palette so yeah. beautifully, doesn't yeah. it? Because yeah. um, if you think about the peacock itself, they've got some amazing flashes of iridescent mm. green. Um, and also an element of fusion of green. Now this is again, totally and utterly natural. Now, it is the last, very, the very, very last brand new vivid green natural angelite that we have in the entire vault. But this 50. Imagine this, like, and I know it's not the same gemstone, but imagine like channeling your inner Barbara Hutton vibes. You could mm, knock that, yeah. put it on a red, like, oh, you know, yeah. red yeah. silk, whichever. How beautiful that would be. Amazing. Now, there's 50 in the world. It's going to be first, first come, first serve. We can only, that's as fair as we can make it. That's why you've got the clock on your screens right now. 
again we are desperately trying to get hold of more not just your blue angel light we're trying to get hold of in fact more so actually at the popularity of your vivid green angel light and your peacock angel light has overtaken blue angel light Wow. We love this more. here. At, I don't know about globally, but here at Jewelry Maker, mm. most certainly. Um, so get it whilst you can. We are trying. However, at the moment, this is the only strand that we have. And I don't think they have it on our sister channel either. You know, it is that rare that our sister channel, I don't think, have actually done a showcase. I, it is, yeah, yeah I agree. Yeah. Ross has just said it's one of those gems you almost can't believe is, is natural. You think it must be treated, it must be dyed, it must... Yeah, it must be man-made. Not the case. It's all Mother Nature's doing. You know, and believe me, if our sister channel could feature Green Angel Light, I'm sure they would. But they won't have the quantities, that's the thing. No, no. We're very blessed. 50 is, a, is, is... 50 isn't a bad quantity, even because we've got to remember the rarity of the gemstone, but it's like literally... It's a 30-second auction on our sister channel. Mm -hmm. yeah. We're at 149. It's natural. It's uber rare. If you have the peacock angel, like, can you imagine these together? If you have maybe some amazing pearls, vivid green angel, like, just works beautifully. We have been offered a parcel, and we've shared this information, haven't we, Roscoe? Uh, it is more geared towards the peacock angel, like, but this is actually even more limited than that. And what Bernard has actually said, look, I can get you more, but it will have a presence of yellow within there. The demand for this is huge in China. And I get it. It's understandable, isn't it? Look how beautiful it is. Plus, it's one of their favorite colors. Um, we, were, we, had, we had Angel Eye on order, but then, and, Bern, and we'd agreed it with Bernard, who actually was kind of like the middleman, effectively. Um, and in the end, he actually said, sorry, guys, I've been... Um, somebody in came it goes oh, up to him yes, basically three times yes. the price yes. so yeah and and obviously he then offered another opportunity which was um to sort of keep up relations i guess but that was in peacock angel like that wasn't in the vivid green <laughs> we're at 49.99 a brand new strand it's not where we are closing jewelry makers it would go beautifully with your selenite i have to say and it's a full 38 centimeter strand um, look at that colour, it's beautifully colour matched, a natural gemstone. I mean, you think about green gems, this is what they want to look like, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. I guess it's one of those unique greens, isn't it? It's, it's, I'm trying to think about the, the undertone, would you say blue? I think blue. Yeah, yeah, I think blue. Yeah, it's a little bit like yeah. a Colombian emerald green, isn't it? Mm. It's that. Twenty nine ninety nine oh for natural word. vivid green angel light. Ross has literally just checked. He said the website because we're saying it out loud. He's like, I'm just going to double check that there's nothing in the vault. There is literally nothing in the vault. How gorgeous. £29.99, Sarah, Cumbria, Sharon, uh, Michael, Denise, Susie, Anjum, um, Amanda, Denise in Surrey, I've got Rupal, Wiltshire, Neil, Cumbria, Tracy, oh, I mean, that's our of... Susie. Is that our Susie? Yeah. Oh yeah, Susie's getting two, yeah. I don't blame you Susie. No, no. Look how pretty it is, it's so gorgeous isn't it? It's a big Christ appraise this. Mm. It's yes, not the same yes. gemstone, obviously, but it has that kind of beauty, and I love Chrysoprase. It's got that inner glow about it again, doesn't it? Now, I've been talking about this since 8 o'clock this morning. Uh, we have just checked and double-checked. We have one strand of, of vivid green, uh, but they're bicones and they're tiny. So if you want the classic rounds, this is it. This is all we have. And believe it or not, brand new, it's never been on air before. Believe it or not, $29.99 is not your price. <laughs> oh no. Imagine doing a Marla in this. It'd be stunning. It'd be absolutely oh. gorgeous, wouldn't it? 
Yeah, get it whilst you can, jewellery makers. It would be yeah. absolutely beautiful. Imagine putting some of your pearls in there, maybe putting some lovely blossom pinks like Kunzites or Rose Quartz. Um, it will sell out. We're going even lower. 50 were available, but there's a lot of multi-buyers on this, and I don't blame you. It's the only vivid green angelite strand that we have in your round. The only other one we've got is in a very small bicone. 19.99. Wow. I thought we could take a fiver off then. I know these are eight um, now. Doable? Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it doable? Yeah, yeah. Even if you did sections. Yeah, with the rarity and the exclusivity of this gemstone, you know, if we have less, normally the price is that much more. However, clearly not the case today. Still bringing it to air, launching it at 19 pounds and 99 pence. Um, it will sell out all around the world. Get involved. Well done. Teresa, oh. Sarah, Denise. Australia. Yeah. Oh, Kirsty in word. Australia. I'm always curious, Kirsty, where you're from in Australia. Because I love Australia. It's a beautiful, beautiful country. Gosh. Um, Kent, Caroline. Yeah, it's... 20 past 10 at night. Is it? Mm. How many hours are they? 12. Behind or in front, I can never um, in front because they always have New Year's before us, so That's they're right. uh, 12 hours ahead. 12 yeah. hours ahead, yeah. there you go. So it's wow. night time for you, yes. it's early, mo it, well, yeah. mid morning for us now, isn't yeah. it? Um, well done, everybody. Elaine's got two, Cumbria's got two, Wiltshire's got two, Denise has got two. Out of the 50 that we had, I've got nine left. Oh, no. Um, I love that. I'm really fancying some pink. I, think, I was going to go for a really Zambian amethyst, really dark purple. Nice. Go down the Wimbledon route. Yeah. All the blacks oh, yes. out. What about yes. an orange? Yeah. yeah. An orange would be nice, like a like a specetite or something like that. Yes. That'd be quite nice, wouldn't it? Twenty. Oh, I, just, I love the fact it's from Peru. Yeah. I just think Peru is quite a romantic place, isn't it? And Paddington comes from Peru. Paddington. Paddington Bear comes from Does Peru. Does he? He's from Peru, yeah. I, I <laughs> honestly did not know that. Yeah. I honestly did from. not know that. Yeah. When I was growing up, yeah. my bedroom was Paddington Bear. Was it? And I ne never knew he was yeah, from Peru. Peru, yeah. Ah, yeah. how do you make his way over here then? Well, I think the story in the first film is how he comes to how this makes country, his way to, to London. UK. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Do you know what am I at? Like when you think, whenever I think of Paddington Bear, I always think about that thing with the Queen. Yeah, where they have. Uh, I watched that so many times on YouTube. It's lovely, you isn't you it? Come across it. Yeah. It's really nice. I like yeah. that she did that. Yeah. Um, well done, everyone. Final six of these available. Marie, wow. Sandra, Andrew's got two. Susie got two. I'm not surprised. We only had fifty of them. They're so pretty. Again. You know, and all your precious metals, and it's all natural colour. Well, we said with an orange. Hang on a minute, Mark. What about this? Oh, look at that! I love that because you've got the different tones of orange yeah. because of the uh, the banding. Oh, yeah. That's pretty, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, I like that a lot. That's again. What about that? Have you got the kunzite purple there? I do. Yeah, that Is that this one? Yeah, yeah. That might look quite. Should nice. I swap out the orange? Yeah, that's it. That's oh, yeah, the one that's I would lovely. Go. I like that a lot. Yeah. Gorgeous. Thing is, it's going to go with absolutely mm. everything, isn't it? Love these. The final three. Do say where we are now. Just before we go to the break with a, with your revised deal of the day, um, we have a brand new. I did. Oh, there it is. Oh, this is your classic angel school, like what we all fell it? in love with. Mm. Yeah. Amazing. I love this this stone with Botswana agate. Yeah. Because it picks nice. up those greys and the and the banding colours. It's lovely. Oh. 1987. Although this gemstone formed over thousands upon thousands of years, it lay undiscovered. And this was the first offering. Angelite, just by its whole name. You know, if you think angelite, you think about the heavens, don't you? You think about the beautiful hopefully pristine blue skies that we have outside what are you thinking of in um 1987 yeah um prince of wales prince william yeah was five was he yeah and it was his 42nd birthday yesterday happy birthday your highness 42 yesterday wow. where is time gone where does time go <sighs> the craziness yeah 
It's nearly July, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> now, the original Angel Eye, we have a slightly oh, bigger quantity. Oh, Can I good. also just say this would go so yeah, yeah, pretty with your, with your vivid green. Yeah. Look at that together. I've got one left of the vivid green. We have 70 of your classic angelite That would look blue. nice in a, in a bloke's mar A bloke? bloke? No. Where did that come from? I don't know. A gent's marla. Yeah, it would. That, that colour blue. And also, that is perfect yeah. peacock colours, isn't yes. it? Yes, yeah. Lovely. Maybe with, some, maybe with some nice gold components in there. What do you reckon? A nice gold That's nice, it is. Mayuki. Yeah, yeah. Just to give that lovely iridescence. Um, jewelry makers, we've got 70 of these available. Yeah, with a oh, yes, little perfect. flecks of gold yeah. if you want to go for that full peacock tail um, inspiration. Loving that, absolutely loving that. It is natural. First price crash, there's only 70 available. I love Angelite full stop. I think it's one of those gemstones that, you again, it's calming. It's got the, for me, the feelings of jadeite. You know, when you look at jadeite, it's one of those gems that actually has this lovely tranquility, comforting, relaxing, calming, all those sort of uh, uh, um, emotions and feelings. When I look at when I look at angelite, I have that same uh, um, reaction. Yeah, I agree. Again, it's it's amazing to think that this is totally natural when there's so few blue gemstones, powder blue mm. gemstones that are natural. You know, maybe you can occasionally get blue opal. Oh, yeah. From Peru, yes. From Peru. Yeah, that's true. Um, blue lace, one location. Yeah. I prefer this to blue lace, yeah. And that's a, that's a big statement because I love blue lace too. We're at 99.99. This would go absolutely beautiful with the avocado alashum. Oh, yeah. That we had recently. Because they've both got the same op yeah. opacity. Yeah. Not your price, jewelry makers. 60 second oh. clock on your screens. We've got 70 available. Uh, yeah, you're going to need to have get a little wriggle on you. Get a wriggle on because it is 70 is not going to hang around on um, a Saturday morning when we're talking about natural blue angelite. Again, do you know when I first was introduced to angelite, and it was here um, at Gemporia across the whole partnership, obviously, I remember seeing it in a showcase on our sister channel and being like, oh, what is that gemstone? Because mm. I'd never seen it, no, never no, experienced no. it before. Um, but the reality is, it's, it's a baby in comparison. You know, you think about your Cotan Jade. Cotan Jade's been mined for almost 10,000 years. This is, this yeah. was discovered in 1987. <laughs> Adam's saying, young, some might say. <laughs> Adam, you are young. You are young. Absolutely. Love it. And it is that, that, the depiction of summertime for me. No, it's gorgeous blue. Wait a minute. You know what I'm going to do, Mark. That's crazy, Ross. Um, I love this combination. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They all would work. I yeah, totally agree. Yeah. In fact, I tell you what I'll do. Let me put that there for a minute because otherwise I'm just going to cover it over, aren't I? Yeah. So <laughs> here in <laughs> let's. Oh, I do love working with this team. It's so such fun. Here we go. Look. There we go. Yeah. Look at that, Mark. All of them. Oh, it's so beautiful. And again, you, it stands out because you've got that contrast between the actual texture of the it's, gem. It means a lot, doesn't it? Metaphysically. Metaphysically, and absolutely. Yeah. Well, angelite, yeah. yeah. It's, uh, After um, angels. Angels above. Oh. Big quantity, Ross says. Had a little bit of a swapperoo on your Saturday show, but I think it works. For I mean, that reason. I'm really intrigued what that left hand strand is on the stand there. Um, I, I think it's a bit of it. It's a bit of jadeite. I think. Really? Yeah, I think so. We're going to go even lower, Mark, just because it's Saturday. Wayne's on a barge. Mm. <laughs> Wayne's on a barge. <laughs> Can we just... <laughs> <laughs> when Wayne comes back, right, that needs to be a full catchphrase, Wayne's on a barge. Yeah? <laughs> Because I've cer I have cer <laughs> I've certainly said it multiple times this week. Cos Wayne's on a barge. 
we're doing twelve ninety nine. Gosh. I don't know if we're allowed to do twelve ninety nine. He's got all the power as Ross this week. Has he? All the power, don't you, Ross? Ah. Yeah. Yeah. These, yeah. He's keeping us in ship shape. Yeah. He's like. He said at the beginning of the week, he was like, oh, things are going to change around here. <laughs> 12.99, Kathy <coughs> in Derbyshire, Elaine in Monmouthshire multiplying, Christina, well done, well done multiplying, Anjum's got three, Amanda's got two. Again, imagine this with your, um, with your project, but also um, alongside things like pearls. You can't be angelite with pearls, but like Mark, you just said, there's lots of meaning to this gemstone yes. as well. Yes, um, amazing. Now, coming up after the break, jewelry makers, we're going to be talking about your beautiful four-leaf clovers. We have malachite, Australian chrysoprase, ooh, carnelian, type A jadeite, labradorite, and even quartzite jade. Is that what it is? I love that clover on the end. If it, it looks like a green Larimar. Might be. It's stunning. Is it? Wow. You're right. It's beautiful. That's coming up, Jewelry Makers. So there's so much to see. Oh. And don't forget, you're 12 o'clock as well, Jewelry Makers. We've got, um, I think, a new technique, Mark. A new yeah. technique. Just give a little... I love this. Oh, Mark, that's so beautiful. A new technique. So this will literally, well, not quite literally, but this is 12 o'clock. Yep. Ties in nicely with your deal of the day. The Quartzite Jane, it's the one that Mark was actually eyeing up without knowing what it is. That is um, stunning. That's amazing, that is isn't it? beautiful. It's and it's faceted. Up. Yeah. It's facet yes. The other side of this break, jewelry makers, so do not go anywhere. Join us after this. <laughs> Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewelry Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click on the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewelry Maker. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Here at Jewelry Maker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard P&P is $3.95. Charges may differ outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option of $5.95. Shopping made easy on Jewelry Maker. Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there, you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewelry making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8 a.m. until 1 p.m. And you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel.
Are you new to jewellery maker? Well, we want to help you on your jewellery making journey. When you purchase with us for the first time, you'll receive the jewellery maker handbook, which is filled with 35 different techniques, as well as lots of hints and tips to help you on your way. Jewellery maker, create, wear, share. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Jewellery Maker gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says Gift Cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email. Then decide the value you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion or just a way to say thank you, the Jewellery Maker gift card is the perfect answer. Shopping with Jewellery Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewellerymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your jewellery room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewellery Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewellery Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewellery Maker. Did you know that instructions come included with every designer project? Dive right into your Jewellery Maker project with confidence and clarity. Whether you're a seasoned pro or a first-time creator, our step-by-step -step guides ensure success every time. Just download them from your Jewellery Maker account on our website. Get started today and experience the joy of hassle-free crafting. Instructions included, creativity unleashed. Welcome back. We had a little, little swap around, didn't we? We did. Well, I had to, I had to be near these. Um... Yeah, something has really oh. taken your fancy, isn't it, Mark? I'm desperate. It's not very, it's not very often when I sit in the studio and I think I've got to, I've got to steal that strand. I've got to steal that strand. It's I've, lovely, I've isn't it? To, it's that one at the end there. Yeah. We are talking about, uh, and we clock, Mark clocked it literally yeah. from what three meters away. Yeah. Yeah. I love the fact every single stone is completely different from its neighbour. Yeah. That that mottled one halfway down the strand. I just think it's so beautiful. Ah. Oh. Now. Wow. Do you know what it is? I've no idea. I think I, from over there it looked like, as I said, it looked like a green Laramar. But then looking at the screen, it looks like an emerald. Yeah. But no, I don't know what it is. I assumed it was Burmese jade, like floating flower jade. Oh, okay. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. What we're looking at might well be one of the only strands of a clover that we've done in this gemstone. I don't recall uh, any others. Okay. This is natural quartzite jade is it really now it's and i beautiful i do know there's confusion with quartzite jade that dave is far more qualified to talk about than i am um but this is how i kind of make sense of it in my mind so imagine ourselves thousands of years ago when it was jade was nephrite mm -hmm. nephrite yeah. nephrite 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 and then Fast forward, a new gem was discovered that gemologically is very different to nephrite. Nephrite and jadeite are not, they're not like, uh, like beryls where they're all linked. Okay, they are no, no, gemologically no. separate. But then when jadeite was discovered, it was like, that's a jade. We're going to put it under right. that umbrella. Because I've always okay. referred to jade as an umbrella term. Think mm. of it as like a surname, if you like. Then you've got your two siblings. Remember, I've always said it yes, this way. Yeah. Nephrite which is the older sibling, and then jadeite, which is the other sibling. Gemologically different, but under that umbrella. So, yeah. Now these aren't at my words, or even Dave's, these are actually the words of far more, no disrespect to Dave, far more qualified um, authorities in China who have educated us at the same time and said, look, this is a quartzite jade, but they refer to just as a jade. They don't mention quartzite. We do because we like to be very transparent and tell you, explain everything. Yeah, absolutely. So they're like, 
Gemologically, there's a, it's quartzite, yeah? But this location, and not all quartzite comes under that jade umbrella, not all quartzite, this location is being described under the jade umbrella. So that is natural. And it might well be the only strand we've done in a clover. It's coming up in a couple of auctions, but not yet, Mark. So we're going to have to tease you with it for a little bit. So every single one of those stones warrants something individual, whether it's on a necklace or mm. in a slider bracelet. Yeah. Are, I, I love it. I love it. I'm going to start with... <sighs> did you see the amber that I launched the other day? First time I've seen it in the flesh. It's gorgeous, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. Um, Ava, could you pass me a bust? Is that okay? Maybe a white bust. Uh, white would be preferable. Thank you, lovely. Only because if I put this, thank you, lovely. If I put this across the back of my hand, it's not going to show the gemstone to, um, to the max. So you know your classic Alhambra, which we'll talk about as well. But you know your classic Alhambra, which is that four-leaf clover that has been around for many, many decades. We took inspiration from the Maison, um, that is Van Cleef and Arpels. We went to, uh, we spoke to Marius, who, um, th this is, ex that we know of, this is exclusive to us here at Jewelry Maker. He, he does, oh, that's been it? confirmed. Yeah, no, he has not commissioned oh. this for anywhere else other than here. Right. So you can't get this look from anywhere else. Um, so specially commissioned exclusive to you and we said look our off our, our jewelry maker family absolutely love the van cleef and arpels um idea the concept the design is this something that you could work with now let's not forget that there's there's a few hurdles along the way we're talking about amber in this piece amber is hasn't got a crystal structure it's what we call an organic gemstone what that means is uh, formed from a living organism which is effectively what was resin so it was once upon a time liquid. It's gone through a process called polymerization where it defies mother nature mm. and effectively hardens. Um, so to cut it is particularly challenging. That's why most amber is either, either in free forms or cabochons because it can burn, it can literally yes, burn. Yes. So to cut shapes like this, incredibly, incredibly challenging. But Marius did su uh, succeed. And he's framed it, wrapped it in the most beautiful sterling Isn't silver. It? That is incredible silver work. It is. The There's a lot of, the of silver, it. Yes, yes. Well, you've just read my mind because yeah. I'm going to do this. I'm going to turn it sideways so that Ava incredible. can catch the silver gram weight, literally wrapped around each piece. Mm -hmm. And then you might notice on the reverse, mm -hmm. you have the extender chain as well. It's, you know, when we talk about heirloom jewellery, that's what this is. But know that not even Van Cleef and Arpels themselves actually have amber. I was going to ask, do they do an amber version? No. No, they don't. You can get it in Tiger's Eye. Okay. Yeah, so, yeah. if, which has got similar colour tones, isn't it? So, if you go to Van Cleef and Arpels and you want the long line, uh, vintage Alhambra, long line necklace, 20 motifs... You are going to need to part with... £12,300. 17, is that? Yeah, 17. Yeah, you just missed five. What? £17,300. It's in 18 karat gold. Here's us in solid 925 wow. sterling silver. And you can get it in white gold, by the way, at Van Cleef and Arpels, which looks exactly the same, doesn't it? Um, with free postage and packaging. It's not going to be anywhere near those five oh figures. Word. Now, I know that this is extremely limited, jewelry makers. I know there's not many available. I personally wouldn't do anything to this. I would literally wear it exactly as it is because it's a perfect design. Mm. Hello, Sally. I have this. It's out of this world. Go, go, go. <laughs> it is Sally, isn't Thank it? Thank you, Sally. And it's one of those pieces, Sally, that I would buy and I absolutely would not give. Oh, eh? I wouldn't sell it. I wouldn't gift it. It would be a piece that would go in my jewellery collection as well. It's gorgeous. Okay. Just Can I quickly just say that, bear in mind, at 12 o'clock, we've got project kits with metres of chain. Yes. So if you wanted to cut this up and elongate the sections <gasps> in between. Yes, create Or make overhead. earrings or do the tassel or, or do the, you know, the double drop. You could you do can that. You can have a real play around. And the, and the chain is, you can, the chain links are large enough to do your rosary and your wrapped loops. Wow, so you could incorporate it into the would. 12 o'clock. Oh, Definitely. amazing, yeah. absolutely amazing. 
Now, let's introduce the graphics. Um, to launch your clover selection this Saturday morning, we're launching with the only necklace that we have, complete necklace that we have in sterling silver. There's a big amount. I can't remember. I want to say eight grams, Ross. Isn't there something high like that? There's a big <coughs> gram weight behind this. Didn't We did weigh it because actually amber weighs nothing, doesn't it? It's, it's one of those few gemstones that will physically float in salt water. Um, we did weigh it. You're right, Ross. Good memory. Come on then. Carrots. No, we don't want carrots, do we? Um, units. There. Okay, let me weigh the gram weight. I can do this because amber is will physically float in salt water. Oh, I, wow. might, I might have underestimated that. Mark, what number do you see? 13 grams and 46 milligrams. 13 point, nearly 13, 13 and a half grams. 13 and a half grams of solid sterling silver in this piece. Yeah, that's a heavyweight piece. It's absolutely beautiful. It's just effortlessly chic, isn't it? I love the fact it? that, that um, Bank Leaf don't have amber. Yeah. Do they have silver pieces? Or no. They don't, have, they don't do silver? No, so it's they all would, they, wouldn't, they wouldn't tune in and buy all these off us and then remake them back in there. Well, every single one of their pieces is hand finished. Firstly, so, yeah, so, um, wow. yeah. Um, but they don't do silver to my knowledge. It's right. all okay. it's all gold or eighteen carat gold, eighteen right. carat white gold. Um, so tiger's eye, seventeen thousand three hundred in eighteen carat gold. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, we are at ten percent of that price tag, and I can tell you, not stopping there. Roscoe, how many do we have of these left? Eighteen. I didn't think there'd be that many of them available out of the wow. one hundred that we originally launched. Amazing. First collector. USA. Well done, California. You've got the first one. Don't worry, though. We're not stopping at £1,700. Um, we're also not stopping at this next price crash. Not. You try and find amber in any boutique jewellers for, for less mm. than that. You know, an amber necklace with that volume of amber in there as well. You try and find one for less than £200. I think you're hard pushed. You know, amber is not is, is is a rare and valuable commodity. You know, and I remember having this discussion once upon a time, and someone was saying to me that, um, oh, I'm wrong, I'm incorrect to call amber a gemstone. Amber is a gemstone. It's a, it's an organic gemstone. It doesn't have a crystal. It's not a mineral. It's definitely not a mineral. Um, it's in the same way that pearl is a gemstone, the same way that amylite is a gemstone, the same way that jet is yeah, a gemstone. Yeah, yeah. They just don't have crystal structures, so they form differently. We've got to remember what qualifies gems as a gem um, is basically its rarity. It doesn't say about crystal no, structure. No. Rarity, its beauty and its durability. Those three factors. That's the, that's what, that. I like that's why. Fordite is always a bit of a discussion, a topic of discussion. Mm. This is Mother Nature created and it is uber rare and very difficult to actually carve into those shapes. It's unbelievable, isn't it? Well, oh my when word. We have sold Alhambra four leaf clovers, not necessarily in amber, let's say in silver. How much do they each? Oh. Ross is saying with the amber, they'd be £20 each. So, okay. Let's say 15. Let's say 15. You've got one, two, three, four, five. Is it 10? There you go. So you, you know you're getting a fantastic deal by our standards, never mind outside these four walls. Zara, Kathleen, California. I've got Mary Claire, Janice, Kathleen, Linda, Amy, Catherine, um, Cheshire. These will sell out today. I don't think they're going to be on your screens again. Plus, you've got your 0% interest split payment as well, lovely jewelry makers. Um, so take advantage of that if you wish. Um, it's the only sterling silver Alhambra piece that we actually have. The rest are all carved mm. gemstones. You've got the chains, as Mark said, coming up in the 12 o'clock hour as well. It's absolutely beautiful. The, you could, the, even down to the gram weight of the chain. Yeah, yeah. You know, you can see how substantial that chain. There's a lot of silver in there too. But again, make sure you're checking out. Uh, yeah, £17,300 for the 18 carat um, yellow gold tiger's eye motif necklace. Um, even if you doubled our price, because they've got 20 motifs on this. Exactly, yeah. It's yeah. still a drop in the ocean, isn't it? Even if you timed ours by 10. Yes, exactly, it's a drop in the ocean. 
unbelievable. Nice. I just love the depth of the silver around the around the uh, the clovers. It's so stunning, beautiful, isn't it? Isn't it? And, and amber, you get that lovely glow about it as well. It's one of the few oh. gemstones that will actually get better with age. Yes, yeah. I've missed amber. Yeah. We used to have amber weekends, didn't we? Did. We did. Can't yeah. do that now. No, it's very difficult. No. no. Very difficult um, to actually acquire. Yeah, our amber showcases have become far more yeah. sporadic as well, haven't they? And I was saying Same. we've had we've had Marius on air before. He's not been able to do shows with us. It's very difficult to get hold of, and it's very very expensive now. We're fortunate here at Jewelry Maker, and I, by we I mean obviously all of us, um, that, to have that relationship with Marius because that's how pieces like this are actually uh, um, within our grasp. You know, if that was in a boutique, so isn't, I reckon it goes back to the conversation with your kiss cross mark. Mm. I think that's mm. five, six hundred yeah, yeah, pounds. Yeah. Not a hundred quid. That's, no, that's crazy. definitely not. Eileen, Linda, Janice, well done. Kathleen, Zara, Kathleen, Amy's California. And this is how many I've got left. Seven. So if you are Mandy, Surrey, June, Ruth, Florence, Linda, another Kathleen, Cheshire or Beverly, you need to check out your basket because I've got literally seven available. Once they're gone, they're gone. I can't guarantee that Marius will be able to commission something like this for you again. Um, it was, there was a hundred in the world ever made. That's, That's pretty beautiful. cool, isn't it? I don't think it would work as well if they were larger. I think the, the size of the stone mm. with the, th the thickness of the chain the, the, and the length of the necklace works really well, doesn't it? The balance is beautiful, mm. isn't yeah, it? Yeah. It's absolute, every, it's just perfection, even down to the beading that surrounds yeah. wow. um, the actual malachite itself. So, and malachite, where's that come from? Sorry, um, <laughs> the amber itself. Well done. June, you've just got yours as well. Um, I've got Jean, Joanne, uh, there's so many there. Good luck, everybody. I mean, Four left within the vault. Once they're gone, they're gone. Amazing. Okay. Next up, type oh. A grade Burmese. Is he bringing it early? Oh. And then we're going to do the quartzite oh. jade for you. Amazing. Um, have you seen this strand? This is some of the best colour I've seen, Ross. Have I picked up the right one? Do you know that when you're in a colour is so good in a in a flat in a clover. You know what? What did it, he say it is? Type A grade Burmese jadeite. But oh. Ross, honestly, I've picked this up. The colour is so bright. Yeah. Do you see where I'm coming from? I'm almost like I'm questioning. I would question. It I would question it as well. That's intense green, isn't it? Look at that. Does that come across on your screens? It's properly wow. spearmint, it isn't is. it? It is, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's wow. beautiful. Now, one thing I can say for absolute certainty, Van Cleef and Arpels, one of the world's most coveted jewellery houses, do not do Burmese jadeite. In fact, all of their gemstone offerings, yes, they do the big five, of course, but in their, so let's just talk about the Alhambra, the most successful collection are all actually relatively accessible. Tiger's Eye, Agates, yes, Onyx. Yes. They are relatively accessible. Mother of Pearl. Then it's unlikely, never say never, but it is highly unlikely that they're ever going to start introducing jade because of the rarity of the stone. But you remember, Van Cleef and Arpels will do probably thousands, tens of thousands of, uh, of those Alhambra necklaces um, on, I don't know, yearly, monthly, whatever it might be, basis. We're about to bring you how many? 40. Oh no. That's some of the most vivid green four leaf clovers and they are carved by hand that I've ever seen in Burmese jadeite. Such a pretty colour, isn't it? And the wastage from those cuts, they yeah. wouldn't be able to use for anything else. No. So it, that'll be literally almost carved away. Mm, yeah. In the same way that your master carvings are achieved, it is literally done by hand and you create what is basically like a heart cleft four times mm, over. Yes, yeah. That does uh, um, come with a risk, obviously, of fracturing the stone, um, in which case it will be lost. You know, the yeah. carrot weight is lost. I have 40 of these available. Again, with Mark's projects that's coming up at 12 o'clock today, this will go hand in hand, Absolutely. It? Yeah, it's a beautiful chain, really nice chain. Loving these. So you have from 12 to 16 millimeter, um, don't throw the spaces away as well, because they are actually hematite. 
Um, 60 carats of type A grade Burmese jade. And I know I'm repeating myself here to my reg uh, to regular viewers, but um, it's really important because we do have new viewers that tune in on a regular basis as well. But Burmese jade has got literally hundreds and hundreds of years of, of history. And in 2020, the mine closed. So the fact that we have it, even have it yes, available, yeah. is something to most definitely celebrate. Celebrate, um, And also remember, there are about 4,000 different minerals on this gemstone. Uh, I can't talk. There are 4,000 different minerals on this planet. This is one of the top 10 rarest and probably moved up over the uh, since its announcement that the mine closed in 2020. Good luck, everyone. We are under 100 pounds. Wow. But we're not stopping there. Plus, you've got your free postage and packaging jewellery maker. Um, we have, I think, all completely fallen head and head and what's that? Head over heels. Head over heels in love with the four leaf clover motif, haven't we, here at Jewellery Maker? But the reality is not just here at Jewellery Maker, it's everywhere. Our sister channel do a version. You know, you can find it online, you can see them on Etsy. Um, high end jewellery houses, even the likes of Louis Vuitton is doing a kind of a similar design, aren't yeah. they? Very, very similar. Not with Burmese jadeite, though. 69 pounds and 99 pence just wow i mean go back what two three years ago maybe more this would have had a one in front of it ross don't you think easily this would have been 169 pounds maybe even more 199 quite possibly because they're not small stones it's, not just, that, it's just that intense color it's, it's beautiful it is some of the yeah. most vivid yeah yeah, yeah. yeah, you, yeah completely agree? yeah I've got 40, but, or I had, Angela, Sandra, Karen, Pamela, Maker, Beverly, London, Joanne, uh, Miu Yin, Angela, London, Essex, and those are the names I can see. We got a great deal on this. Is this new, Ross? They're all ah, brand right. new. We've sourced 40. Doesn't that speak volumes? Do you remember when we used to do type A green jadeite deals for like 200 quantity? Do you remember? We've managed to source 40. Normally that elevates the price. It seems to be doing the polar opposite for you um, today. We got a great deal. You get a great deal. Uh, just, just unbelievable. I'd pay that for any one of those carvings. Any one of them. You know, the colour, and when we're talking about jade eye, it's about the translucency and it's about the colour saturation. You know, translucency, how fine that crystal is. Let me just say that if it was a coarse crystal, you would have quite a heavy mottled uh, surface to the actual gemstone. Not the case here. You can see that one un uninterrupted colour. Um, and when you're talking about colour, it's, yeah, green jade eye is still the most valuable. And you have some of the greenest saturation that I've seen here at Jewelry Maker. Kathleen's got two, Angela's got two, London's got two. Oh, you just teaming it casually with a bit of... Well, just to show the intensity of that jadeite. Yeah. I mean, look at that. That's, that's amazing. See, so when have we bought jadeite that sits and stands perfectly against malachite? Toe to toe. You, yeah, that's true. Because they're completely different. This is amazing. That's true. Oh, they're both amazing strands, they're lovely, aren't, aren't they? they? Absolutely amazing strands, brand new, coming up as well uh, along um, other amazing gemstones like Chrysoprase and Carnelian. But Mark, I can, we can make you wait no longer. Is he bringing it forward? He's he doesn't, he doesn't it. have to, honestly. I'm... Let's do it. Okay. Let's do it. It's brand new. The demand for this is extra, extra high. So okay. I hope I've explained that, well, certainly as best I can anyway. Um, you can have, so Jade is an umbrella term, like a surname. You know, um, and imagine you've got the two siblings. The firstborn was your nephrite. And then you had a separate si sibling that came along, not gemolog um, gemologically the same, different, mm. that they named Jadeite, but still have that surname. Now, fast forward um, further centuries, effectively. Now, um, China actually saying we have a new location, a new variety of jade. Wow. Not all quartzite is the same. It's this one location. I hope I've explained that right. Uh, okay. This is beautiful the quality it's a long is strand. <gasps> i know it's 
Oh. It's floating flower as well. Yeah, that's amazing. Bow. Every single one is complete, not just slightly different, completely different. Look at these. Oh, and you can you see that facet? A facet across the front. This is beautiful. Mark, it's so this pretty. Is so gorgeous. This this literally grabbed your attention. When I came in this morning. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, yeah. Beautiful. I can see why. Look at that, Mark. Again, I would with the chain that we've got coming up at twelve, you could do, I don't know, two or three of your long line Alhambras with this. No that one else no one else in the world will have this stone, no. will they? In this this is rare. Rare and extremely beautiful, where you have those wonderful flecks across the surface. Like I said, if if it was jadeite, we'd be talking, calling it floating flower. Effectively, yes, yes. it's that same patterning and pa uh, that we've seen. I agree. I agree. I agree. And Mark, you're not alone. Ross is saying this is one of the nicest quartzite jade strands I've seen. If that one there was taken, if that wasn't on the strand, which is my favourite one, this yeah. one here, that I just love that. If that wasn't on the strand, I would say that that was a new form of Laramar. Yeah. A green version of Laramar. Yeah. Without a doubt. Because there's, there's a bluey green yeah, yeah. colour yeah, to yeah. it, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, wow. Now, that there is. is, how many did you say? 40? 50. Oh, the no. faceting, the natural colour, the rarity of this beautiful gemstone. Um, yeah, absolutely. At £149 for a quartzite jade. Um, it's beautiful in its appearance. And again, we've got to overcome lots of hurdles to bring you a, a shape that's so popular mm. here at Jewelry Maker. <laughs> but you've got to remember, I mean, I don't know this for certainty, but I imagine over in China, you don't see many jade pieces no. ca carved into a, into no, a no. clover because it's wasteful and it's also quite risky. Pamela, Gloria, new customer Elaine, uh, Amy, Susan, Angela, Andrew in Essex, you're there as well. Um, I have 50 available. It's a long strand, as Mark's pointed yeah, out. Yeah. It's brand new. And they're 17 mil consistently across the strand. On this next price crash, under £100, <laughs> jewellery makers. How many have you got on the strand? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 17. So, what, so, what's, so what's, that, what's that each then? I should know um, that. £6.75 each. What is it? Five eighty-eight. Okay, so if what? I was sat here, which we've done, ah. with, we've done with jades before, haven't we? If I was sat here no. and said, look, okay, I've got some, a little parcel of Guatemalan jade. I've got a little parcel of Burmese no. jade. I've got a little parcel of your Kotan jade. I've got a little parcel of your uh, um, Canadian jade. And there'd be just one or two stones. They're not going to be five pound no, eighty-eight, are no, they? No, absolutely not. The fact that you're getting it on a strand, and these are parcels. Already, so many collectors securing theirs. Oh no! It's brand new. Now, I am aware that you were a lot of you are disappointed that Dave's not here this this morning. I am sorry about that. Our apologies. He will be here at ten o'clock tomorrow. So what we're going to do, jewelry makers, is do a, a bit of an apology deal on the only quartzite jade piece that we have today. Oh, so we should have given this to him tomorrow then. <sighs> but because it was right. clovers, we included it in today's show. You get more clo um, more quartzite jade tomorrow. A minute clock, and we're going to go lower. But we need to see you there. Remember, there's 250 carats of your beautiful quartzite jade, 17 motifs. Um, I think there's more actually, isn't there? Because you had your finger on one of them. Hang Did on. I miscount them? Shall we count? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 19. 19. 19 Not motifs. 17. So what's that then, Ross? 19 motifs. At this price, <laughs> £5.26. <laughs> but we're going even lower. Oh, no. With your free postage and packaging as well. Oh, that's so gorgeous. It's beautiful. This is perfect for this time of year. Good luck, everyone. Get yourself ready. The newest variety. It's, it, it, it's historic, actually, the quartzite mm, jade introduction. Yeah. I love it. I Hugely love it. historic. And the fact that literally 10,000 years best part of it was all about... Um, it was all about... It was all about your nephrite jade. But then when we're talking about your Burmese jade, that's what, hundreds of years later... And now, 
hundreds of years again, just after the Burmese mine closes. This is what? this is welcome to that's the under family. three quid each. Yeah, that's crazy, isn't it? For natural, natural quartzite jade. No. Twenty four ninety nine <laughs> on your split pay. Good luck, everybody. It's on split pay as well. Yeah, I think that's the apology deal. We should have been higher, Mark. That's why. Because we've had a little bit of a swapperoo because oh. your uh, um, yeah, your weekend show has changed somewhat. So basically, your deal of the day for tomorrow is today and vice versa. Um, well done. It's going to sell oh, out. Well, Elaine, Gloria, well Pamela, done. hello to you, Geraldine, Kathleen, Andrew's got two, Olivia, Linda, Virginia, Louth, Sandra, Sharon, Jan, hello to you, London, Anna, Ruth, Marie. There are so many names on the phone lines. I would strongly encourage you checking out your baskets um, because we only had wow. 50. Phone lines have gone crazy. Again, your Shanghai Red, you mentioned oh. earlier, that would just be incredible with this. What I would do is I would put mm. an inch of twist macrame in between each one oh, and then knot it at the back and yeah, just a nice. long line. Nice. And you say, uh, if you look at like traditional Chinese jade pieces, you mm. know, they are on cords, yeah, yeah. they are macrames. Yeah. They're not, you know, they're not hugely embellished in lots of gold or platinum. No, it's no. all about the cords and threads, isn't it? Because remember this jade is, is glass is classed as a, a very humble gemstone, isn't it? You know, it talks about the integrity of the gemstone. This will come under that description. Um, loving it. We only had 50 though. So I know there is a little bit of a queue on the phone lines. I can see you oh, there. Yeah, yeah. So don't remember, uh, don't forget, what is wrong with me this hour? I can't construct sentences. <laughs> <laughs> don't forget, it's free potion and packaging um, as well today. Um, stay where you are. So good luck, Sandra, Susan. Su Sandra, you're about to be answered in actual fact. All of a sudden there was a flurry. There was a flurry of wow. people being answered. Um, amazing. Kevin, you've just got yours. Fantastic. Denise and Lester, good luck. Diane, good luck. June, good luck. Carol, good luck. Kevin, good luck. Maya, good luck. Susan, who wants six, good luck. Um, Angela, good luck. Amy, good luck. Susan and Lancashire, good luck. If you've got a phone in your hands, you should be fine. Lynn in Cheshire, uh, make sure you're checking out your baskets. This is an apology oh. deal purely because we've had to kind of swap your courtside jade parcel for tomorrow and vice versa. But actually hindsight, it works really it well. It does, no, it's perfect. Because it, it leads lovely, in, uh, beautifully into your masterclass. We have a close up of that one there. Yeah. I just think that seems, that, that's the one that threw me, you see. That's incredible. There are 14 chances remaining. I love that. It's like K2 Jasper, that yes. same sort of mottling, but a yeah. green. I like this oh, one. Oh, look at this. Uh, ah, yeah. is it free post on the web and TV, it says is. Trevor. Yeah. Sure is, Trevor. I know, use JM free post. Sure is. Make sure you use that code and you can buy your order and everything. And yeah, free post. How are we packaging. in June? How oh, are we in June? Oh. We are actually almost in July. We are. I know. This year is going so fast. It's true what they say. It does get faster as you get older, yeah, doesn't it? Yeah, does, it does, doesn't it? I can't... And, and, and I, I'm busier than I've ever been as well now. And your kids are finishing school in two weeks' time, aren't they? Yes. Is it two weeks' time? Three... three no, four uh, weeks' time. 21st of July. Oh, yeah, four weeks. Yes. So six, seven weeks, is it? Yes. <laughs> Good luck with that. <laughs> you come here for a, for a rest, don't you? much harder work at home yeah I can imagine yes wow. yes it is I do like it's also one of those that um, they need to get out that's the thing you yeah. need to get them out and I, can't, I won't just unfortunately I can't just let the girls out and play on the street anymore no, no. there's too no. many cars about these days and aren't how there how expensive it is to take them to do things exactly as well. so I need to yeah. start thinking about that how to keep them entertained I think um, I spent one summer holidays just in, sat in the garden making mud pies and had a lovely yes. time. Yes! That's what you should get them doing. Love it. Get them, <laughs> yeah, yes, absolutely. I used yeah. to just play out on the street, but I couldn't do that with my yeah. girls because it's a, it's, it's a busy road and mm. also you've got to be careful these days, mm. don't you? Yeah. So, yeah, we'll go on nice walks and bike rides and things like yeah. that. That'll be yeah. the plan. Hopefully Elle, Elle will get fit at the same time. My mum used to kick us out at about eight in the morning and we'd get on our bikes and she wouldn't see us again till supper. 
and she'd embarrass us by standing at the back door shouting for us to come in for our tea. Yeah. Yeah, yeah like street days. lights on, isn't it? That's the that was our cue, wasn't it? To oh, was go it? back. Oh. But mine was anyway. As soon as the street lights come on. Oh, we never had that. Mind you, in That's the sense. summer though. Yeah, it was quite late then. Yeah. <laughs> Basically. Wow. Another world. Yeah, it is. It is. Yeah. Um, well okay. done, everyone. Well done, everybody. Gone? I think that has sold out, hasn't it? Two left. I'm going to have left. one of those in the break then. I don't blame you. It's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Should we do some more? So I've done Ooh. that one. I've done that one. Yeah, look at that. So what is it about malachite that you like? I, 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 You've it's, always liked it's it, hypnotically you? beautiful for me. You know, yeah. like um, <laughs> Adam, he likes that it's green and stripy. stripy. <laughs> do you know? Do you know? Do you know this? For me, Ross, and I've shown this before. There's um, Dior perfume. They do a perfume called Poison. Oh yeah. yeah. And their packaging, for me, is a bit malachite. There's oh. something so hypnotically beautiful about it. It's it's so distinctive, and it's one. There's no other gemstone like it. I don't know. It. Let me just show. I don't know how close Ava can get to this. Yeah, this is why is I love beautiful. it. Oh, look at that! Look. Look at how amazing. It is amazing. Is second to none, isn't it? Even yeah. on the sides, look, because yeah. they're so deep, you get the patination. Oh, look at that. Remember, malachite is a very a copper rich. Mm. There we go. See what look I mean? Look at that. Oh, well, yeah. Can we show that? See what I mean? Yeah. It's hypnotic, that green, yeah. I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, remember, this is a copper rich gemstone that is very shallow forming, that forms in stalactites and stalagmites, literally copper-rich solution dripping down, dripping down over thousands and thousands and thousands of years. And as it grows, you get these wonderful patterns. I don't know, I just find the whole process of how it forms utterly amazing. This quality is second to none. I agree, this it's is one of the best, best I've had. seen. Yeah, yeah. And it's everywhere, Mark, now. You know, you've got, there it is, there's the stalactites oh, and stuff. I just think that's so cool, isn't it? It's like a really expensive lava lamp, doesn't it? Yeah, so cool. Mm. I'd like that in an image, mm. you know, framed. Well, I talked about you in images the other day. Did you? Because we had um, Botswana agate on yeah. the show, and I told the world that you've got agate prints. I have. You, haven't you, in your house? Yes. Yeah. I, again, it's just the patterns yeah. that Mother Nature yeah. does. I love, I love it. It does that naturally. Yeah. But again, if you want to talk Malachi and how popular it is, uh, we've discussed obviously that Alhambra is huge at the moment. Malachi is huge. Could we flick through those, Roscoe? Lots of the big designers um, using uh, using Malachi, of course. In the brands. Mm. So interior design, yeah. Look at that. I oh, in soft furnishings. Yeah. How beautiful, Absolutely. even in tiles. Dolce <laughs> and Gabbana, um, commissioning it in bags and watches. They're also doing it in shoes, Dolce and Gabbana. Lola Rose, you took this photograph. Yeah, that's on the Isle of Wight. There you go, yeah. in a stately yeah. home. Queen Victoria's house. Wow, I mean, it is literally yeah. everywhere and branding the inspiration behind it. And of course, Van Cleef and Arpels yeah. use it. Um, the Queen, um, Her Majesty, the Queen Consort, uh, Camilla, um, one of her Van Cleef and Arpels pieces is actually the Malachite, so she wears it quite frequently. Oh, yes, and yes. by the way, if you do want to buy that, oh, pe that necklace. That's a car. Yeah, £23,100. That is a really nice car. Mm-hmm. Oh my word. Well, tell you what, you can still get your car. Gosh. Because we'll make you a lot of saving on this strand. It's brand new. The quality, as Mark was saying, is second to none. How many do we have, Ross? 40. Oh, these are all limited then. Yeah. This is, I think, this is without doubt the best quality Malachite I've seen. Definitely. It's incredible, isn't it? Even the little dinky ones on the, on the end, yeah. the depth of them. Look at those. The more oh, no. of those patterns that you see, the finer the quality the malachite actually is. I mean, some of them as well, we've actually had the, the peacock's eye in them, 
We're at ninety-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. It's a drop in the ocean. Well, listen, you've, we've saved you mm, right now yes, twenty-three thousand yeah. pounds. How good is that? <laughs> How good is that? Um, and also, that necklace that we showed was the magic Alhambra that has the mixture of the sizes in that gemstone too. We're at ninety-nine ninety-nine. Already interested in this. I find just it's just hypnotically beautiful, and we're not alone in that love of this gemstone. It's everywhere at the moment. Piaget, um, Chopard, Van Cleef. Oh, just to name but a few. To name but a few. Forty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. Maria Maker, Newport, Kent. You're all there. Getting in nice and early. Um, by the way, you um, can get malachite, very shallow forming gemstone. Mm. So the mine history tends to change quite quickly as it becomes deplete, they move on to another location. Um, often actually found in around turquoise mines as well, as because well, that's again quite copper rich. But the global finest grade is regarded to be Congolese, of which this is from. This is Congo uh, Malachite. In eight seconds, we're taking it even lower. I agree with what wow. Mark was just saying. This is some of the best grades. It is. It's incredible. This one here is just Unbelievable. stunning, isn't it? And once seen, never forgotten. Wow. We used to do just plain round strands for more than that, Ross, didn't we? You're playing around malachite strands. But again, you've got to remember, wow. it, it, it's everywhere. Everywhere wants malachite in their jewellery. Please be mindful. I had a whole conversation with someone the other day who was showing me um, a, a malachite piece and, and it was painted. You know, please be careful. Make sure you source your gemstones um, from a, a trusted supplier. Hopefully you regard us as exactly that. Um, we do gemologically certify each and every single one of our gemstones as well, which you can also um, acquire. $39.99, Zara, Christine, London's Multibore, Kathy, well done, Sandra, Linda, Marion. I can't keep up. We only had 40 though, so it's extremely limited. And remember, free post as well. Um, how good is that? Take advantage of that, the free postage and packaging. The chain, by the way, we've got perfect chains. If you wanted to go for the, the Alhambra look in Mark's amazing projects, would they work together? They would, absolutely. Could I incorporate yeah, this you strand with your 12 o'clock yeah, yeah, projects? Yeah, easily. In fact, that would have lovely. And it? I would go with the amethyst, that Zambia, we've got the nice. most beautiful Zambian amethyst as well. Yeah, team it with the Zambian amethyst yeah. of the 12 o'clock. Oh, amazing. If you saw that and you didn't know the designer, you wouldn't in a million years think that they'd given it to me, would you? There's there's little tells. Oh, is there? Okay. But take that as a compliment. Right. You should. Your little sea beading um. details. I love that. <laughs> but I agree. It's one of those projects that mm. we normally see maybe with Susie. Yeah, yeah. That's amazing, Mark. No, I'm really pleased. Really pleased. Mark. Because this will go so hand in hand with your masterclass. Ross is suggesting oh. maybe going lower. But doesn't that have a telltale effect with the other strands? Yeah. Normally. Sometimes. Mm. Can you pass me the cry surprise? I certainly will. <gasps> that's that's my favourite, I think. And I love malachite. Glow. But with do you imagine, selenite. imagine those oh imagine them together. How beautiful are these? The visions of green. Two natural gemstones that defy belief that they're natural. We're going lower because it will go hand in hand with Mark's amazing project. Oh. What on earth? Again, I've got to say the words. I've brought you malachite rounds for more than what's on your screens. Um, this is effectively a master carving and it's also some of the best possible grade. The Ooh. world is hypnotized by the beauty of this gemstone. I remember an article, you know, it registers. When I read an article on gemstones, I, I, you obviously don't digest it all, but I remember word for word the sentence that the jewelry editor wrote about this gemstone malachite. The outlandish eccentric that once seen is never forgotten. It's true. Eccentric. It's true. You can imagine they'd be a very flamboyant, mm. eccentric character. Twenty nine ninety nine. Look at that. 
It's how those how those yeah. beautiful bands blend and almost disappear into the darkness. It's the ombre tone of the stripes yeah. as well. You follow a stripe from one end of the stone to the other, and it changes colour and graduates. It, see those yeah. two there? They almost look yeah. like they're, they're, they, you know, they just appear out they of the do. abyss. Yeah. Just cool. It's so cool. That those two that we were just looking at is like that bathroom. You yeah. know the. They're like satin rings, yeah. satin's rings, like that planets. one there. Yeah. yeah. A malachite bath? No, the one in the malachite bathroom. Did you see I'm it? sure I've seen a malachite bath. Oh. There is a malachite bath somewhere. I've seen, yeah, I thought I'd Who seen it. Who owns a malachite bath? You just passed it, Ross. There, uh, there, there. See what I mean? It's a bit moody. Yeah. That, I love that chandelier. That's lovely. That bathroom is yeah. like that recording that Adam's just done there. Yes. I like that bath too. That's very nice. And that would be vinyl, would it? Or yeah. tiles or something like that? Yeah, it's a print yeah. effectively. Yeah. It won't be the real gemstone. So the fact that they're going to all the work of printing a design to yeah. replicate a gemstone. I yeah. mean, that says it all, doesn't it, really? I can't think of any other stones mm -mm. that they would replicate. No. Why no. Not? I looked. I looked yeah. at malachite wallpaper once. Mm. Oof. Really. Really expensive. Very pricey. I actually approached wow. uh, Jake. I was like, "Yeah, can we do? Why don't we do a wallpaper on our sister channel?" And I, it was like, "We'll see what you're going to do there." Because. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Now look at this. From here, you've got this sort of lemony glow coming from underneath. That's incredible, isn't it? Again, if you imagine yourself mining gemstones or discovering a gemstone just randomly yeah. and all of a sudden you see this electric green. It's stunning. It's like lemon and lime, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, because all gorgeous. the green gemstone, this is the most. Yeah. And it does look almost yellow on your on your TV screens. It's very, it's quite Zavarite yes, green, isn't yeah. it? And it's colour saturation. Um, but, yeah, imagine seeing this peering from the ground. Again, For the first time, oh, can you imagine. You do know this is this is the Australian deposit, Roscoe. He knows, oh, he says, oh. of course I know well. So Christ appraised, again, another gemstone that lots of the big designers are working with. They used to really kind of restrict themselves to the big five once upon a time but now we're seeing you know the likes of dior working with christ appraise tiffany co working with christ wow. appraise harry winston working with christ appraise um yeah absolutely beautiful and that's again totally and utterly natural this strand they they're shoulder to shoulder so you get quite a lot mm, of them yeah, yeah, yeah. so what two four six eight ten twelve fourteen sixteen seventeen seventeen four leaf clo clovers how many have we got? 35. Yeah, more limited. So here we go. So what you're looking at here is your Australian chrysoprase, often referred to as Australian jade. Um, oh. And here's an article we can refer, uh, we can show you. Um, couples Australian jade boulder, likely world's biggest. On the surface, this is a 16.4 ton freak of wow. nature. Isn't much to look at, but veteran sapphire miners, Jenny and Jim Elliott, say this uh, semi-precious gemstone is one of, if not the world's biggest boulder of Australian jade. If you're thinking, what's Australian jade? Um, it's a, a term of endearment, I suppose, for mm. this beautiful gemstone that is Chrysoprase. And again, commands high, high, high prices. We've shown you uh, um, conversations that we had with jade traders when we were, uh, not jade, sorry, Chrysoprase traders when we were over in Tucson. There was one strand of Chrysoprase, wasn't there, or was it two? There it is. That's dollars, by the way, on that calculator. I don't know if it's per strand or if that's for both of them. Yeah. Either way, $3,020, and that's wholesale. That's a wholesale price. So Christ appraise, yeah, it does command high price, uh, high price tags. 70 carats that you're getting here from nine to 14 millimeters, but we are not stopping there. With that beautiful graduation. Again, the inspiration is coming by the bucket loads with the Alhambra yeah. today. We've got Mark's Amazing Masterclass. 
We've had the Marius's beautiful amber piece. Brand new strands, jewelry makers. Could stop here. But we'd let, we'd not, yeah, we're not. I agree. Yeah, this is what I was just saying. It's one of those gemstones. If you were literally mining gem and you saw that vivid green, you might even be a little bit concerned, mightn't you? Because the colour is... <gasps> we should have been 49.99, but Ross has taken an extra £10 off for you this morning, jewellery makers. Um, you get 17 motifs on this one strand because they are literally shoulder to shoulder. 39.99 from the... For the 35, did you say, that we originally had? Good luck, everyone. Good luck to each and every single one of you. They, it's always a popular gemstone, but not just here, sorry. Uh, not just here at Jewelry Maker, globally, internationally. So yeah, $3,000. Um, if you were, when, a couple of years ago when we were in Tucson. And that's because, again, big designers like Dior and Tiffany's and Co. There you go. Piaget are all working with this said same gemstone. Look at that. I love that cupcake ring. I think it's so cool. Is that what it's called? Yeah. Cupcake well, ring. I don't know if it's called that, but that's what I call it. Oh. Should be. Yeah. Sweet, isn't it? Kerry, Denise, Carol, California, Angela, London, Alice, Newport, Anne and Kent, Kathleen, Sarah, Susan, Christine, Elizabeth, Susan, Moira. Again, make sure you're checking out your baskets. And that's just one. All right, you'll be in 18 karat gold. And that looks to be like a rubelite, maybe even a pink sapphire. I'm not sure. But, um, but the bulk of that piece is all about the chrysoprase itself. You can see the quality of it, jewelry makers. Um, but yeah, that's the joy. We, you know, we travel all around the world, not me personally. Um, but our amazing gem buyers we, um, travel all around the world. Australia is a regular haunt, if you like, yeah. for amazing gemstones. We source a lot of our sapphires from there. Um, which, if you remember, those uh, the, the couple that actually discovered the Australian jade boulder are sapphire miners. So it probably discovered by chance. I've only got seven of these left, so well done. And there's only two more of your four-leaf clover designs to bring you. Um, so carnelian and a very beautiful labradorite labradorite <sighs> all coming your way make sure you check out your baskets everybody peach and purple tell me about it I can, i'm looking down on one of the stones here and i can see peaches and purples yeah ross um mark has just said those exact <sighs> words it's the best he's ever seen look at that oh <gasps> Oh, these are going to sell out. Oh, my goodness, there's blue sheen. How often do we get this stone at the moment? Hardly ever. Hardly ever, yeah. And it used to be a staple back in the old days, yeah. didn't it? Every single hour would have. But I, can I be really honest? I, so I used to worry about labradorite. Because you remember, we've got floodlights above, above oh, us. Yeah, Not yeah, one yeah. single light source. So whenever I used to pick up a labradorite stone, I was like, oh, please mm. show the labradorescence, please show yeah. the labradorescence. I could see it but whether you could actually see mm. it on the camera. I, I don't have to work at this at all. Ready? No. Ready? It's going to prove me wrong now, isn't it? Mm. There you go. That's stunning, that peach. That's really rare, the peach tones. The peach tones. Look at that. This one here. Come on. All about the blue sheen. Okay, I'm gonna put it to the back of my hand and then you can see them all. Oh my goodness, you're not wrong, Ross. Mm. <gasps> That's yeah. purple, that one. Yeah. Did you see the purple? There it is, there it is, yeah. Turquoise blue on the other side. Look at that, if I just keep my hand moving, you will see, there's the peach, there's the, peach. There's the blues. There's the purples. Oh my goodness me. Every wow, single one has that amazing magic. At first when you see Labradorite, you think it's this deep, dark, moody gemstone. But then actually when it turns itself towards the light, you see this, the, the, the beautiful Aurora Borealis spectrum mm. naturally forming within this gem. And it's tiny platelets perfectly aligned 
literally almost like almost like layers are of uh, of a loaf of bread literally layering on top of one another and the light hit, hitting each of those layers that's what produces this phenomena and we're at 49.99 mark's right to ask the question when was the last time we yeah. had labyrinth in any in any shape no, i've probably seen it once or twice this year so far yeah in one form or another see the purple see mm -hmm. the blue see the peach Look at that. that purple is amazing that's uber uber yeah, rare yeah, yeah, yeah. that's uber uber rare so is the blue sheens that you're getting i agree ross uh, mark yeah, finest yeah, grade gorgeous. that's amazing and then of course faceted well they're not going to carve it into a four-leaf clover if it no, wasn't no, this no, grade. no you're right good luck everyone i have <laughs> how many 40 and they're not going to hang around. We've gone straight down to it at £29.99. pence. Lucy in Derbyshire, Kimberly, Paula, Denise, uh, Barbara. Hello to you, Magali. Hello to you, Ayrshire. Hello to you, Gillian, Kathleen. This is our penultimate of your four-leaf clovers as well. Yeah, do you know, the reality is we should sell one of those for, for, three for that quid price. Each. Yeah, that's three ridiculous. Three quid each. When that's you've got blue honestly. sheen, yeah, yeah. when you've got peach, when you've got purple. Wow. Absolutely unbelievable. This needs to be separated with a couple of inches of chain in between each mm. one, doesn't it? Yeah, I think I probably would do yeah. them on their own. Yeah, yeah. You know? Yeah, like the you know the ones where you just literally yeah. have one in the centre of the of the neckline. Mm. Stunning, absolutely stunning. I don't have enough. The penultimate of your four leaf clover, and my goodness, what an amazing strand it is too. If you love. Yes, if you love your clovers, then we have got the amazing masterclass with Mark as well. Um, that is centered around the four leaf mm. clover design, but with a twist. I had no intention of doing that. It wasn't until I finished that I thought, oh, I've done the clovers. It gives me, it, it gives yeah. me, um, yeah, it is more Louis Vuitton. Mm. Ah, yes, Adam, mm. that's perfect. It's more, more the Louis Vuitton motif. Oh. We'll show you that. Okay, that. yeah, yeah. Show yeah. you that. Now there's one more, the finale. This is amazing. Oh, this is so juicy. Look at that two-tone one, look. <laughs> I adore Carnelian. It it's, is like it's nice to see it again. We've had a couple of strands this year, haven't we? It's just been... Oh, look. One of the few other oh. stones that Van Cleef do actually use, yeah. Because there's no, no, there's no other orange gemstone like Carnelian, no, in my opinion. No. It is, you know, literally, if you can imagine like the fruit itself, it's that in a gemstone. I love the mottled tones in this. Ooh. They're a different mixture of colours. It's like blood orange. It's yeah. gorgeous. Yes. yes. Yeah. Oh, they're delicious, aren't they? Mm. Yeah. Now, jewellery makers, do we have the same quantity? Yeah. It's the finale. Should we do the lowest price of the entire selection? And those of you that have been paying attention know just how low we've been today. Beautiful quality carnelian. That wonderful, oh, like a sunset. Look at that. Like an African sunset. You can gorgeous, see the warmth, the heat that glows yeah. naturally in this gemstone. Mark's completely right. It is a gem that we almost just disappeared, just disappeared from our portfolio for a period of time. $24.99. Oh, wow. it's so beautiful, Carnelian. I just gravitate towards it. Do you know what I do? I was just thinking that alternate them on a necklace would be beautiful. It's got the same sort of hue and tone about it, but the yeah. different colours, doesn't it? Translucency too. Yeah, yeah. Love it. Absolutely love it. Well done to our collectors who have got involved. Yeah, Car wow. uh, Van Cleef do use Carnelian. Um, I think Adele's got a carnelian one. She's got a carnelian bracelet. Mm. Yeah, that beautiful warmth. Perfect for this summer, uh, for this this season. But actually saying that, so autumn as well. Um, well done, everybody. Now, coming up after a very short break, we've got some closeout deals on some amazing pearls. And we have Mark's amazing masterclass all about, I mean, look at the pieces of jewellery. Um, the gemstones that you have, Mark, you've got Amazing. meter long lengths of, uh, of sterling silver, but then you've got the, type um, A jade. The amethyst has got a two meter length. Has of it? Chain. Yeah. And then, yeah. so is that green jade and then, and then but the green, black? black and amethyst. Wow. Yeah. They've all got the, the double stoppers, five of each. But you're yeah. right. This isn't, this isn't a usual no. Mark project hour. No. But I like that. Mm. 
I like that, to see people's sort of different takes. Um, okay, that's coming up. Plus your closeout deals on your amazing pearls, jewelry makers, don't go anywhere. Join us after this. <laughs> Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewellery making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8am until 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Our UK-based call centre is always on hand to assist you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Here at Jewellery Maker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard PMP is $3.95. Charges may differ outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option of $5.95. Shopping made easy on Jewelry Maker. Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there, you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Shopping with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website, from your jewellery room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewellery Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewellery Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewellery Maker. Are you new to Jewellery Maker? Well, we want to help you on your jewellery making journey. When you purchase with us for the first time, you'll receive the Jewellery Maker Handbook, which is filled with 35 different techniques, as well as lots of hints and tips to help you on your way. Jewellery Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Never miss a show by watching on the go with the Jewelry Maker app. Head over to your app store now and search Jewelry Maker and simply download to your smartphone or tablet. You can watch the shows live and see your favorite presenters and guests. Click on the Today button to shop all of the products that are featured on today's show. Want to know what's hot? Then click here to see today's best sellers and highlights. Have you missed a show or want to watch one back? Then click on the schedule button and you can go back seven days to watch and shop and you can also see what's coming up over the next seven days. Want to say hello or ask a question to our guests? Then send a message to the studio. You can also keep in touch with all the latest news, events, product launches and much more by clicking for our social media pages. Never miss a show by watching On The Go with Jewelry Maker. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Jewellery Maker gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says Gift Cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email. Then decide the value you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion or just a way to say thank you, the Jewellery Maker gift card is the perfect answer. Did you know that instructions come included with every designer project? Dive right into your Jewellery Maker project with confidence and clarity. Whether you're a seasoned pro or a first-time creator, our step-by-step -step guides ensure success every time. 
Just download them from your Joymaker account on our website. Get started today and experience the joy of hassle-free crafting. Instructions included, creativity unleashed. We've moved back. Mm. It's nice over here. Would you prefer which side? I, 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 I don't really mm. mind. Mm. I like it in both parts. It'd be nice to have a big green screen behind us and then like waterfall scenes or wildebeest going across the Kenyan plains and things. That'd be lovely, wouldn't it? That would be nice. Instead, we've got yeah. a board of tools. Yeah, no, which is good. That's lovely too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's yeah. your favourite wildlife animal? As giraffe. Yeah, I love giraffes. Giraffes are ace. It's my favourite animal. It's always been my favourite animal. I love them. Yes. I love their gangliness and yes. the lollopiness. But they're hench though yeah. at the same time, aren't yeah. they? Hench? Well, yeah, is that a kid's word? Is it? I don't know. Hench? I don't know. I've is never it? heard of that. As in muscular. Oh. Musc they're very muscular and strong. Hench. Oh, yeah. I've never heard of that. <laughs> oh. Like Adam's hench. Uh, is Adam, are you? Right. Would you would you describe yourself as hench? Oh. No, not so much, oh. he says. Um, yeah, we went to the zoo not so long ago. It's a oh, conservation Okay. It is, and yeah. they had they had some giraffes there. Mm. No, no, they, they do. I they just kind of mm, yeah, I love them. Elope yeah. around, don't they? Anyway, um, what we're about to bring you, jewelry makers. Wow. Yeah, it is a wow, isn't it? It is. Yeah, yeah. Because I'll go as far as saying, Ross, we've brought sapphire for probably the past decade mm. here at jewelry maker. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Um, and we've brought you from loads of different locations around the world before. I don't know the location, but I have to say this is some of the best saturation. That's the colour is amazing, isn't, isn't it? it? That's yeah. the first thing I noticed yeah. about this, the colour. And when we're talking about the big four, it is more about the four C's, of course. Carrot weight, colour, no particular order, clarity and cut. Do I, do I say this? in? To work with sapphire is is you know it's, it's pretty amazing, especially when there's so many big designers. I'm not talking about sort of like the calibrated cuts that we see all the time, don't mm. we? But are working with beads like Cartier is a big one. Um, Cartier, I spoke about tassels a couple of was it last week, Roscoe, when I was talking about tassels, and I showed historically tassels through the years, and Cartier worked quite heavily with faceted sapphires, oh, rubies, right. um, also incorporated pearls mm. quite a lot. This for me, and this is only my opinion, is crying out to be a Cartier inspired tassel because the quality of it is absolutely unbelievable. Now, the moment you see it up close, you, I, I guarantee you will agree with Mark mm. and my feelings on this one. The saturation, is absolutely amazing. I think we get a bit blasé working here, don't we, with the gemstones that Very we bring much. on a daily basis. Very much so. And then there's something like this just sort of, it, it, it sort of reignites our passion again, doesn't it? Yeah. And you just think, wow. We're very privileged. <laughs> it, it, it does. Blase is the perfect word. Yeah. But, I mean, Mark, we see sapphire on a regular basis, mm. don't we, here? And it, but you do become a little bit, ah, oh, sapphire. You know, it's, no, this is sapphire. Sapphire, yeah. You know, like <laughs> wow. My mum and dad bought me a sapphire ring for my twenty-first birthday. Oh, did they? Yeah. And it's tiny. The carrot weight of the oh, sapphire yeah. is absolutely tiny. You're right. We are blasé, Mark, because look mm. at how much you get. Yeah. It's a full strand, not twenty centimeters like we used to do. It's a full thirty-eight centimeter strand. Colour, and it's though. totally natural. Now, I know you've heard this countless times before, jewelry makers, but 95% of oh, the yes. world's sapphire is treated. Yeah, yeah. So, either heat treated or diffused or fissure filled, 95% of it. This is all natural. So, to have that saturation of colour and be natural is amazing. Plus, you're getting a cool 40 <laughs> carats. 40 carats. Yeah, oh. 
you know earlier on this morning yeah it is that, that that's the thing normally natural can be quite navy i suppose but because you have this quality it's much more burmese blue isn't yeah. it it's more yeah. burmese sapphire blue i wouldn't call it salon blue because in my head salon is is more of a baby pink a baby blue um burmese blue is this it's like it's like a, um well think about the royal engagement ring mm. for example it's this blue look at that that's extraordinary <laughs> how many do we have ross 60 oh. on the nose now ross says i'm going to show you how how good a deal you're going to get on this fine quality natural sapphire we could stop off along the way, couldn't we? We could say, oh look, you know, elsewhere, we've just referenced Cartier working with quality like this. And it wouldn't be, it's not unfathomable, is it? Yeah, I remember this. I, um, so I've, I've brought to you a presentation before when we've launched Natural Blue Sapphire. I don't know this bracelet's natural, firstly, it just says Blue Sapphire. But a beaded bracelet, could you make that, jewellery makers? 265 pounds you can make that bracelet probably three times over yeah. what about that one with an 18 carat yellow gold spacer bead 160 pounds it's a stretchy i gonna yeah I, i'm gonna repeat what adam's just said in my in our ear i think yours is better quality yeah. your first price crash but not where we are closing what? What? Four oh. millimeter natural sapphires of this quality. They're not dark. You know, sometimes sapphire can be so <laughs> deeply saturated it almost becomes borderline midnight black. blue. Yeah, yeah. You know? Like black, yeah. 20 um, quid. Yeah, we're not stopping there, Mark. But Ross said, I think 60 could sell out at this price tag. We got a great deal. You get a great deal, jewellery makers. It is no reflection of the quality, how low our price tag is. The quality is remarkable. Do you know, I would more than happily, from one gemstone lover to another, sit here and bring this to you as a big star by opportunity and say, 99 pounds and 99 pence, jewellery makers. It's natural sapphire. You get 40 carats of it. It's a full 38 centimetre strand. They're four mil. You know, if I was to say 100 pounds, would we all agree? Let's be honest. That's an amazing deal. Where else? What other jeweler in the world would be able to bring you that kind of deal? We start at 19.99, and we close. Mm. Move that decimal point. Mm. It's still a great deal. Yeah. It's still an amazing deal, isn't it? Wow. Well done. Um, hello, Miss Janet, saying I love sapphire, super special, as my gro uh, grandparents oh. gave it to me on my 18th birthday. Jewelry maker natural sapphire is stunning, lucky us. Mm. Oh, bless you. Yes, we, um, um, as long as, for as long as we go, you know what, that's 14 99 but that's no reflection of the true value or worth. Please, 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 if you make your piece of jewellery, people have a perceived value of sapphire, rightly so. They're not wrong it's to not do that. that. <laughs> it's not 14 99 No, no. You know, we've referenced this a couple of times, Mark, because we've got free postage and packaging today. That's a bottle of wine in it some is. places. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Isn't it? Yep. 14 99 for 40 carats. If I was to say to some of my, my, you know, my best friends who are not necessarily in the jewellery or gemstone world, okay, you can buy a carrot of natural sapphire for fourteen ninety nine. They'd be like, okay, you've got forty today in this opportunity, but there is only sixty. Um, in fact, I've got less than that because there's tons of you there. Jennifer, Josie, Susan, and Brian, five. Amanda's got four. I don't blame you, Amanda. Janet, Linda, Tessa, Jane, Cheshire, Hilda, California, Elaine, Zara, Elizabeth in London, Carol, Sharon in Essex, Jean in Surrey, Persis, Lynn. It's going to sell out. Miriam, Barbara, Tracy, Ruby, uh, yeah. Maker, Grace, Anne, Susan, Sandra, Lydia in Pennsylvania, all around the world getting involved today. Also, Mark. Perfect. It goes yeah. beautifully with your project in the next yeah. hour, doesn't it? Oh, look at that. that just blue. just casually some type A jade eye and some natural blue sapphire draped across the back of my I've hand. I've no idea what these kits are going to. Um, 
I mean, Ross is in. The, Ross is at mm. the helm. Mm. It'll be a great deal. Um, it'll be a great deal. <laughs> good luck, everyone. This is a good stone for gents as well, I think. Yeah. It's got that because it's got that moody blue, you know. It's, a moody, a moody yeah, blue. Yeah. Loving that, absolutely <laughs> loving that. And if it's good enough for Cartier and Bulgari and Chopard and all of those big designers that equally work with faceted rounds, they do. It's not just your calibrated sizes. They've done. I think it was when we went over the history of the tassel. Cartier featured quite heavily, didn't they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Um, in that in that presentation, um, the final few, lots and lots and lots of multi buyers. When you think about it this way, sixty is thirty people multi buying. Um, and we've got Brenda who's got two, Therese has got two, someone I saw had got four. I've got lots of twos in baskets. Maker's got two, Jane in Shropshire's got two in her basket. Julian Tyne and has got two in her basket. Um, so you get the general gist. How many do you have oh. left, Roscoe? Okay, single figure quantity. So we'll leave that with you. Amazing. Well done. Okay. Oh, I was eyeing these up this morning. Big closeout deal coming your way on the fireball pearl that comes with the peg. Wow. Big closeout deal on that one. But also, we have a closeout deal on the more roundish Baroque. But just before that, I don't know if you've noticed something about this. There's a definitely a defining feature in that peg bale, isn't there? Oh. Should we do the peg bale now? Shall we? Okay. Would this be good for April? It, it might well be. Mm. I bought oh, these the first gosh. time they were launched and much like I'm sure so many of you will do, you'll, fe you'll feature on the finest pearls that you have. Because yes, Mark's right, that is a pure oh, colourless white God. diamond in nine carat white gold. No. Oh. I was pitching for gold for ages. You have been, yeah. Ages. Because of the quality, we've just brought you natural blue sapphire. We bring you South Sea, um, Akoya, Tahitian pearls, Baroque pearls, all of which, you know, I'm not saying only do gold, absolutely include silver still, but we definitely should have that offering, shouldn't we? Look at the quality of that diamond. That's a 57 facet round brilliant cut diamond. One of the best diamonds we've seen on jewelry making. I agree, Adam. I totally agree. White Good gold. luck in white gold. Look at that. Remember, with a colourless diamond, you want it to be as pure white. You want it to be void two. of inclusions. They've got two available. Yeah, one. Well done. Um, I do also have. Oh the white gold word. without any diamonds they are perfect for the pearls that are coming up that we're going to do a close out deal for the fireball comes up next notice they've got the burr as well so it's going to really adhere to your pearl. and it's just simple glue isn't it Mark? is this the first white gold we've done uh i've never seen white gold on the show before i'm not sure white gold and fireball pearl and that's the thing you know <sighs> a massive close out coming your way on the fireball but this is the thing look you might i know i know silver has its place it really does and i love silver too but if i had the choice and it was okay you can either get a white gold or you can get a silver version i know which one i would gravitate towards um 79 pounds and 99 pence it's and, and it does elevate the value of your piece of jewelry absolutely elevates that value um by just mentioning that it's solid gold 79.99 but not your price <laughs> what for nine carat gold nine carat white gold 
Nine carat white gold. You could use these on your jadeite master carvings as well, yeah, couldn't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, That'd be amazing. Because I, I would put gold with jadeite, mm. personally, as well as silver. But, you know, it's, it's one of those, it's your high-end gemstones that you would choose to put alongside your gold offerings. Um, and, yeah, it is our pearls that really have been sort of driving me to mention that we should have gold. We should, you know, it, it can be a smaller offering, I suppose, in terms of quantities, yeah, yeah. but we should actually have that offering for our viewers. Thirty-four pounds and ninety-nine pence. Rita, hello to you, new customer. Jay, Karen, London makers in Surrey. If you want the multiples, I would check out. How many do we have? Twenty-six is where we started, so it's not a massive quantity of them at all. Um, again, and there's a brightness to white gold for me. It does. I can. You can recognize. They look similar, don't get me wrong, but actually when you put white gold alongside silver, there is a difference there. It's a lot whiter, um, and that's from the rhodium that's often used to actually coat it. Well done, everybody. Um, do stay where you are on the phone lines for that. Know. Massive closeout deal opportunity on your fireball pearls. Should we ever say close out when we're talking about <laughs> something that is as difficult and inaccessible as a pearl? Never. You know, pearls have no. never been more valuable than where they are right now. We have 45, but they're all going to go today. Fireballs also, it's like a little lottery win to the pearl harvesters because whenever they harvest pearls, the goal is, well, I say goal, they'll set out to be rounds. But occasionally, obviously they're not always perfectly spherical, occasionally, whatever, that mollusk has got, all, or, or oyster has got, um, alternative intentions and it's like no I'm going to put like an abundance of nacre I'm going to create <laughs> this flurry. beautiful yeah flurry yeah, yeah. Um, like a comet tail across it yeah, and the more nacre that you have the more luster that you have which is ultimately the most what you want your pearls to have because that's what produces that mirror like luster and that's what produces the spectrum of color I love the fact that each fireball pearl will be unique to you it's like folds of silk, but then with those colours. I mean, can yeah. you see the reds? Can you see the purples? Oh, that's incredible. Pistachio isn't it? greens and blues. All in one fireball pearl. It is that little winning lottery ticket of the pearl harvesting process. We're gonna do a massive closeout deal. This is not a small fireball pearl either. It's half drilled as well. So, hang on a minute, jewelry makers. See if I can. Sometimes they need reaming, but I'll give it a whirl. No, oh, no, this one doesn't. I need trimming down a little bit, the peg. <laughs> I mean, that's hot. Yeah, that's high-end jewellery. One of the finest pearls with diamonds and gold. Easily. Look at that metallic luster. Yeah, it's so reflective, isn't it? 99.99 here at Jewellery Maker. That's an amazing price point, isn't it? Ross says, I've guaranteed a closeout deal. And it isn't this. <laughs> it's one of the most metallic fireball pills. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Plus, it's on two way split pay, so it shows we're already too low. Um, Ross has just said, I'm tempted to buy this during this auction. You get it about you get a better price, yeah, yeah, yeah. I would, you know what, you could, and, and I'm gonna sound quite uh, what would be the word. No, frugal maybe, because you could literally buy these, stick them on Etsy, and sell them at significant profit. Couldn't you? Massively so. It's a natural fireball pearl. Even without edu educating your customers that pearls have never been more expensive than they are right now, we all know that 29.99 is already far too low. It's a brand new low. This has never been anywhere near this price tag. And if they don't sell out today, there's people here wow. in the studio that will definitely be getting them, I think. That's amazing. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Look at that quality, Mark. Look at that quality. So how many and years old do you think it is? Probably, depends on the, on the temperature of the water. Mm. 
for maybe a couple of years, wow. two, three years. It's been looked after. It's been looked after. That they've doesn't get taken into account, oyster. does no, it? No, no. They've turned that oyster to, so that the nacre is obviously coating that pearl beautifully. And then, but what they don't know, all that time no, that's invested. No, they don't know what's in there. No. Firstly, if it's producing mm, a pearl. Yeah, Secondly, yeah. you know, what the quality is going to be like. Remember, from a harvest of 10,000 pearls, less than 10 will be naturally metallic. Look at that. It's got reds. When have we ever seen reds in a fireball pearl before? Amazing. Well done, everybody. They're flying out. Christine Warwickshire, Kent, tell it to you, Mandy, wow. Sally, Kim's got two. Ooh, pair of earrings, maybe, Kim. Um, Peter and Sharon, hello to you. Hilda, Angela, maybe going for some earrings, or are you thinking about gifts? A pair of these earrings elsewhere. Well, you think of the prices of Yoko and London that also do natural pearls like this, and they are thousands, absolutely thousands, especially if you put something like gold alongside mm. it. You know, yeah, it's not unrealistic, is it, to say, even if we said high three figures, it isn't unrealistic, the quality of the actual pearl. Look at that split payment. Wow. That's um, exclusive expensive jewellery shop in Stratford-upon-Avon yeah. that, you, that you look at sometimes. Do they do pearls in there? Mm, oops. Um, yes, no, not Pragnos. Yes, they do. Right. I don't know if they've got coloured ones there, no, though, at the moment. No, not many people do. I'm not do. sure. Mm. But... Ross, you went away, Pragnall's in Stratford, yeah. And they had amazing imperial topaz that you'd oh. ever seen. They did, but you took a photograph, didn't you, Ross, of natural, uh, naturally coloured pearls? And but oh, were they, they were just round. Just right, round. Just, just round. <laughs> but how much were they, like £500? Yeah, £500 for, for a, a pair. pair of, yeah, they're so, they're so expensive. So, mm, so, God. just simple pearl stud earrings from that jewellers, and they were £500. They're not fireball pearls. We are so blasé, in wow. particular with our pearls. Things are going to change, though. They are. Well, we can't hide from it, really, no. the desirability of this gemstone. It's not just here in the UK, it's global. It's ridiculous, frankly, that we're bringing this to you at twenty nine ninety nine. Here you go. I mean, and by the way, these are old prices, so this has yeah. probably gone up. But look at this, for, uh, 14 karat yellow gold amethyst. Can you get amethyst for, I'm sure we've brought you amethyst like that for a fiver before here at Jewelry Maker. Um, <coughs> and natural, <coughs> excuse me, pink Brock pearls, $1,049, uh, sorry. Wow. Yours are better. <laughs> Yours is better, I think, because you've got more colors. But it's not unrealistic. And you'll probably get more uniform sizes. I actually don't like the fact that they're, they're so irregular. Um, and they're more flat, aren't they? Rather, yours is like yes, a full teardrop yeah. shape. I've got 10, with, uh, 10 left. I'll leave those final few with you. Absolutely amazing. Now, oh, I have got the other purple one. This is cute. Can I just reference Yoko of London? Purple pearls. You, uh, Yoko of London, which is arguably one of the finest jewellery houses in the UK, high-end jewellery by their own admission, and one of the things that they specialise in is pearls. In fact, I think on those photographs, they're pearls. I don't know if this is still available, but the Novus necklace, this is pre-pearl mania as I refer to it as, a beautiful matched natural purple pearl necklace in 18 karat rose gold. Now, there's not a massive amount of rose gold in no, there, I have no. to say. If you wanted to buy that necklace, it's going to set you back £22,500. Is that today's price or when this picture was? That's when this picture was. I wonder was what it is now then. It's, I don't think they can even make it now. Right. It's not on their website anymore. Oh, okay. So you can't replace this. If they could, I reckon that price is probably four times that now. By oh. the price, if I look, if I was to, and that's not an overstatement, the price of pearls have skyrocketed. We spoke to a gentleman in Hong Kong, knowing we weren't going there to buy pearls, who was talking about all varieties, freshwaters, Akoyas, South Seas, Tahitian pearls, and one single pearl was like 10,000 pounds. 
The pearls have never been more expensive than they are right now. We are blasé about it. Um, the pearls that you see are pearls that we've been we've bought maybe three years ago, and that's the only reason you're getting these prices. Right. Look at this, the Novus ring. Two thousand three hundred. Pair of earrings. Five thousand seven hundred. These are these are old prices, jewelry makers. I don't understand this design. This this is, this always foxes me. I just don't I don't get it. Why would you go to all that trouble and expense to have half of it hidden behind the lobe? I think they're meant to be reversible. Right. But half of it is going to be hidden away yeah. at some point. I just don't. Uh, Strange. There they are. Oh, here we are. So, oh, th thank you, Ava. Thank you. What are the you. prices there? So, for the ones at the bottom, let's look at yeah. the ones at the bottom because they're the ones most like these. Yeah. What you're about to see. Natural purple pearls. Yeah. For a pair. £535. You yeah. can't say there's a huge amount of gold in those. No. There's a, there's a post. Gosh. Ours looks a bit darker as well. Yeah. It's More a, intense. Yeah, it's, it? a, it's a deeper colour. Ross is saying they weren't <laughs> that great. They weren't, they weren't, he was like, he was disappointed that the stand's dirty as yeah, well. Yeah, yeah. You're right though, Ross, the, the, mm. the Orient isn't as bright. It looks a bit uninspiring just plonked there on that little stand as well, doesn't mm. they? Mm. 535 pounds. But, um, but one thing I have to say, they're not wrong in their pricing. No, no. That's right. It's us that's massively wrong. Now I have one, so you will need to buy two. Pardon? Wow. Let's match that price. As in, we'll half it. 535 divided by two. 267 pounds. Okay. Yeah, okay. You know we're not stopping there. Natural, purple, freshwater pearl. Flawless, a flawless orient. The lowest that we have ever oh, taken no. this to previously, jewellery makers, is about to appear. How many do we have? 70 available. Okay, I mean, that's unbelievable, isn't it? So that makes those earrings, you could make a version of those earrings for £100 today. Um, Gosh. Again, again, am I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to blow your trumpet, jewellery makers. <laughs> this is why I think you should be approaching jewellers. Mm. This is genuinely... Make a pair of earrings, approach jewellers, say, I do this, would you, like to, would you like to buy them from me? Because I bet they would absolutely yes. jump at the chance. Because there's no way that Pragnall would have, would have no, bought them for no. what's on your screens. No way. I doubt it. Listen, I'm not a buyer for them, but I very much doubt it. Jewellery makers. Because you remember, how, also, how many times have I said this? Usually a minimum of 400% margin. In a jewellers. Is that what it is? Minimum plus that, yeah, plus VAT. So I reckon it's cost them more to make wow. those earrings than it's about to cost you. By my calculations. My favourite markup is when you go to a restaurant, the price you pay for a glass of wine is yeah. generally the price they pay for the bottle. Yeah. Amazing. It's pretty similar to a jewellers yeah. markup, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Never been any lower than $49.99, jewellery makers. We've got 70 of these available. Half drilled, beautiful natural colour. Ross says... <laughs> Ross, why... Half it, but still not done. Oh, no. There, it makes no sense and i get it we get customers saying why are you doing that then if you can't buy them at this price it's a fair question it is a fair <laughs> question i ask that same question mm. as well from time to time we could literally take these and set up we've done with it, it, it yeah, with, yeah. Other, with jade for example we encountered the same conversation yeah, we did. didn't we mark we yeah, we're yeah, like yeah. okay yeah. Well, why don't you send, send sell it back into a trade we can, but there wouldn't be much of a shopping channel then, would no, there? No. We can do that. We did set up our own gem booth in Tucson um, and did very well out of it. Not Jewelry Maker, that was Gem Poor. did very well out of it. That was at market price. Um, but there wouldn't be much of a shopping channel. 
I can't believe we're going any lower than this. No. We shouldn't have been any lower than 49.99. That was a great deal. Lowest ever price. We've halved it, but going even lower again. I've been stocking up on these. Wow. Good luck, everyone. We are so far removed in the current situation of pearls. Nineteen ninety nine. You pop into new look, you can get some costume mm. pearls for that. Yeah. Not real natural, rare nat. I used to call the purple pearl. Well, I still do the impossible pearl, because to get that colour, it has to nav it has to kind of migrate to the circumference of the oyster itself, where it has the hold uh, the, the 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 sorry intensity of purples. They are rare hybrid pearls that will actually produce a natural purple colour as well. That's not dyed. That's not treated in any way, shape, or form. And here we are bringing it to you in a casual 20 quid. Do you remember years, like about three years ago, Mark, we talk about that little purple pearl that was discovered in a clamshell. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah. You know, and it sold for thousands of pounds. Yeah. Or he sold it for thousands of pounds. That's one purple pearl. You've got a larger size by the looks. Um, and it's at 20 quid today. The only reason and the only, the only way that we are making such opportunities possible is because we are, and this is again not me exaggerating, one of the largest pearl buyers certainly in the West, or certainly were. I was going to say we were. Yeah, yeah, certainly were. Nobody could really, not even Yoko of London can actually remake some of their finest pieces of jewellery for £22,000 because of the accessibility of the pearls. Now, keep on dialing through jewellery makers. Wow. Um, coming up after a very, very short break, we've got your wall of fame and then we've got the most amazing masterclass with, uh, with Mark. All about, I mean, these are high-end projects, aren't They're they, lovely. Mark? Um, yeah. A bit of Taipei black jadeite, a bit of Taipei green jadeite, and amethyst, all coming with sterling silver, spaces and chain. You know what? Okay, sorry, the amethyst is with the base metal. Amazing, wow. that doesn't look base metal at no, all. No, no. Okay, we're going to put them all on pre-order, jewellery makers. Don't go anywhere, and of course you've got Mark's amazing inspiration and knowledge. Don't go anywhere, join us after this. <laughs> Did you know that instructions come included with every designer project? Dive right into your jewellery maker project with confidence and clarity. Whether you're a seasoned pro or a first time creator, our step by step guides ensure success every time. Just download them from your jewellery maker account on our website. Get started today and experience the joy of hassle free crafting. Instructions included, creativity unleashed. Shopping with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website from your jewelry room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewelry Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewelry Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewellery Maker. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Jewellery Maker gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says Gift Cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email then decide the value you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion, or just a way to say thank you, the Jewelry Maker gift card is the perfect answer. Are you new to Jewelry Maker? Well, we want to help you on your jewelry making journey. When you purchase with us for the first time, you'll receive the Jewelry Maker handbook, which is filled with 35 different techniques as well as lots of hints and tips to help you on your way. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share.
Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewellery making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8am until 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Here at Jewelry Maker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard P&P is $3.95, charges may differ outside the UK, or upgrade to our premium option of $5.95. Shopping made easy on Jewelry Maker. I'm very excited about this this masterclass because we've got three beautiful projects but in terms of the components mark you know you could literally just sort of piece those components together as is couldn't you absolutely no and the drill holes are large enough to get the chain through See? really yeah yeah so they're, they're amazing you could literally feed the the, the mm. spacers onto the chain yeah now they're all available yeah. on pre-order but and they're flying on pre-order oh. as well. Mark, I mean, beautiful designs as I'm always. I'm really pleased. I'm really pleased. Well, um, I did the black necklace first of all, because that's what I wanted to do the project this on. One. Yeah. And then I thought, well, I need, I'm, I'm, I really, then I did the jade eye, which is completely different. Yeah. And I've, used, I've just added some featherweight head pins to make the little bubbly bits. Um, and then I thought, what should I do for the, for the amethyst? So I thought, well, I'll do the, um, Alhambra, and then I—I I don't know how it happened. It just came up with this gave it a tweak. completely different look. I love so, it. So we mentioned yeah. um, in the last oh, hour, the Mark. Louis Vuitton. Yeah, yeah. Okay. because I mean, I'll be honest. I've not actually seen this before with Louis Vuitton until they announced to the world that they they are um, actually including Amazonite in their offering. But yes, yours is very Louis Vuitton. Oh, we'll show that funny. in a second. Yeah. But first, let's show off your wonderful creations um, in the Wall of Fame. Do you want to start Oh, off? yes, definitely. Take it away. So first entry for today is from lovely Linda. Linda is number 852. And Linda says, good morning and love to all. Oh. My entry for this week's Wall of Fame is a necklace with a twist. The twist being the copper connectors which are made from the staples off of the JM delivery boxes. Oh, wow! Well, that's ingenious. To make the necklace, I've used copper wire, 0.8mm, to make the jump rings, dyed blue magnesite rounds in 6, 8, 10 millimetre rounds, and I've coiled and twisted the staples from the boxes from my orders connected with a copper S-clasp. All components to make this necklace are from JM, including the box. Including the box. That, That's amazing, that Linda. Is in, I'm going to have a double look at that. That's amazing. How clever. Oh, yeah, look. Oh, yeah. They're ingenious. I love that. These. I absolutely love that. You're looking everything, using everything. That is inspired. Bless you, Linda. That is amazing. Well done, Linda. <laughs> I have number 853, um, a beautiful pendant oh. from uh, Vera Barini. Hello, Vera. Uh, morning jewelry makers my creation is a pendant made with gorgeous crazy lace agate cabochon enhanced by bezeling it with jewelry maker gallery wire all from jewelry maker good luck to all who enter the draw um you have to be in it to win it how true that is vera well done and good wow. luck to you you're 853 that's beautiful 
This is a very beautiful set as well. This is from Catherine, number 854. Hi all at JM, here is my entry for this week. It's a white freshwater culture pearl nugget bracelet I purchased some years ago with two millimeter faceted round amethysts. I've had them in my stash for a while as I didn't know what to make with them. I have a very special friend who's turning 60 next month so I decided to make this bracelet an earring set for her as she loves pearls. I finished the bracelet and earrings off with sterling silver findings, all from Jewelry Maker. Good luck to all who enter in this week's draw. I'm sure your friend will love that. I'm sure she will. And that is a bonus friend. of it being handmade. Yeah, lucky friend. Well done. Well done. Good luck to you, Catherine. Um, I have a, a lovely Aww. piece of jewellery from Michelle Mason. Hello, Michelle. Uh, your number 855. Um, and beautifully photographed as well. Morning to uh, Jewelry Maker crew and viewers. This is my entry into this week's Wall of Fame. A jade necklace using sterling silver twisted wire and a roller chain, all from yourselves. Made for a friend who is going through a very tough time at the moment. Good luck to all and fingers crossed for a win. Oh, bless you. How thoughtful everybody mm -hmm. is. And how wonderful yeah. that you can create these one-of-a-kind pieces of jewellery for your nearest and dearest. That's beautiful, Michelle. Mm -hmm. You're number 855. Number 856 is from Anna. Morning lovely team, I hope you're all well. Please find this week's entry for the Wall of Fame, a sterling silver heart on heart pendant. I'm getting a little better at soldering as I've managed to solder both hearts but also add a bale without melting it. Hope you like it, good luck to all in the draw and that's from lovely Anna. Amazing! That is incredible. Sorry, I've just noticed uh, something. Oh. The same piece of jewellery. Ah. Oh, it's okay. Yeah, right. Cool. Um, 857. That's amazing, wow. Anna. Well done. 857 is from Joe Hall. Hello, Joe. Um, hi, y'all. Uh, this necklace and bracelet set is made from jewelry maker shell nuggets and rhyolite. Uh, wire and findings also from you. Be making today instead of mowing. Better do the grass soon, else I'll be losing the dogs in the jungle. Yeah. Ooh. Do you know, do you know, Joe, you're number 857, that's gorgeous. I did it a couple of days ago <clears throat> and I've never suffered with hay fever. I had the most horrendous hay fever that day. Did you? I've, yeah, I've never had it. Adam's just said the same. He's been, he's been struggling with it and he doesn't oh. normally get it. Well, touch wood, I never, I've never had it. It must be a particular type of pollen. Must be, must there be. There you go. Amazing, Joe. Wow. Well done. Is this, last en this is the last entry today. This is number 858 from Sue. Please see my entry into the Wall of Fame. I saw Debbie Kershaw's spiral technique on a show last month. I've used pearl nuggets, crackled quartz, and some gorgeous smoky opal silver lined wow. alabaster seed beads. Really pleased with the result. Many thanks for the inspiration, Debs. All materials from JM. Best wishes to all. And that's from lovely Sue, number 858. Lovely nose. Good luck, everybody, in the draw this Wednesday. Well, so there's still time to send them in, isn't amazing. there, Mark? Absolutely. Shall I take those out your way? Yes. There you go. Um, because you've Gosh. got a, um, a lovely hour coming your way with demonstrations. Now, well. Mark. Um, how many steps did you say this was? Oh, let me double check. I can't remember. This one is... Oh, yeah. How many? 36. Oh, just 36. <laughs> 36. Um, and I'm going to say this because I know our designers don't. I know Mark definitely won't. But they take hours on mm. these on these. Especially for somebody as incompetent with technology as me. Well, you're clearly <laughs> not because look at oh, this. It's a, it, there's a lot of swearing involved. <laughs> And there's a lot of, is it copying and pasting yeah. and deleting and yeah. and templating and whatever that means and this sort of stuff. So, But a lot yeah. of time goes into these instructions that you get for free, jewellery makers. So absolutely amazing. And they're not just one sheet. You've got, what, 30, oh, sorry, mm. 36 steps. Mm. And this, I love this. Well, I thought I can't... Alha I Cadabra. Al Alha Cadabra. Well, I thought I can't call it the Alhambra, but I thought I like the Alhambra look. So I thought, what? And so I went on the dictionary and put Al. You know, I thought. See what came up. And there, and this Alha Cadabra. So I think I've coined mean? coined that. Well, it's abracadabra, as in the magic word yeah. abracadabra. So I thought it looked sort of magical, and then I thought, how can I incorporate Alha Alhambra? Yes. So Alhambra Cadabra. I thought Alhambra Cadabra. That Love might it. have been better actually. Love it. Alhambra Cadabra, not. 
old hack. It's quite hard to say, isn't it? We know what you mean, Mark. You know what I mean. We know what you mean, yeah. and that's absolutely beautiful. So you get this for free. These projects are flying on pre-order, and I'm not surprised. You have a choice of three, or all three. It's entirely up to yes. you. Um, just wow. I mean, Taipei Burmese Jade Apple. We did mention earlier on, particularly if you were to look at Mark's Amethyst project. Um, which features this uh, silver plated components. Um, we've done sort of, like you said, the Alhambra inspiration mm. before, but this is that with a twist, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And we mentioned that it's actually more Louis Vuitton. I'm intrigued. Do you want to see the Louis Vuitton mm. piece? Mm. Okay, because the Louis Vuitton is very similar, only maybe a little bit more sort of pointed. Oh, uh, yes. Do you see where we're coming from? Yes, because this is the... Isn't there a symbol like this on their luggage? Yes. A little diamond as well as all the other things. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, on their oh, like yeah, luggage. To be fair, um, I had no idea Louis Vuitton did um, jewellery. I thought it was all bags and luggage. Yeah. No, they do oh, jewellery and right. it's very expensive. Do you want to know how much the, um, the kind of Alhambra long line necklace version of Louis Vuitton is? Mm -hmm. um, it's actually more expensive. Louis Vuitton's is more expensive, isn't that right, Ross? Thirty-one and a half thousand pounds. <gasps> what? Yeah. Thirty-one oh and a half thousand pounds. It doesn't feature Type A red jadeite, by the way. Not red jadeite. Amazonite. Oh, it's Amaz Amazonite. It's Amazonite. Oh, you said Amazonite was Amazonite going to be the big thing this year, didn't you? Mm-hmm. Wow. Um, Thirty-one and a half thousand pounds. You said earlier on that's a very nice car. That's an that's, even nicer car. That's a very, very nice very car. Very nice car. Yeah. Okay. Now, just so you know, heads up. Limited on the jade kits. Is that right? Seventy of each, and then we have a oh. hundred of the amethyst. But people are shopping ahead on all of these. I'm not surprised at all, Mark. Mm. Um. I'm going to start with the black jade. Talk us through, like I said, it all started here, Mark, but then it kind of manifested, didn't it? Well, the the main um, idea with these kits were the double stopper beads. Yeah. Okay, which enable you to do your slider bracelets or your slider um, necklaces, which is why they put the long length of chain in. So you can, A, you can decide on the length of your necklace, and then you can decide if you wanted to do two tassel drops, whether you wanted to, to end with a gemstone and it's all about adjustability and I thought okay I've never done anything like I've never had this before so I thought why well, I, I like cutting things up as you know mm. so that's so I cut the um, the chain into different lengths and then came up with the necklace so I made the little Alhambra sections and I thought well I can't just attach those so then you incorporate the gemstones at the top and bottom and then you have to explore the lengths. And then I thought, well, do I just leave the ends with the gemstone? I thought, no, I need the weight. So I added more. So it sort of came about as I was... It grew. Yeah. It, it, I love it, it that. Completely. Completely different as I wanted it to look. But I'm, I'm really pleased with and those And those out. slider mechanisms are not the same as a slider that we've done previously before, where it's one, where it's one circle. They're kind of um, like twins, aren't they? Yes, that's right. Beautiful. So, they're, so they're two spacer. In my, for me, they, the way they look are two spacer beads soldered together. Yeah. And then inside each of those halves, there's a silicon um, slider, one in each. So it enables you to slide up and down, choose the length. Um, I can, we talk about wearing these down the back, don't we? Yes. Of the of a long slinky dress or something like that. And, so um, beautiful, Mark. I love this the amethyst one with the. I love the earrings with the, I've put. I've used some of the chain to make the tassels on the end of the. Just love those. They're absolutely yeah. stunning, and and the fact that they right yeah, it eliminate or eradicates I should say more um the need for soldering capabilities. Yeah, so you don't no need clasps, to be a silversmith. No, no, no clasps. So I've used the chain as nature intended with the projects, and then I've the two bracelets I've used S long cord. Oh yes, here. Yeah, that's yeah, what we, yeah, we were just so that's showing. That's Eslon. So um, in my little VT, I said I've made some little um, friendship bracelets as well using. I love them. Those toggles. Yeah. So gorgeous, yeah. aren't they? Yeah. Um, now we're going to start with arguably one of the rare. Oh, arguably, is that really an argument? It takes three times longer than any other colour of jade no. to form in black. 
Um, so many people do say that black jadeite is the rarest of all. It certainly forms in much smaller sizes. Um, we're going to bring you jewelry makers type A black jadeite in its natural form. It's beautiful. It's Guatemalan black jadeite. Is okay. that a thing, is it? Yeah, but it's rare. Oh, I, know. Rare, I didn't know you rare, could rare. get black in well, Guatemala. Yeah. I thought it was all um, Olmec. Very, very, very oh, rare. Right. Okay, jewellery makers. Oh, no. Oh, he no. Says, <laughs> even Ross is saying the price that we, we, we've got set for this is very, very, very low. Now, you don't just get the 38 centimetre strand, which is natural black Guatemalan jade. Look at that. Um, wow. When you think about it also, the Burmese black jade, or the Burmese jade at mine is closed. Yeah? Mm. Full stop. Guatemalan jade eye is closed. Is closed because they found that mask. Yes, haven't they? And we don't know when, if even they might it's find gonna something reopen. else. Or, exactly. Yeah. Right. So we cannot replenish our our jade eye opportunity, our Guatemalan jade eye opportunities. Not only that. Okay, hang on. I've got to be careful here, haven't I? I love this chain. It's a stunning quality of chain. Yeah. You have. A meter, I'm gonna put this over the back of my hand first, use both hands so I don't knot it. A meter of silky. And I've used 0.4 wire to do the links and I've also used featherweight head pins as well. So the link's large enough to do all your ad your additions and things. You get five of those. Five of the sliders, which have got yep. the silica in the and center. And if you want to, I didn't do it, but I've looked into it and I think you can. You can if you use your flush cutter pliers, you can separate them. Can you? Mm. So you could turn it into one single if yeah. you prefer. Yeah. So if I tip them out for a second, because then you can actually see, um, they're in they're pairs beautiful. effectively, aren't they? I think they're stardust as well, aren't they? Yeah. Can you see that? Yeah, they're beautiful. <laughs> they're lovely, aren't they? Absolutely. Ingenious. Very clever. Sliders are ingenious. Okay. Let's half that price for the jadeite alone, particularly the fact that it is actually Guatemalan jadeite too, um, at four hundred and ninety nine pounds for the jadeite alone. Plus, you get the thirty four step instruction mm. booklet on that beautiful Alha Cadabra necklace. <laughs> I should have called it Alhambra Cadabra. That is so much easier to say. <laughs> you like to keep me on my toes, Mark. That's the thing. Four nine nine. Still not your price, jewelry makers. Still going even lower. Look at the quality of that black that black jadeite. Wherever the location, whether it's whether it's uh, Burmese, whether it's Guatemalan, whether it's uh, Kotan. You know, you are talking high prices for any of these locations. For the strand alone at 149, that's absolutely amazing. But it's not your closing price. This does come with the sterling silver. So that's a meter of your sterling silver chain. Five, did we say, yeah, yeah. Um, of your, well, how are we describing Double those? Double stoppers. Double stoppers, yeah, there yeah, you go. Yeah. And you get the instructions, and we're going lower. Can I just say a personal thank you to Ross for doing split pay on kits? Because oh. I just think it makes them so much more accessible, and yeah, you know, and Especially we, we do put a lot of, of, of time in the in the projects and things. Yes. So, so it's really nice that people get them home to enjoy them. Yeah, and it's not a case of mm. Mark that, that you know people have to wait until they've paid all those payments. No, you no, know, no, it literally no. will arrive with the free postage and packaging as well. Of course, it will yeah. arrive in in a matter of days. Um, yeah, I agree, and it's not percent interest. You haven't got to pay mm. a charge for it. Today you can get the whole project for ninety nine <laughs> ninety nine. 
with your split pay as well. There are only 70 available. Jade collectors absolutely would be going crazy for this. Remember, the Guatemalan mine, we're not saying it's deplete. It's not deplete. In fact, it, it wasn't so long ago, actually, until the pretty much the bulk of the Chinese jade mining operation relocated to Guatemala because it was the Burmese mine closed. However, they discovered a Mayan mask. And I think that's, you yeah. know, okay, right, really? So has that stopped everything? Yeah. Because it's a fairly huge, huge uh, um, historic event. You know, we know very little about the ancient Mayan people. So who knows if, when um, the Guatemalan jade uh, pieces will be, uh, or, or, or Guatemalan jade pieces will start being mined again, if they will. There we go. Here's the article. Archaeologists discover 1,700-year-old jade mask inside the tomb of a Mayan king. Located in Guatemala, the tomb also um, held rare uh, mollusk shells, carvings, and other funeral offerings. And you can see the date there, February 2024. So that's when it all stopped. Literally, it all stopped. So we cannot replace your black jadeite Guatemalan offerings. We can't replace any Guatemalan offerings at the moment. Um, GIA even uh, um, oh. spoke about it, the blackish green omphacite jade from Guatemala. Um, I mean, yours is almost entirely black, not blackish. Blackish green omphacite jade from Guatemala. They go on to say, in recent years, a new kind of Guatemalan jade has entered the Chinese jewelry market. Um, uh, please don't expect me to pronounce that. Um, <laughs> Um, prior to the availability, um, Chinese consumers have uh, had a negative impression of Guatemalan material and prefer Burmese jade. However, the recent emergence of this, uh, of this new high quality blackish green jade has attracted the attention of Chinese buyer. And remember Stanley Chu, who um, has Ilya, um, which that's what his business is. His whole family's legacy is in jade. He says the future is Guatemala, doesn't he? Um, it, the future is Guatemala, A, because the offerings and the availability of it when it is in operation, but also the quality that is coming from. Um, Fei Chi, he mentioned Fei Chi, mm. didn't he? Top water jade. Uh, Wendy, California, Christine, Denise, Angela, Amanda, Swansea, Elaine, Zara, Angela, London, another London, Cheshire, Celia, Lanarkshire, you're there as well. Telephone callers. A lot of Chinese jade miners are now mining in Central America. Um, um, or rather they were. Uh, this has the greatest potential of all jade currently. The future is Guatemala. These are Stanley's words. Um, the acceptance is now certified here in Asia as it is also listed as Fei Chi, which you just heard in the last uh, GIA article, um, which was historically reserved exclusively only for Burma. However, this conversation was pre-February. Pre-February, because the mine is closed. After everything that we have just mentioned, jury makers, for natural type A, Fei Chi, Guatemalan, black jadeite, for a meter of sterling silver, for five of wow. your double stoppers. bead stoppers, yep. all in 925, we are going lower. Everybody pays the final low, remember? We're not stopping there. When it's mm. irreplaceable. Yeah. And it's not our, us just saying that, it's the GIA saying that. It's big articles saying, okay, we've, we've discovered an ancient Mayan mask, 1,700 years old. And um, I don't know many archeologists, in fact, I don't think I know any, but I should imagine they work fast. <laughs> I shouldn't imagine they do. 79 pounds and 99 pence only. When wow. it is still, it has the same, qualifications now for want of a better description as your Burmese jadeite you know they're referring to particularly this new variety this is of, of, of which this is that ilk um, where you have that phagey opposite um, crystal structure and color well done everybody Tina, Lowes, Lucy, Rupal, Sally, London, Wendy, Kerry, Denise I've got Sheila, Kirsty in Australia, Australia, sorry, I can't, uh, Celia, keep up, I can't keep up with you. Um, we only had 70, so wow. again, make sure you're checking out your baskets. Um, we're going to get dive into our demonstration. You can shop ahead on the Taipei Burmese Green Jade Eye, and you can shop ahead on your, um, on your Amethyst as well. So, over to you, Mark. Right, so I'm going to show the, the Louis Vuitton, I'm going to call it that now. You should. The Louis Vuitton motif. It's really, 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 really simple as well. 
So you need four of your jump stones. Now all three kits have got your six mil rounds. So it's exactly the same technique on all of them, which is the, whichever kit you decide to go for. I've got size 10 needle and again, a couple of feet of your fire line or your wildfire. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to pick up four of our gemstones. We're not going to put any sea beads in between. It's straightforward four of our rounds. Slide them down, leave a tail of six or so inches just so you've got something to tie your motif together with. So a single knot and a double knot. That will make it nice and secure. Okay, and then the first thing we're going to do is we're going to sew away from the knot, so sew through a gemstone. And then what we're going to do is you need two sizes of your seed beads. You need an 8-0 an and an 11-0. So I've gone for the silver. This would look equally nice in gold. The reason I went for silver is you get the sliders, stoppers in silver. So we're going to fill the gaps in the four gemstones with an 8-0 to start. So I'm just going to fill the gap. And the reason that I put the 8 O's in after I've secured the loop of gemstones is it's quite difficult to get in okay. um, with your needle and you get this sort of you can you see that the eight toes are slightly sticking out from the gemstones which will make your beading a lot easier or oh, is that what co what creates that point yeah yeah okay so we're just going to go round and exit one of the eight toes so what we're going to do next is we're going to so around, it's very similar to Kiss Cross, the starter Kiss Cross, we're going to sew around the gemstones with arcs. And the arc is going to consist of three 11 O's, one 8 O, and three 11 O's. So we're going to sew round into the next 8 O. And we're going to do this all the way around. So as I said, it's not a difficult motif. One, two, so it's three elevens, one eight, three elevens into the next. And you see that fills the outside of the gemstones really nicely. And you can already see you've got that point because you've got that eight O. So three, one, three, around into the next eight. And then we're going to sew around and fill in that last gap. So one, two, three, and then an eight, and one, two, three of your 11s. I'm gonna go round and sew into the eight. Okay, so if you wanted to, you could stop there because the, the, this, because they're a six mil round, those seed beads are gonna sit perfectly well, but okay. I wanted to have a, a deeper surround. So you're going to repeat exactly what I've just done with those arcs, but we're going to repeat it again. So three, one, three, I'm going to sew round into the next eight. So those two sections, can you see, sit side by side. You can, you can separate them if you wanted to. So we'll do the next one. So one, two, three, then an eight, one, two, three. So we're going to continue with that all the way around. And then three, one, two, three. One eight, one two three. Into the next eight, and then our last. So one two three, and an eight, one two three. So we're going to sew into that eight, and we're going to come up in the middle of those two rows we've made. Now for this design, I didn't want them to be open like that. I wanted to close them. So all I've done is I've taken the, I'm going to work on the front row of the two. I'm going to sew up through the 11s, exit the eight, and I'm going to do a bit of right angled weave. So I'm going to go across to the second eight o on the first row that we did, sew down it, and then back up through the first, the first eight o. So you can now see that those are now nicely bound together. So I'm going to continue all the way around binding those if you want to bring the next kit. Okay, and we can we'll, do that. And then we'll finish. We, we can do that. Um, in okay. terms of availability on the black jadeite, okay, wow. we've got about the final third, isn't it, basically? Uh, third of the stock remaining. 
Now on to the next project. This one is all about the green jade eye. So if that is your preference, you get that same beautiful. We've kind of overlooked this, Mark, the quality of this yeah. chain. And I know you were talking about it quite no, a lot. It's, it's beautiful. I mean, look, that necklace yeah. is absolutely gorgeous. And as I said, I've used, I've used 0.4 wire and featherweight head pins. So you, and it's easy to do wrap loops and rosary linking with the ends of the chain. Because if it was any any finer, we'd have a few issues. But yeah. but as, as you've seen, I've made so many links and joined them together How and all sorts of things. Is. That's stunning, Mark. Absolutely stunning. Do you know what that reminds me of? Like a sage leaf. Oh yes, it does actually. Because you know, you've got like yeah. a silveriness yeah. as well. Yeah. Um, so beautiful. Now you get a meter long length of the chain. Um, then you get that same collection, jewellery makers, of your double stoppers, double stoppers, um, of which you get five. Yes, that's right. And then you get this absolutely beautiful, very translucent type A jadeite six millimetre strand. Yeah, the quality of this is amazing. Um, you know it's fantastic when even the director has got a reaction. <laughs> Not to say even, that's the wrong word, isn't it? Sorry, Ad. <laughs> Sorry. No, I didn't mean to sound like that, but like Adam was very vocal about the quality yeah. of this then, yeah. wasn't he? Yeah, yeah. Oh, he's like, the quality of this is amazing. Honestly, the translucency is absolutely beautiful. Um, so, have I got 70 of these, did you say? That's incredible. Look at that grade. We're not going to dilly dally. We're not going to mess around, Mark. Okay. First price crash. Straight under one hundred pounds. Wow. We're not done there though. But again, I look. Never mind comparing with first dibs and Mason and Kay and Christie Sotheby's and Bonhams. Look, comparing with ourselves three years ago, this tram would have been. It wouldn't have been ninety nine ninety nine. And then, um, we're further on from the mine's closure. Two thousand and twenty, the mine closed after hundreds and hundreds of years. Eight hundred years of mining. Now, jewellery makers, we've got 70. Let's not overlook the fact you've also got the sterling silver meter long length chain too. And these are all sterling silver as well. What? Right, 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 right. Oh, How much do you think for the sterling silver meter chain? Because it's a different chain to what we normally have. It's kind of silky. Diamond cut, definitely. What do you reckon? I think twenty pounds. Yeah, yeah. About twenty pounds. The bead stoppers on their own, Mark, are about five pounds each. Mm. Five, mm. yeah, twenty-five pounds. So we're saying forty-five pounds for the for the silver, and then twenty-five pounds <laughs> for a Type A jadeite strand. No. When you break it down like that, seriously, because mm. I've brought those individually, Mark. Mm. Five pound each, that's amazing. 25 pounds to get that quantity, 20 pounds for the metre long length, and then 25 quid for the type A Burmese jade. It says no one ever. Oh, says no. nobody ever. That's true, and free postage and packaging. What on earth? Absolutely amazing value. Linda, Kim, Lanarkshire, Lucy, Manchester, Angela, Kirsty in, in Australia, Angela in Surrey, Zara in London, Oxfordshire, Tina in Northampton, Denise in Surrey, uh, Sarah in County Armagh, Victoria in Nottinghamshire, Susan in Essex, Sarah in Yorkshire, Maker in Yorkshire. There are loads of you getting involved. £23.33 pence on your split pay. What a deal on high-end gemstones. Yeah. Unbelievable. Keep on dialing through, lovely jewellery makers. Sarah, I promise our call centre will get to you. Hello, Florence. Hello to you, Barbara, as well. Uh, Florence wow. has checked out straight That's away, amazing. not leaving anything to chance. What a deal. That's an unbelievable deal. That's one of the deals of the day. That's amazing. It is, though. Oh. I mean, seriously, that necklace, if you were selling that necklace for anything less than, what do you reckon, jewellery makers? Two, three hundred? Wow. And I'm being conservative there. So all I've done with this one is I've taken the bottom stone on yeah. a featherweight head pin and then wrapped, did a, well, in effect, a rosary link on the bottom link of the chain. Mm. And then all of the other little bubbles, there are 15 in each side altogether. Mm. And I've, I've, so I've um, wrapped into a link, Mr. Link, into a link, Mr. Link. Wow. So, so I'm alternating between the links. And that's what gives links. you that kind of and that sage gives you leaf. That, yeah, and that gives you that sort of two inch 
bubble Beautiful. drop. Beautiful. They're really cool. Back to you. Okay. So, as you can see, because we've joined the ATOs together, it gives it a really nice solid frame all the way around. Okay. So, the final piece, this is what gives it that Louis Vuitton, I'm going to use that, that Louis Vuitton look. Okay. Is I'm exiting through this 8.0 on the left hand side of the two. So I'm going to sew through the 3.11s of the next section and I'm going to sew through. Can you see that middle 8.0 in yeah. between the frames? So I'm just going to sew through, making sure that I don't sew through any, any other seed beads. I'm just going to just do a bit of a, a wiggle. There we go. Let's just unhook from that thread. There we go. Okay, so you can see now I'm, I'm exiting through that 8 in the middle there, away from me. So to get that little extra pointed look, this is so simple. I feel a bit of a, a con merchant here because it honestly is so easy. All I'm doing... Not at all, if it works. ...is I'm going from 313... 313. ...to 414. That's all I'm doing, just adding one extra 11 either side of that 8 i going to jump all the way over into that next middle 8 -o. give a little wiggle so then when you pull the needle and get it straight can you see then if <gasps> i lay it down and because it becomes louis vuitton it becomes louis vuitton and because you've got that frame that is now trapped it can't move left or right yeah. it's it's snuggled nice and neatly in and then all you're going to do then is repeat so one two three four and an eight one two three four and I'm going to jump over into the next middle eight. Pull nice and tight, give it a wiggle so it sits. It's locked, it, it can't go anywhere now. So you get that really nice little- I love that look. Lock. It's, honestly, it's amazing. So if you, you can just make lots of these. And then the way that I've linked these to the chain is because I've got an 8-0 mm. at either end of your diamond, you see the pointed end is a diamond. All you do is you treat that and you take your rosary link through and attach it as though it was a gemstone. Wow. So you just, just use it to um, attach your links to. It's perfect. Let's do the last one. So one, two, three, four, then an eight, and then one, two, three, four, and then we're going to go through into that eight o. Give it a wiggle, pull it through. I, I got caught in the thread there. We've got the amethyst still to play. Yeah, we can just, do let that. Me just, I'll just reverse a bit because I want to show you what it looks like. Shall we do the amethyst? Now again, these are slightly different. I've been looking forward to this all day. This yeah, I, I, yeah. Lo I love this. And I love the fact that, you know, whatever your budget, everybody can I get think, involved. I think this is going to shock everyone. Really? I've got no clue. Don't you? No. So it's a longer length of chain, this. Two metres, this one. Two metres? Yep. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to hold it all. Uh-oh. <laughs> That's me rushing luck. I tell you what, hang on. I tell you what. You get two metres and I will do this. There you go. Two metres of your chain. It's a lot, isn't it? And double stoppers again. But these are smaller and you get 10 of them. You get 10. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you get 10 yep. of them. And you get, where has it been? Our beautiful, beautiful yeah. amethyst it's in that stunning. chocolate box purple. Yeah. It is gorgeous. Oh, yeah. look at that. Oh. Beautiful. Amazing color. You know, sometimes when you look at amethyst on our recordings, it sometimes looks like quad A. <laughs> It sometimes looks like quality tans night because it's that like mm. deep. Yep. Um, okay. 30 seconds. Nowhere wow. near your price. Let me just quickly show you this then. So that's the motif made. So all you do then is you is you tie off, make lots of them, and as I said, if you if you treat the uh, the outside points to the Eurosary links to attach it to your chain. I love it's it. Lovely. I'm glad it's got that. It's got it's got a name. That we'll, we'll, we'll call it the. Call it the Louis. Yeah, the Louis. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Should we call it the Louis? Or the Vuitton. Or the Vuitton. Would you prefer Vuitton, that? Vuitton. Yeah. Vuitton. Vuitton. Yeah. <laughs> you could the Vuitton necklace. Look at this price. Look. 
Wow. <laughs> so for the chain on its own. And let's oh. not forget. Oh, and this. You 36. get the instructions too. 36 steps. Um, wait, so wait, in, wait, the, wait, um, wait. in the instructions, I show you how to thread your cord and your chain through the stoppers using a little bit of wire. I show you how to um, make the, this is another version of the Alhambra. We show you how to attach these and how to attach it to your chain. Mm -hmm. So everything's included. All included. Yeah. So using, because you get this with the Amethyst as well, you can incorporate the design I've just shown you yeah. with the Louis Vuitton version with this using those connectors. I love it. I absolutely love that. So hang on, Ross, how much are those double stopper beads? Okay, they're about five pound each. At this price, they're two pound fifty and everything else for free. <laughs> yeah. Uh, two pound fifty for your double stoppers. Oh no, look. And then everything else for free. Um, okay, two thirds of the stock gone. You said um, we were going out with a bang, didn't we? We did, we did, yeah. there's loads of you there. Yeah. Please wait on the phone lines, don't abandon your call. It is oh, no. a guaranteed sellout, that's for sure. Jeanette, if you want 10, you need to be properly speedy. Properly speedy, I've only got oh, no. 17 left. Really? We have a surprise auction, given how quickly this sold out. Wow. Okay. Okay. Is it gone? Um, yeah. <gasps> no. There's six. There's 176 people have that in their baskets. Now, who loves the bead stoppers? The double bead stoppers? Have you seen that? It's that screen. That is one of the fastest selling kits. I, th I agree, yeah. Should we do a finale? I've got the disco. Wow. That's taking me back a bit. I know. We've got these two, Mark. This is which, this was my first introduction to these I've double I've never stoppers. seen them before, the doubles. I've seen the singles before. Very clever. Yeah. Yeah. So we'll do the spiral one next, but we're going to start <sighs> with the discos. Can you see those? There you go. So there's, there is, what what you don't see is actually um, the silica in the centre. That's, and that's right. what yeah, grips yeah. it, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. And you can get 0.8 wire through the hole. Because in the, in the tutorial, I'll show you how to use a piece of 0.4 doubled yeah. in half yeah. to go through the, oh, okay. so it takes a 0.8, so they're really good. And obviously you can get your, your S-long cords through as well. Any needles, I suppose. Yep. Yep. Leathers, possibly. Um, okay, now we're starting with this one, and then I'll bring you this one in a few moments. It is 925 sterling silver. We are under five pounds, and we're going again. Well, the money you've saved in the kits, grab some of these because, yeah. it, as I said, in the instructional booklet, which you've already got now, I show you how to use them and how to put your cords through, how to put Perfect. your chains through. So, But you don't yeah. have to be a silversmith now, do you? No. no. You know, as long as you've got sort of your stoppers, um, <clears throat> you don't need to have silversmith. And sometimes you might be a silversmith and you might be thinking, I just can't be bothered. They look beautiful. It creates like a lovely yeah. lariat style. Yeah. But they're 925 oh. silver. Look how they look on those two bracelets. Yeah, so gorgeous. They're so, are. yeah. They're, they're well, so these lovely. ones, yeah. I love these, Mark. Yeah. Absolutely yeah. love yeah. these. So Absolutely. you could mix them up, couldn't Absolutely. you? You could have some yeah, of the yeah. disco yeah. facets, some with the more um, swirl. Um, amazing. How many have we got, oh. Roscoe? Oh, we wow. got quantity. We need that quantity, though. Look at all the yeah, multi buyers. Yeah. Mary and Jerry says, I'll have five. Thank you very much, Ross. You can make your own slider bracelets with these, you see. Yeah. Really. And you've got all the chain you've just bought in your kits. There is wow. a queue on the phone lines, but I tell you what, as you're there. I love the spiral one. Two birds and all that. Yeah, yeah. It's lovely, this. Two birds and all that. This is, do you know, do you know, like, um, uh, oh, it's like an illusion when you spin something and it looks oh, like yeah, yeah, it, yeah. They, that's what they yeah. are, aren't they? Amazing. Guess what? Free potion packaging. We've only got a hundred of this one though. This one's been very I popular. Love that. You can just see the silicon look. Yeah. Just if, you, if you notice, if, if when you get them, if the silicon pops out, or while you're threading your cords through, they just pop back up again. Just push them in. Yeah. Or just push them back up again. Yeah. yeah. They're it's ingenious. We're going to match the price, Mark. Are we? You should. We, I, I imagine these should be more expensive because they're diamond cut, but hey ho. 
Mm. Um, that's not how we roll here at Jewelry Maker. Three ninety nine. There's only a hundred of these though. If you're on the in the phone lines um, for the last auction, you can add them. Both the codes on your screens um, helping you out all the way, Jewelry Makers. Um, wow. Make sure you stock up your stashes. These are quite new actually. I, I, okay, they've sold out. Right. Okay. So oh, it's all no. about the discos now. You can still get the discos. Wow. Now, coming up tomorrow, Jewelry Makers, I'm gonna be joined by the lovely Alison. Oh. Um, eight o'clock, last to stock, Jadeite opportunities. So you're gonna come back yourself some amazing bargains of collectible gemstones. Nine o'clock, we have beautiful jade carvings with our lovely Alison as well. Um, 10 o'clock is the launch of your brand new quartzite jade with Dave. That was meant to be today, but we've swapped it around and actually it's worked perfectly. Mm, yeah. um, 11 o'clock then is all about your jewelry maker essentials, your silver essentials. Oh, so stock up on those. Um, and then 12 o'clock, we have your jade out mala projects with Alison. That is Guatemalan as well. So. Keep on dialing through on the disco balls. I've only got disco balls. Um, I've only got 40 of them left. Um, hold those phone lines. Don't abandon your calls. Free post and packaging also continues tomorrow. Amazing. Mark, when you're back. I'm next, next Sunday with Ocean Agate. Ooh, Brand new Ocean Agate. Nice. Yes. Yes. Definitely be tuning in. Oh, we amazing. love you, Mark. It's been amazing. Thank show you today. for Thank all you. of your knowledge and inspiration, Pleasure. as always. Pleasure. I'll see you bright and early in the morning, jewelry makers. Enjoy the sunshine. <laughs> Thank you.